everyone. Good morning. We've How had one of those mornings. We came in and we've, we've spent half an hour talking about lagging the loft. Yes, we have. It's been really good and, and really uh, entertaining. And, and how... And loft hatches. And, loft hatch. <laughs> and by full doors. We've had a real good DIY morning, haven't we, today? It's been nice. And I basically yeah. said these words. I think I need to get out more. Yeah. No, 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 no. Basically, nothing better than lagging lofts. Basically, uh, we're having our yeah. loft done. Um, and I was like, I'm really excited about it. Is that... Why is that, not? Is no, that... no, not at all. Because you can no. collect cleanse. No, you can no. get, like cleanse, yeah. put all the rubbish, all the junk that's been under beds Absolutely. and in, 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 the, in the shed, in the garage, cluttering it no. all up. That's brilliant. Oh, I'm excited. We live life here on the edge, don't we? we? It's a white knuckle ride behind so the scenes do. at JM. We're glamour <laughs> talking about loft boarding <laughs> and bifold doors. Yeah, absolutely. Amazing, oh. amazing. Yeah, because you've got your doors bifolded, haven't we you? We have. Yeah. And it, 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 I always it turns the outside into the inside. Yes. It turns it into another room. your living space. It certainly does. No, very lucky. It, I do yeah. find it funny yeah. though, because we had a lovely chap come round and quote us for our bifold doors, and he was ever so nice. And, um, he was then, and Tom's then, oh yeah, we might have one of those like, uh, um, you know, what are they call called? Awnings, we've got or an awning. They, oh. Yeah, it's amazing. And I'm thinking, Tom, you know, bifold doors are probably <laughs> going to cost enough. Like this. And he's like, oh, I'll send you a quote yeah. for that. And then, then we mentioned how our, far, our front door isn't particularly attractive. So we need a nice porch. So he's like, I'll send you oh. a quote for that. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> and the little porch <laughs> area, one thing at a time. Morning, Hello, lovely everyone. jewellery makers. Oh, it's Sunday. I know. And we've got a lovely Sunday. And the clocks have gone back. Yeah, did we you are now rid of summer. Yeah. We now head on into Christmas. How many bulbs did you plant last night? 725. Oh, 725. On top of the thousands that are already in the garden. What you can never you? have enough bulbs, you can never have enough. So what ones are already in the garden? Tulips and daffodils from, from years gone by. Oh, do you just leave yeah, them we in? Yeah, we leave them in. Yeah, if oh. they come up, they come up. If they don't, they don't. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, there you go. To. They tend to. I've got, yeah. That makes my two little boxes yeah. that I've got of tatar tape look fairly Can't insignificant. Beat so I think there's probably about 40. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you had about yeah, 725. Yeah. It's That's my favourite time of year because it's just the expectation then, yeah. isn't it, of waiting for the little the little shoots to come up and then, you know, spring's on its way and there's another year ahead of us. And I know. That's yeah, nice. That's, That's nice. You've it's been lovely. busy. You've yeah, been very, yeah, yeah. very busy. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, what's going on today? Well, let's start by talking about your 12 o'clock kits. Oh, no. Yes. I got a bit emotional about that post this morning, didn't I? Tell the story. Tell the story. So, so um, I'm not very good with social media, and I'm oh, very you are? well. I have a go. I mean, I'm not. I don't do TikTok or Instagram or anything like yeah. that. I can just about cope with Facebook. And um, so I put these videos and posts out about up and coming events coming up on the shows. And those of you who remember, a few weeks ago we introduced a, a, a kit of selenite. Do you yes. remember? Oh yes. I so I took this video of this necklace in the garden, and it got four thousand two hundred views, and I was absolutely astounded. Mm -hmm. so I, I remember you dropped me a message yeah. about it, didn't you? So beginning of last week, I put a little video of the necklace that we've got coming up at twelve o'clock using the mermaid quartz. Ten thousand four hundred views that video has had and I was so worried that I'd been hacked and all sorts of things so I got in touch with Emma who's currently with Hobby Maker in Glasgow <laughs> at a huge event panicking that I'd been hacked and she said no 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 you're just popular Aww. I thought, well, I thought well, what a lovely thing to say so thank you to everyone who's taken the time to look at that little video yeah, over 10,000 views. Uh, well, I'm not surprised, Mark. It is absolutely it's beautiful. beautiful. Absol well, I love this stone. And I've not had mermaid quartz since May the 7th, last year, birthday show. Oh, so, so, uh, so we've not had this since May no, the no, 7th. No, no, 18 months, isn't it? 18 months I've, since I've had this. Yeah, and it's, it's just, it's brilliant. And I always say, I'm not going to do another kiss cross. I'm not going to do another kiss cross. But as you can see, I've done three. Yeah, but but, they, but <laughs> they, they, they really compliment they the do. kiss cross. And they it's so beautiful. They absolutely do. No, they're gorgeous. I think it would be a crying yeah. shame when you stop doing kiss cross. Yeah, so the middle one is, is sort of a harlequin of all of the colours. That's lovely. And then I've done a pink version, and I've done, well, a hot version and a cold version, just showing the different, different colours. Beautiful. So back in stock. <laughs> Um, your mermaid Amazing. quartz and it's a big bundle as well that's ten happening strands. 10 strands yeah, yeah absolutely yeah. that's happening at 12 o'clock today mm -hmm. your deal of the day today quite this is unusual. old school it's lovely isn't yes it? yeah, yeah. It's unusual really nice. for us to have um deal of the days just like yeah. this because we are bringing you in all the colors i've got your earring oh, findings 
So they're an absolute must. And the reason why really we don't have dealer days like this very often, usually, well, I'll tell you, it's down to quantity. Mm, we yes, don't, we don't yes. have the quantity um, to justify the dealer of the day. Today, however, that is very different. As you can see, you've got them in all the three colors and you get oh, three beautiful. different designs. Um, I did go down, and um, Ross, I, I was gonna say to you earlier on this morning, so in preparation, you know, I prep for the show and I was like, okay, well, how do, how do I prep? How do I prep? Um, shepherd hooks hmm. because it's kind of like well everybody knows what a shepherd hook is yeah. you know we haven't got a do you know what I mean it's like okay so I was like okay let's look at the history of earrings mm. and I spent probably about an hour reading about the history of the earring um, that dates back to the bronze age you know and there was photographs of mummified bodies with their ears pierced and that nice. was the and I was like do I need to do this though? Because let's be honest, we all know what a, a yeah. shepherd hook is. Yeah. Um, and then I was like, okay, I'll just get some photos. And then I was like, I don't really need to do that either. Because no. you see no. the, the likes no, no. of Mark, I see your designs mm. on Wall of Fame. So this is really, so Ross, I didn't send you anything, did I, for the deal of the day? Because what can we? They speak for themselves, don't they? Exactly. They're so beautiful. And I thought, I'll just yeah. bore you. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, I'll just bore you if I start talking about. They are lovely. About the history of earrings. What's the difference between a drop and a dangle? Mm. Apparently there is a difference. Between a drop and a dangle? Yeah. Is it the length? Yeah, a dangle is just length? below the earlobe. Right. Oh, no. And, uh, and uh, sorry, a drop is just below the earlobe. Oh. All right, they're yawning in the gallery now. <laughs> a drop is just below the earlobe and a dangle is anything longer. I remember lovely Jenny Cleary used to call them shoulder dusters. Shoulder dusters? Yeah. Yeah, love yeah. that. Yeah. yeah, I always remember that. And they amazing. So those are coming up at uh, ten o'clock today. Amazing. Um, then you've also got. Can I also show you a big promo for this hour? Um, I've been eagerly waiting. Can you pass me the two black and white monochrome beauties? Um, They're yeah. weighty, aren't they? They are. Yeah. Type A jadeite. This is happening at nine o'clock. Ross has Ooh. been teasing us with this all week, um, threatening. Threatening is the wrong oh, word. Um, teasing. Teasing us um, with when we're going to actually bring these Oof. to air. Pure white type A and type A black jadeite. They are the piano what keys, aren't they? They're incredible, aren't they? Yeah, exquisite. They, first time being together, being brought together as a bundle. We're going to do a massive, massive deal on this jewelry makers. I have 46 at nine o'clock oh, today as they're well. They're rounds, not bicones. No. The black. Yeah. I know, we don't see faceted no. jade out very often, no. do we? Because no. of the, we know why, don't we? It's fairly obvious. This is one of the world's most valuable gemstones. So to actually cut facets off makes a big difference. I like um, the, uh, the sparkle on the, on the backdrop. Can yeah. you see underneath the, the strands? Like, the reflection. It's like, it's like rain, isn't it? The reflection of those. Yeah. Amazing. Um, you've also got, this is uh, um, your kits, your nine o'clock kits. Let's talk about those. because Kumahimo. These... Now, you, you laughed yes. at me, didn't you, uh, when we did, uh, when was our show? Tuesday? Monday or Tuesday? And I said I was going to show you how to make spark plugs with Kumahimo. Do you remember? And you said, what? Oh yes, I yes, do. So, um, yeah, so we've got spark plugs. I'm going to show you how to make spark plugs. Spark plugs? It's, it's graduated beaded kumahimo, but okay. I, I just think spark plugs. And when you, when you see the necklaces, they look like spark plugs that you get in a car engine, don't they? Oh, Can I you see, see what, what I mean. mean. Yes. yes. It's I not mean, the most romantic of names. No, not at all. <laughs> but they look like spark plugs. Yeah. And I've actually downloaded some pictures of spark plugs that we can bring to air if you like. Uh, have you really? <laughs> <laughs> there Talk was about the nerdy. You find inspiration in every single yeah, facet of I've life. I've always called them spark plugs. It's there the you first. go. So um, they've actually got that. They actually feature on a DVD from years ago, and we called them spark plug. Kuma Did Himo. you? Yeah. Going way back yeah. when. Yeah. Right. Am I right yeah. in saying? Yeah. One of your DVD codes was S X. It was S E X C something so it was sexy something. yeah it did sound it, like yeah, that it was a bit rude yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and in these kits you get three sizes of seed beads so you get 11s eights and sixes which we never get and you get this incredible bundle of kumahimo bell cap endings yeah in different varieties we've never had this bundle on air before so just buy it for the kumahimo bell caps and the endings in my opinion absolutely yeah. and they do you do get yeah. three tubes of your seed beads gorgeous. as well which is yep. amazing yeah um, we're also, Jewelry Maker's going to give you um, a last opportunity on your advent know, calendar. I know. And last opportunities on this amazing storage bag yes. that Mark, we launched together. Yeah. Well, um, well, we'll talk in detail when we get to the advent calendar, but on the advent calendar, you know the guest designers are doing little um, yes. make-alongs afterwards. I'm doing five. Are you? Including Christmas Eve. So it's basically, you know, we're extending our hours, aren't we, in yeah, the month yeah. of December. We are, certainly are. One, I'm so excited. Uh, make-along. Well. 
yeah. and we were saying each of those drawers each of those drawers in that advent calendar worked out to four pound 16 each yeah. when you consider the components mm. uh, but really four pound 16 for your extra hour I know. That on its own, and, do you know and then what you're we've getting got everything on Christmas else. Eve. No. Don't don't look at us. Don't don't put the camera on us because it's going to be a surprise. Okay. I just want to show. Is it? Yeah. No. Uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I've got that on Christmas Eve. Have you? Oh my goodness! Yeah. You need to be with us Christmas Eve. I, I'm so excited about working Christmas Eve because I. Be good. Dare I say it? I like Christmas Eve as much as I like Christmas Day. And I've got a Christmas waistcoat and dicky bow combo. Right, I'll just make for sure. Christmas Eve. I will make sure I dress up okay. all festive. I'll yeah, get a Christmas right. dress. Okay. Especially for the Can't occasion. Wait. Um, it's gonna be amazing. Oh, should we? Can we? Do, is it acceptable for us to do mulled wine on Christmas Eve? I think so. Bottle of prosecco at least. At least. Yeah. Why not? Prosecco, mince pie. I mean, technically, I don't think we're meant to, but you know, no, no. I'd stab at end of the desk. Non-alcoholic prosecco. Obviously. Obviously. Obviously, mm -hmm. like like non-alcoholic gins. I don't understand that. No. And they're just as expensive as the alcoholic versions. I really don't understand them at all. But I there suppose. We go. I suppose. I, you know, if you're expecting, then mm -hmm. there's a place yes. for that. But then, yeah. let's be honest. Have a glass of squash. Absolutely. Equally nice. Yes. <laughs> Equally nice. <laughs> That's what I did. I never had any non-alcoholic no. wine because I just no. th used to think, well, this is just cruel. You know, yeah. it's just teasing. There me. are some really nice non-alcoholic beers. Definitely go for a beer over wine. Yeah. Non-alcoholic wine isn't the nicest. Yeah. But, but there are some good beers. I remember Tom yeah. having a bit of a rant about that because we had a, um, I can't remember, a party. It well, wasn't a party, but a get together. Mm. And um, the following day, Tom was like, who brought the non-alcoholic beer and then drunk our alcoholic ah, and left beer? The non -alcoholic. <laughs> Who brought that? So I was like, I don't know, not sure. Perhaps it's perhaps it's good that we don't know. No, no, no. <laughs> right, shall we get cracking? You've also got some lovely storage jewelry boxes. I love, love these. These are stunning, aren't they? Stocking fillers, easy wrappable, Perfect. lovely box. Yeah, they're Your gorgeous. Little tra travel jewelry boxes. Um, you've got um, yeah. I mean, the, these like if you're going away for a weekend mm. or something like that, yeah. then you've got more of your beautiful These are genius clever aren't they yeah. clever and they're all nicely lined yeah. so that it's not going to damage <laughs> damage any of your jewelry um or components because yeah. you could Absolutely. use them for your yeah, jewelry yeah. making components yeah. as well we've got those in two different colors um, and we've got an oodles of amazing jade in today's show as well, so that's going to be absolutely fantastic. Shall we say hello to our lovely crew? We got gorgeous Chris. Hi. Here he is. Here he is. Ready? Hi, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> and we haven't yet got Gallery Cam, but we have got lovely Roscoe and Adam in the gallery. Hi. Thank you, Roscoe, for our <laughs> cup of coffee. You're yeah, my first ever anything from that certain well-known establishment. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. We can say Greg's, can't we? Can we? Do really good sausage rolls. Yeah. You need to try a yeah. Greg sausage roll, though. I think, I think it's something with the shift side because I've had my very first Greg's today. Yeah. And then you bought me my very first McDonald's breakfast I with did. that with that funny flat sausage yeah. thing. Yeah, McMuffin. Yeah, yeah. A McMuffin. I know. I, know. It's amazing. I tell you yeah. what, we are a cultured are. bunch. <laughs> <laughs> cultured. That's. What, I mean, I don't know if that's something I want you to advertise no, that we're introducing okay, you no. to such establishments. <laughs> <laughs> right, should we get cracking, Roscoe? Should, should we do it? Right. What would you like me to right. start with? Last of stock jadeite opportunities. Now, this is what I came in this morning, and do you know what I thought that looked like? What's that? A Ninja Teenage Mutant Turtle mask. <laughs> A what? <laughs> what do I say? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. That's the one. Yeah. yeah. And you'll know exactly what I mean when you look at that look. Oh yes, well now yes. you say it. Yeah. Now no, you say, say it. it, I can yeah. see that. It's Absolutely. Gorgeous, isn't it? It's also an infinity, yes. isn't it? So that never yes. ending <laughs> motif, so lots of symbolism there. Um, it is type A jade. Like, these are last of stock opportunities, jewelry makers. So if you are a collector of this rare, precious, beautiful gemstone, then make sure you're quick checking out your baskets. I'll tell you one thing I have noticed we haven't got. We haven't sorted out the iPad, have we? Um, my bad, uh, my bad, my bad. I normally ask for that. Um, again, so I, again, I was reading um, up about this, seeing if there's any more information that I can introduce to you. You're all fairly knowledgeable, well, very knowledgeable, I'm going to mm. say, um, about your gemstones in particular, um, jadeite, and you know, the article I was talking about referred to types, you know, type A, type B, type C, and the fact that. Um, of course, type A is the rarest, it is the most sought after because it is completely void of any treatment. Um, at £49.99, how many do we have of these then, Roscoe? 
10, oh. okay. I mean, you could lock said not either side, either couldn't side, you? Either side, really nice, simple little bracelet. It's lovely, isn't it? That'd be nice, put it oh. on, a, on a nice Solomon's bar. Yeah, perfect. Sliding on, incorporate it into mm. your kumihimo. Yeah, you could do actually. Yes, you could. Either because side, yeah, make a little because bracelet. that's an ancient technique yeah. as well, isn't it? Yeah. 19.99, but you've got 60 seconds wow. to secure it at this amazing price tag, jewellery makers. Make sure you're quick. It is not type B, it is not type C. Currently, here at Jewellery Maker, we do not have any type B or C. I do know our sister channel actually has got the type B really? variety. Yeah. Wow. Um, and we should expect that, so make hay while the sun shines. Absolutely. As they say. Um, beautiful, yes, you could use your pinch bales, you could lock said knot, you could macrame with this. It's, it's just a, mult, a plethora. Yeah. Gorgeous, of things that it? you could do. I love this shape. Really nice. Now I, all I can mm. see is a mask I know, now. I know. <laughs> <laughs> a little teenage. I used to yeah. like that though. Teenage Mutant yeah, Ninja Turtles. What was the yeah. rat called? Oh, um, Splinter. Splinter. Yeah. That's it. Splinter. Yeah. Speaking of rats, yeah. did you hear the story about um, Gemporia's MD? Did you hear this? I saw an arm wrestling. Okay. There's there's a, there is a story. Mm. So. <laughs> yes, yes, can I elaborate on that story? Sorry, because mm. I can't just leave it at that sentence. I'll have to be really quick, yeah. Um, so basically, they've been pranking him through the 19 days of Gempori's birthday, and um, his wife shared, shared a video, and, uh, and, and I was like, oh, it's been so funny. And he was like, you need to tell the social media manager about his fear of rats. And I was like, okay. So I did, I told her, I was like, he's got a really, he's frightened of rats. So they're like, ooh, right, we'll see if we can incorporate that. And we're thinking a toy rat, you know, something like no. that. They literally put two live rats on his desk, covered it over, and uh, yeah, Jake freaked. He absolutely oh freaked. It is brutal, isn't yes, it? It yeah. is brutal. No, uh, no. Uh, we, when we said we were talk thinking about a toy rat or something, like one of those ones that runs oh, yeah. across the screens. Oh, There's sorry, some... you're not condoning, I apologize. <laughs> So someone's pet rats they bought they were pets. pets he was okay pets, yeah. he was he was he was right. he, he was okay but he was like no 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 get them off the desk get them <laughs> off the desk but yeah keep an eye on Jen wow. Boris social media just made me think of that yeah um hands a hand you're right I think they're I think they're quite cute rats. They're very intelligent very yeah. very intelligent I think they? they're quite yeah, cute yeah. um okay hands a hand different meanings to the hands of hands and how you actually position it upright um is warding off evil spirits this way is abundance Seeking oh, abundance. I didn't know that. Um, now we've only got 30 available, says Ross. But we are going to clear all 30. We're going to do a brand new low price tag. Something that we have never, ever, ever done before. We'll crash that price tag and we'll give you one minute to secure it. One minute. Are you ready? I mean, look how beautiful that is. The hands are hand. I mean, obviously, there's huge amounts of history associated okay. um, of, across, um, obviously, cultures. But, um, you know, whether you wear it for, for as a fashion statement, whether you wear it for beliefs as well. 19.99, there are 30. Wow. It's never been that low before. You will need to be quick making sure you check out your baskets, yeah. everybody. And do remember, all the items that you might be seeing on the website are only there until nine o'clock. Um, so secure these whilst you get the chance. The reality is though, at these deals that we intend for this hour, um, it's gonna be more a case of the stock. So get them before they actually sell out. That's gorgeous, isn't it? I just had a really nice substantial little jump ring. Yeah. Maybe or even a twisted jump ring and then just on a simple call. That would be gorgeous. Perfect, wouldn't it? It's lovely. And and Jade has got lots of meaning and sense. It's quite to be quite uh, mm. thought to be quite protective, isn't mm. it? But yeah. not everybody will want the big, you know, master no. carvings. No. You know, this is something I think if I gifted it to my husband, mm. he'd definitely yeah, wear yeah, it. Yeah. On a bit of Absolutely. leather. You could yeah, do that nice. on leather. Yeah. Uh, Ross is saying, Yeah, I'd wear that. Yeah, around the neckline. Mm. Yeah. 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 It is simple, and of course you've got the meaning behind the hands of hand as well. Um, good morning, everybody. Shaolin, Deborah, hello to you, Jenny. Nice to see you all there. Get get your messages into the studio. Yes, We're going to have a super Sunday. Let us know what you're doing. Yeah. Oh, amazing. We have got some messages actually. Oh. Um, next up, oh. though, I'm going to bring you. Yes, the Type A yellow. Out, this is one of the rarest of colours. Um, good morning to.
There you oh, go. Amanda. Hello, hello Amanda. Uh, good morning, lovely JM team. So looking forward to the show whilst making for my five craft fairs in November. I need the mermaid court, she so says. So Amanda messaged me yesterday to say that she was going to watch, but she was going to be sitting on her hands. Oh, clearly she's already, clearly, she's she's clearly changed you've, mind. you've changed your mind, haven't you? Yeah, <laughs> Hello, I, I do that a lot. You have yeah. all good intentions. <laughs> and then like the show starts, then that's not going to happen, is it? It's not going to happen. Morning, Francis saying, morning, the sparkle of that black jadeite rivals diamonds. It Absolutely, does. it is Incredible. beautiful. Uh, morning, yeah. Francis. Get those messages in. Come and say hello to us. We'd love to hear from you. Um, one more message coming through from Caroline. Can Mark please please show how to join the ends of the kiss cross to create a 360 today please oh can you do that um, i guess I'd, you'd have to prep for that i'd have you? to i'd have to do a little section and i've not and it would have to be a big section to um, right to bend so it leave, leave it with me leave it with me i'm just trying to think in december if i can do it in december mm -hmm. in december right there you go caroline <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Why are we winking? Because of the advent. Oh, yes. 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 There you go. Caroline, watch this space. Yeah. And we will uh, recap yes. the advent too. Um, now, last of stock, Jadeite. This is your beautiful honey jade. Oh. Um, do I remember what happened? No. They used to be 49 oh, dollars Really? 49.99 you're getting a parcel of type a yellow jadeite which comes under the red umbrella um ross loaded them onto the web about a month ago and it was the wrong price we have 11 left we'll honor that price again just because there's only 11. um it is yeah there's such a lovely you, this is one of My your favorite favorites color. isn't it yeah, yeah i love it Love it comes it. under the red umbrella. What I mean by that is um, it, uh, it, it only occurs in this saturation if boulder oxidizes. Not every boulder does. And you are talking about small proportions, like millimetres of a boulder that will oxidize. Um, so it's rare to get a solid yellow or red uh, type A jadeite. We cannot get any more yellow jadeite. Um, we've been offered a parcel, uh, um, this is what, a couple of months ago, we've been offered a parcel of yellow jadeite, um, but it was type B grade. And it was more more expensive than the type mm. a that you've seen on your screens um so definitely definitely worth getting hold of if you're a collector and you love this wonderful warm color get it now because we can't re repeat the uh, purchases like this um 19.99 all that being said we still put incorrect prices on our I screens know. though don't we Mad, i know amazing oh, you've got 16 oh, seconds so at gorgeous. this price tag though jewelry makers how many have we got roscoe we had 11, that's right, you did say. Now down to seven. Hello to you, West Midland, Sharon, Veronica, Maker, nice to see you. Um, you've only got that deal for 38 minutes, but literally a second wow. on air. So amazing, amazing. Just use those on your dealer day. Just one on your dealer day. I think we're going to play this. It? I love this. Oh. That's a little strawberry. It's probably not a strawberry. It's probably an urn or something that looks like a little strawberry. It's cute, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. beautiful. Are we doing that one? Yeah, yeah what, have, what have we called it? Ooh. Oh, it is like a little yeah. apple, like an apple or yeah. strawberry. Yeah, I can see that. That's sweet. I've not seen this before. Solid red. Now, Ross wants to say, I get it Sunday and the clocks went back. Back, yeah. Back, yeah. yeah. So you've already had a an hour <laughs> lie in, folks. You've already had an hour. Come on, we should all be up and energised. I'm feeling fresh this morning for an actually. extra hour. Yeah, yeah. But I'm going to tell you, it is actually pretty quiet so far. With Jade, our most popular mm. number one selling gemstone, normally the phone lines have gone crazy by now. Perhaps I've been waffling. Maybe oh, maybe no. it was the talk of boarding lofts. Yes. Perhaps that was it. You tuned out. <laughs> so um, we can't get red jade type A grade. Moving forward, it is the rarest colour. We can get it in type C, but it's more expensive than what we have in type A right now. What we have in type A red wow. jadeite yellow jadeite that's it we've kind of drawn a line in the sand right we won't even attempt buying it because why would we want to bring you something that's lesser lesser quality effectively um at a more expensive price tag now ross is willing wow. to do a massive closeout deal just to wake everybody up because this sunday it seems you've all had a little bit of a lie-in <laughs> Well, don't do that then. Ross has just said, this may well be a bit of a sacral offence. Well, we don't want that then. No, no, no. 
That's how good of a deal it is. How many are there? 35. He says, okay. I am fully expecting to be called into the office on this one. He says, never mind Dave, never mind Wayne. Mm. I'm willing to go extra low on this one, but we need to see you there. Okay, fair enough. I don't want to, Ross, I don't, we don't want to lose you. <laughs> How amazing is that? So, look how sweet. I love this so much. It's a little oh, peach. It's a peach. Oh. I like peaches. Graphics live, and I like type A red jade as That's well. Gorgeous. Good luck. I'm mean, uh, high expectations then. Everything we have told you about red jadeite, the price, the fact that we can bring you type C, but it's more expensive than the type A grade. Obviously, we have to make a, an executive decision on that. We need to see you there, though, says Ross. If he is going to do this, sackable price drop um, then um, yeah show him you're there I've never seen this before it's so no, it's sweet it's gorgeous isn't it little peach little peach ah oh, I got that's mm. I call our girls peaches do when they're good you're a little, mm, peach. little peach little peach half the stocks allocated but not confirmed fair enough Gosh, we can see you wow. there Wow. That's it. That's perfect. That's perfect. We can What's see you all there. Then? Adding it to your baskets. He says, but I do want every single one of the 35 being allocated. Currently, we've got 19. Fair enough. So we've got a little, a little bit of uh, way to go just yet. Um, however, some of those people have got multiples, Roscoe. Twos and threes. It's I can see It's a perfect colour, isn't it, for this time of year, all coming into autumn yes. and all the leaves are changing. Little peach, it's like little pea. Yeah. They're often, often a term of endearment, mm, it isn't is, it? Yeah. Very sweet, and I'm sure it's probably got meaning yeah. within uh, the Chinese culture. Um, still not enough people, says Ross. Come on, Sunday morning, you've had your extra hour in bed now. Um, <laughs> we need nine more people. I, oh, it's nice when the clocks go back, isn't it? Just having, if you can, if you can capitalise on that extra hour in bed. I was on the fence whether it would happen because I've got a two-year-old, but no, yeah. I did. I get that. I got that extra hour of sleep, which is nice. It throws the cats a bit because they still expect their dinner at yeah, a certain and the dogs. time. Yeah, 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 and the dogs. They're almost tapping. It does confuse mm -hmm, them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, come on, I want my yeah, food. Yeah. Um, we are, we need five more people. If we're going to go to this, I don't want to say it out loud, this sackable price tag. <laughs> <laughs> it's only Ross though, it's okay. It's I think I know where he's going. Do I you? I think I know where he's going. I haven't got a clue. Yeah, I think. I haven't got a clue. That's the first time I've ever known Ross say that. Yes, yeah, so actually, actually say, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to take it to a, pos a potentially be sackable price tag. What's that? Everything we say about Red Jade, mm. yeah. He says, I'll show you a price point that we are not paying. Oh. Let's get that price on the move just to sort of, yeah, whet your appetite. Twelve carrots, ninety-nine ninety-nine is not out of the ordinary, not for no and also, look, we've we've spoken about Roland Schlussel. He's mentioned that mm. you seldom ever get a solid red colour in any in a bead or in a carving. Usually it's like a percentage or a proportion of the actual bead that will have that red colour. Naturally, of course. You know, you can get a solid red if it's dyed, that's not an issue. We could anybody can dye gemstones, but this isn't dyed, it's solid red in its natural colour. Susan and Brian were the first ones to check out. Well done, Susan and Brian. I'm wondering how many people use little peach as a, a, a term of endearment. We need four more people to put it to your basket so we can take it to that price tag. Is this your ammunition then, Ross, if you actually say? <laughs> right, OK. Um, let's do... Oh. You generally think what? You, do, you don't even think that will back you up, OK. Oh no. You think there's going to be a serious conversation? Right, let's give you another little hint. Another, another one prize that's not. that he's not oh, going to close okay. at. Oh, I like the peach. What does that say? 59.99. And we're not stopping there. Not stopping there. Okay. Clock's ticking. Right. Sackable offence, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness me, Roscoe. It's so beautiful. I've never seen... Is this new? Is this a premiere? I've never seen it before. Oh. It's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> 
It, I mean, this is, I've never heard those words come out of my producer's mouth before. I'm going to take it to a sackable price. Honestly, and, 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 and Wayne is fairly chill, isn't he, to be fair? The fact that you are envisaging him not taking this very well, I, I genuinely do not know what you're taking it to. Right. It's solid red colour. Ross says, I think a lot of you are expecting this next price. And it is amazing. Forty nine ninety nine. <laughs> There's another clock. Yeah, I'm not even stopping there. You get this deal for 30 minutes and 30 minutes only. I take the apple blossom greens. I was thinking Turn that as well. Turn this into quite a, yes. you know, kind of fruity. A fruit. Do a little, um, a little bubble cluster yeah, on the top. Yeah, beautiful. That'd be really cute. Like it? some little berries or yeah. something like that. I don't know what a peach tree looks like, to be honest, but you know, you could, you mm. could. It's, it's going to have nice green yeah. foliage, so you could use your type A green jade out alongside. Um, definitely worthwhile starting to check out your baskets if you've got heart, your heart set on owning this beautiful type A natural genuine jadeite, uh, red jadeite, the rarest of all colours. Bar none, it's not imperial green. Imperial green is not the rarest colours. It's the most expensive for sure. Um, but that's really down to very clever marketing, I suppose. The actual rarest colour is what's on your screens right now because very few boulders will actually oxidise. Um, uh, 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 and when they do oxidize it's only a small proportion Tiny, like the skin it? of an apple yeah, yeah. yeah that actually achieves that color so to get a carving which has got solid red 29.99 <laughs> can oh, we just no. for a second appreciate that that is not a price point that should ever 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 be associated to any variety of jadeite even your type b's and your type c's and in particular the red in its type a that's ridiculous your little peach it's not so little though i have to no, say no it's enormous That's 12 beautiful. carats maker in london renfusia susan and brian what margaret in wiltshire multibine jacqueline you've got yours i've got five london norfolk Anne, elaine janet louise jane gloucestershire jacqueline northamptonshire amanda um lots of you wanting multiples marie wants two maker wants three amanda wants three uh west midlands if you want that quantity we had what 35 did you say roscoe um, and half the stock has already gone. So would, do check out a sackable price tag, says Roscoe. <laughs> um, and also, um, if you are wondering about sort of quantities in your last stock uh, hour here, last stock J Light hour, there are items already selling out on the website. So um, yes, I wouldn't linger. Don't dilly dally. We can't, we can't, we're not, we cannot, we cannot go any lower. You know, don't you? You know Ross by now. If he can bring you yeah. a great deal, he absolutely will do. He's not shy of that, you know. He's definitely not shy of a deal, are you, Roscoe? Are you shy of anything? He's a bit of a prude. Mm. You, you don't like innuendos. And you, do, you also don't like confrontation. Well, oh, no, no. you've just yeah. asked, you've just invited confrontation with this yeah, deal, yeah. haven't you? <laughs> he'll, 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 <laughs> he'll just sulk out and out, uh, uh, sulk, skulk, is that skulk. the word? Skulk word. out yeah. of the building on Monday. We're not here Monday, so it's all good. It's all good. Well done, everybody. Well done. It's all right. They'll have forgotten about it by then, Roscoe. Don't worry. Don't worry, we've got two days off oh. after this, so it's all good. Well done, everyone, and as always, keep your messages coming through. You can still get hold of it, mad deal. Love the peach. Should we do another one? Go on, then. Certainly have. I, uh, this strand's been eyeing me up. I want Five this strand. Five mil. Uh, <laughs> Five mil. Oh, there we are. Have you found it? Oh, oh. look at this. That's cute. Oh, is, that, is it me or is that a long strand? And it's some um, mirror ombre. Oh, and it is. Yeah, will that work? Is it half a meter? Yeah. yeah. I was going to say oh. you can immediately see that this is a longer yeah. strand, can't That's you? Beautiful, isn't it? You've got your reds, your yellows in here. <laughs> you've got your lavenders. That would look beautiful with the peach, actually, because you've got you just got little that little. You've got that. Ah, couple yes. Of, that would just be lovely, wouldn't it? Gorgeous. Hello, Jacqueline. Yeah. Say Hello. morning, all. Hope he can find another job soon. <laughs> <laughs> Savage, Jacqueline. Um, thanks for the great deals. It was so worth it, lol. <laughs> See ya.
<laughs> See you, Roscoe. No, anybody, I uh, know of any jobs going. Yeah, there's a, um, a, very, ta a very talented TV producer going, Spit. Um, no, oh. don't worry, we'll, go out, we'll be protesting, Roscoe. You can't leave. You can't leave. Um, voluntarily or involuntarily, either, either, or. Um, beautiful translucency, 50 centimetres, 140 carats of your beautiful type A jadeite. Don't go! Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> what do you reckon, Ross? What, what, what kind of job would you go for then? Do you know people are actually going to think that you're leaving if we carry on this conversation? Yeah. What would you do? What would you do? You'd be lost. <laughs> <laughs> I won't repeat what he actually just said, but you have oh, got multiple skills. In this role, he says. Okay. So what if there was no shopping TV? <laughs> He'd retire, he I says. I see him as a farmer. <laughs> a sheep or a cow farmer, I think. I think it'd be, um, <laughs> I think it'd be really good with farmers, yeah. So he's, <laughs> mm. he's not an outdoorsy person. I don't think so. I think that's more Adam. Right. I think Adam, Adam, you, Adam, could, you yeah. could be a sheep farmer, couldn't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Because you're very horticultural and, yeah. and outdoorsy. outdoorsy. Yeah. You've kept sheep, have you? Oh. oh. What your family did? Oh, oh. Yeah. There we go. See, my mum was uh, my mum was uh, um, a farmer's daughter. Was she? Yeah, yeah. And she uh, um, she 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 used to tell a story about their sow that used to be able to open the door of the of the farmhouse and go in and just lie against oh. the arger. She was huge, apparently. Oh, I know. I'd love the idea of yeah. living on a farm. Yeah. Hard work, though, isn't it? Um, we've got it easy, cushy here in the studio. Right, we've got how many? A hundred. Sorry, thirty. Thirty. Where did I get that number from? Um, should we do something ridiculous? I think Sunday is the day to be ridiculous. A fifty-centimeter strand, the perfect one to go with um, <laughs> your hands a hand. It would be lovely with your hands a hand as well. You could suspend that on there, or your um, or your infinity. Yeah. You could do any of these, couldn't you? Yep. Lovely. Now, first price crash. Previous closing oh. price, and then we're going to go even lower. Push those boundaries. But again, we need to see you there. Come and say hi as well. Drop us a text message. Tell us what you're up to this Sunday. Are you having a roast today? Oh, I need a roast dinner today. I'm really craving a roast dinner. We've got dinner. our first Brussels of the day today, Ooh, of the year. Oh, yummy. How it's do you cook your Brussels? It's a special occasion. Um, do you boil them? Boil. Do well, you? Well, steam them. Steam? Steam, yeah. I'm chopped with butter and bacon, yeah, so mine's yeah. a slightly oh. unhealthy version. Um, if we see enough of you with them in your baskets, remember this is the previous closing. It's 50 centimetres, so it's much longer um, than your usual uh, um, strand. We're going to wake everybody up this Sunday morning. We will half that price tag if there's enough people. So we've got 30. We've got 30 available. It's the perfect carrier, isn't it, almost, for all of your pendants. Yeah. Um, the Just big, knotted. And yeah. yeah. It'll, be, it'll be long enough to do over the head knotting if it's knotted. Yeah, lovely. I love it with that because it's just got that little hint yeah. of orange. Yeah, those little pops. Need. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. Oh. Yeah, yesterday I was saying I took Willow to the theatre and her little friend and um, I said, Mummy, can I borrow a necklace? And she chose a jadeite necklace. I knew it was a mistake. She broke it. And there was jadeite beads literally no. all the way across. Um, I was like, oh, so I need, and it was this oh, size, no. so I need to make another one. Um, nowhere near enough people, says Roscoe. If we are going to half that price tag, we do need to make sure we'll, 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 we'll close out the auction here. This is how Shopping TV works. It's very different to usual retail. If we're going to sell the bigger quantity, then obviously you can work off the minuscule margins. If it's only looking like it's going to be one or two, um, then I'm, unfortunately I have to hold it a little bit higher. We need how many? What, 10? Oh, okay, so you don't even need 30 of you we just need 10 of you to justify this price drop Fife is there West Midlands there Amanda's there Julie's there is there people on the phone line do you need five more okay Christine's just joined us morning Christine previously closed at 99.99 could I use That's these good. with your kiss if cross you could absolutely be perfect <laughs> it would be absolutely perfect. and your kumihimo yeah both, lovely both of yeah, yeah and and how perfect yeah. would this be with a lot much of the contents of the advent mm-hmm Perfect with the advent. Yeah. You know, we've got some pretty amazing pieces within the advent calendar. If you got involved yesterday, this would perfectly complement it. Jane and Gwyneth is there. Hello to you, Jane. Hello, telephone call. Oh, it's more than enough of you, says Roscoe now. Brilliant. So are you going to do it? Yeah. Oh, we know you would. 
He's a soft touch, isn't he, really? <laughs> he, 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 beneath that oh. hard exterior, <laughs> he actually is a big softy, isn't it, Ross? You give the image, the illusion of a hard, tough exterior, actually, he's a right wow. softy. <laughs> you were right, he's halved it. Yes. Yeah, so he hints it, he usually does. Um, 49.99, well done everybody. Um, I think I'm gonna join you on this one, especially, I was happy oh. at 99.99. But like I said, my, um, I made it, type A seed pearl necklace that I lent my lovely daughter. She was mortified though, bless her. You could see like she was fight, holding back oh. tears. I was like, don't cry, it was an accident, it's fine. I'll go and find them. It's like, Willow, there's about 100 people in this foyer. You're not gonna be able oh, to find no. them all. Don't worry, mummy will make another one. It's all good. Oh, she dear. thought she was gonna get in trouble. It was an accident. And thankfully, I work for Jewelry Maker, so I can capitalize on these yes. amazing deals too. Well done, Renfusha Senga. Hello to you, West Midlands, Heather, Jane, Fife. The cleaner's gonna be happy though, aren't they? Yeah, absolutely, I was just thinking <laughs> that, yeah. Cleaner's gonna be, oh, look at these pearls and jades that I've just, I've just swept up <laughs> off the floor. That's a pound per a centimeter on your screens jewelry makers let's not work out price per bead so there's 100 on the strand isn't right it? so it'd be 50 yeah yeah so it'd be 50p 50 50p 50 for a jade eye, 50, honestly 50p you put, you put the, two um two on earrings on your little shepherd's hooks we've got coming up yeah 15 20 pound a pair yeah just for two you only need to make three pairs and you've got your money back Quids with all in. the rest left and it's lovely translucency yeah. you also get reds up here i've just realized i was hiding those so perfectly you could restrand it that's you know it, it's that's perfectly on braid um as is maybe pop on your yeah. Yeah, either your peach or your hamza hand or your infinity yeah. i think that would look lovely wouldn't it yeah. um you know what to do well done everybody vesna sheila jane christine five julie amanda Maker um, in West Midlands. Hello to Midlothian. Hello to Renfusha. Heather and Five. Good morning. Happy is that Sunday. On the bottom of the list, on the left, is that Amanda in Leicestershire? It is. Who was going to sit on her hands today? She said. Yeah. She said. She did. Listen, yeah. we're not judging Amanda. No. You're amongst friends. Mm -hmm. You're in a safe place. Yeah. Safe place here. <laughs> I always say that, and it never happens. No. I'm like that in the garden centre. I always say, I'm not going to buy. I'm just going to browse. That's impossible. The worst thing is when you go in and you pick up a basket. <laughs> I mean, once once you've got a basket, you feel obliged that you have to put something in it. Of course you have. But it's really difficult not to pick up I a basket. I love a garden centre. I do as well. I'm going to say that's, yeah. I love I love a garden centre as much as I love jewellery maker. Mm, yeah. And I drag my husband around them. He's like, oh. Oh, we love them. Yeah, sure. Tom, not so much. Yeah. Like all the Christmas departments are now open. Oh, even yeah, better, yeah. even better. 49.99 jewellery makers, well done. These are absolutely flying out the door. We had 30 of them. Yeah, the barbecue mm, section is yeah. good too. <laughs> That's good. Um, and they're like uh, like your, your your fancy scented drawer liners. And oh, yeah, you pick yeah. up all these things that you, you do. don't need. No. You absolutely don't need. <laughs> However, they're just nice. Just Good nice. Place for napkins, buying paper napkins, oh, garden Now centers. that's my mum. Yeah. My mum, when oh, we, we emptied her house, she, I'm, I'm not yeah. kidding, she could have done a banquet for thousands really? of people with the yeah, amount of like us. Yeah, garden centre napkins that she had yeah. um, in the drawer. Um, <laughs> of all different varieties. I've only got five of these left. Again, the perfect size to go alongside. What is it about nap yeah, a napkin? Mm, can't beat them. I remember the best napkins that she actually ever bought were, they looked like um, pound notes, like 10 pound oh. notes. Um, yeah, and I had Amazing. a- Amazing. <laughs> they, they were really good as well. Oh. Um, yeah. We've got our funniest ones was last Christmas we bought gnomes with their back turned, pulling their trousers down to see their bottoms. Little bottoms, yeah. gnome bottoms. Yeah. I bet that's cute. On a plate with a mince pie. Nice, yeah. lovely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shall we do some Guatemalan jade Ooh, rounds? Look. A little parcel oh, of, yeah, amazing. Okay. Shall we do something, um, another, something else? Oh, I mean, we're just crazy, aren't we? Just are. Please. <laughs> just wild. Should we do another wild deal? Go for it. I love these. The color. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. Again, this would work perfectly with m many of yeah. your items within your advent calendar box. They will work oh. perfectly alongside your deal of the day today. And Mark, you know, they could be little stations in between they your could. kiss cross, your kumihimo. Yeah. They're gorgeous. They are lovely, aren't they? I'd use them actually with the honey yellow that oh, we had earlier on. That. Yeah, and if you did that as well, you'd have. Traffic nice. Light. You'd have the traffic lights, wouldn't you? Yeah, that's a lovely combination. Yeah. This is the perfect hour to get them. Yeah, yeah. You know, last of stock opportunities. We do rock bottom deals, brand new lows, 
but you need to be a little bit speedy about making mm. sure that you don't miss out on that opportunity. So parcel of type A Guatemalan jadeite. We know that the future is Guatemalan. That's uh, That was Stanley, wasn't it, who actually said those words. The future is Guatemala um, because we know that the Burmese mine is now closed. You can get jade and different type varieties of, uh, of jade in different locations around the world. But the Chinese market has effectively mm. relocated, haven't they? Um, relocated to Guatemala. So they've got the expertise of mining and also cutting now um, of course that is going to push the price up of this gemstone the lost treasure of Guatemala um, rediscovered when was it the 1980s I think it was wasn't it right. after hundreds and hundreds of years of knowing its existence but didn't know where in s the story inspired yeah, Indiana Jones yes I, I think it. it's amazing yeah. Yeah, Hi, yeah. Amanda. I can confirm my hands are being naughty, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> but I am being selective or trying okay. to be. Right. It's so hard to resist good prices and beautiful gems. Yeah. Absolutely. Listen, yeah. Amanda, I'm going to make you feel better. We aren't going to regret these purchases, are we? And it's not like we're no. spending it on napkins. Old Let's napkins. be honest. One use napkins. One single use napkins. Yeah. You're, yeah, you're, you're, you're purchasing. Ge yeah. rare precious gemstones with an inherent yeah. value so um you know just yeah, just mm. to make you feel a bit better um they will always have that amazing value um yeah. we're at 99 pounds and 99 pence for your parcel of beautiful translucent olmec guatemala and jade eye um, we're gonna do something ridiculous because we just fancy it um brand new low that we have never been anywhere near how does that sound how does that sound i think i think that I reckon Sunday could be our day for, you know, the day when we're probably our naughtiest <laughs> on prices because we absolutely know the powers that be aren't going to be watching. No. no They're not, are they? No. They're going to be peeling, peeling the spuds. Peeling the spuds. Spuds. Yeah. Peeling the spuds for their roast dinner. They're not going to be watching, or at least I hope. At least I hope not. We're going lower. We're going to a brand new low, significantly lower than they have ever been before. What do you say? I'm, I'm craving a roast. I'm craving a roast. I, I need to go to the shop though because I haven't got the ingredients to make a roast. Oh. But I feel like I need What's a roast. What's your favourite roast? Beef. Yeah, me too. I do I like think. a beef yeah. roast dinner. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah, beef. I do like pork as well. Nice pork because I'm good at crackling. Mm. Oh no. Don't you like oh, crackling? Oh no, I do not. Oh, Andrew really? loves it. I mean. But I can't bear it. Delicious. The thought of it. Delicious, no. delicious. I know, Willow tried it the other day. She was like, so what is it? Just eat it, Willow. <laughs> Just eat it. Um, okay. Where's he going with this thing? I don't know. But he did say, unfathomable, what? 19.99. So how many coffees from that place can Ross buy with 20 pound? Because I don't know what you'd pay for a, yeah. Um, for the coffees that he bought this morning, that was just over ten pounds. Wow. So you could probably get six coffees, or you can get a parcel of I old know. Meg Jade. That puts it into perspective. It doesn't does it? rather, doesn't yeah. it? Oh Something that you savour for about thirty seconds. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my goodness me! Uh, you're getting this on your screens for one minute only, jewelry makers. Um, Olmec. It's the only place in the world. The Guatemalan mine is the only place in the world that produces Olmec blue. But not only that, you know, our Olmec, and you can make comparisons elsewhere. It is very rare. Make sure you are comparing like for yes, like quality. Yes. But you have the most unbelievable translucency, which whatever location in the world, when it comes to your nephrites and your jadeites, translucency and colour are the main indicators of the overall value. Um, they're perfectly colour matched, beautifully translucent. Um, and of course, Olmec, the only place that produces that beautiful blue. Phone lines have absolutely lit up. Good morning. I'm not surprised. I mean, it's no. under £20. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness me. Um, yeah, and you are getting an entire parcel of them as well. I'd be using this alongside something like um, your beautiful pearls. I think there'd be mm. nice little accents in amongst your pearls. Great with your deal of the day. That's coming up today at 10 o'clock. Um, uh, okay, yeah, no problem. Someone's asking about the drill. Are they are they through drilled or are they half drilled? Let's double check this for you. Through drilled. Perfect. There you go. Here you go. Ooh. We've got a question for oh. you as well, Mark. Ooh. Can you see that? There you go. So they are through drilled. There we go. If I drop okay. it down. There you go. Now, oh. not just oh. jewellery making oh, okay. here. Go on, question then. for you, Mark. Yeah. I think it's going to be garden related. Okay. Have a little look. Um, 
Uh, from Tina in Hampshire. Morning, Tina. Saying hi. Can I ask Mark if the fungal spray I need yes. for my dwarf yes. peach tree is called it is. copper sulfate? Yes, that's right. They start to grow fruit, but then drop off the tree. Yeah. What is this conversation? about peach trees. So peach trees, you grow against a wall because the, it needs to be really hot. So it's got to be full sun, south facing with a wall to reflect the heat to keep, obviously, right. because they're a tropical plant. Of course. So Victorians used to grow peaches in greenhouses. Yep. Oranges, yes. you know, oranges and lemons and, and that sort of thing. But copper sulfate, um, there aren't very many on the, on the market at the moment. I'm not going to get political, but lots of products have been taken off. Unfortunately, they're not going to be put back on now we've left certain something. Right. You know where I'm going with that? Brexit. We won't talk about that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yes, but copper, copper sulfate is yeah. the one to go for. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> but can you get it? Yes, you can, you get, can it. get it. Right, yeah. okay. Yeah, speak, there speak, you go, speak, Tina. speak to somebody in the department in the garden centre and they'll put you in the right direction. There you but, go. But copper sulfate. Any other moment. questions like that? There you Absolutely. go. Who, who knew? Yeah. Who knew? Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, my mum and dad mm. have a lemon tree in their mm. conservatory. Mm. It's very pretty. Yeah. Very fragrant, <laughs> very fragrant. Um, there you go, Tina. Yeah, hope that helps you out. Yeah. Um, right then, shall yeah. we do some oh. jadeite rice beads? Uh, it's kind of my favourite Green. shape. Red. Oh, red. Are these the ones with the little rounds in between? Oh, I love oh, this strand. Look. Again, um, it's weighty, isn't it? Oh, Deb's got this, that. isn't she? Yes. She yes, has. designer yeah. Deb. Again, long strand. This is more than 50 centimetres. Mm. I'm going to guess 60. 65, I was close, I was close, I was close. Um, there are only five left. And like, again, to quote Roland Schlusser, who, by the way, mm. is probably one of the most uh, um, respected gemologists in the world, contributed to countless different gem books, in particular about jade. Um, and that's what he, he um, his wife and he actually mm. deal in until they actually run out. He said then they'll have to look at diversifying. It was Roland Schlusel who actually said to us when we were in Tucson some uh, a couple of years ago, he was said, um, you don't get solid red pieces of jewellery or carvings just because of That's how true. little of it yes. actually oxidises and yet here we Hello. are with a full <laughs> strand of the it, it, oh, it is I love this. And, I, and this is not oh. a Chinese technical term this is a this is a very much an ism um, it's the, like the ripest juiciest cherry tomato it red is. isn't it no. it's like sun-dried tomato oh isn't it? just yeah. gorgeous that's yeah. the best quality that you could wish for um here we go so these are this is uh, uh roland schlusel um and his business is pillar and stone and he said these colors have turned the industry on its head the demand and supply is a real issue and as such we are seeing some of the highest prices for this material and still dealers are reluctant to sell because it's simply irreplaceable yeah. we are finding it easier to provide imperial green to our clients and at a more affordable price for the first time he's talking about red jadeite here jewelry makers that's a very simple diagram that oh, shows you um, a cross section effectively of your jadeite boulder um, if you imagine it like an apple you bite into your apple and the, the skin of the apple is potentially the red not all will oxidize though these are extremely limited i love this strand it's probably one of my favorite strands this one of your jadeite um, the colour is just amazing, it's the cut's amazing. Like Mark said, you get the two different shapes. Yeah. We're at £299. I love it. I would just restrand this as, as is. is. Absolutely. I would knot it, I think. And yeah. I, don't, I don't know what black, I think. That would be nice. Black knots. Maybe use your maybe yeah. use your faceted mm. rounds that are coming up yeah, a little bit later that's a good on. Idea. That'd be lovely. Or use your parcel of Guatemala and that'd be quite nice too. Oh, it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's, it's just so vivid, isn't it? Yeah. And, and rich. £299, yeah. it's last opportunities to get hold of that. We have got another mm. strand of red. These are um, knotted rounds. It's knotted for you. So Already. If you, yeah, you don't need to do anything to this, really. Um, yeah, you can just attach it to your clasp. I like being your glamorous assistant. Do you know, I'm really quite offended. Why? By all of you, actually, in the, in the, in the, in the building today. Why? Nobody has mentioned the fact I'm wearing I did notice a plain shirt I did notice but I did yeah, yeah. honestly so, sorry even Andrew even Andrew this morning in his in his just woken up slumber mentioned why haven't you got check on today it suits you 
Well, I thought I'd... It does suit you. As we're heading into remembrance, I thought yes, I'd just yes, go yes. a bit more subdued. Yes, yeah. yes. So, um, I did compliment yeah. your hair, though. You did. <laughs> Didn't I? I was like, your hair is looking lovely. Very silky. Thank you. Very silky hair, Mark. <laughs> um, so I apologise. Yes, I did That's notice right. it, though. Um, <laughs> I genuinely offended you then. I was like, God. Now, 299, where we closed the previous strand. Oh. You've oh, brought no. the minute in. What's the minute in for? I thought you were stopping there. It was meant to be a minute to close. So it was Adam's fault then? Adam's fault. Right, right. Adam, some might say it's a sackable offence. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ross, if Ross is going down, <laughs> you'll go down too. Shall we do... So yeah, you could do something terrible and you can blame Director Adam then. Uh, we close the last That's round at 299. Okay. It's knotted for you, so all you need yeah. to do is attach it to your class. We should be here. We should stay here. Um, attach your sterling silver findings that are coming up, or gold, whichever you wish. Um, but Ross is saying I've been pushed into this next price oh. crash. It was never intended. Plus, you've got your split pay. How many have we got then, Roscoe? Only five. Oh, no. Okay. And they're beautifully knotted for you. If you're not great in knotting like myself, then you, this is done for you. All you need to do is undo this little knot at the top and attach your clasp. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so sorry, Ross. I, yeah. I was, I was backing you up up until you took a hundred quid off. <laughs> yeah, hundred pounds. My goodness me. That's amazing, wow. isn't it? How beautiful! Again, that lovely, vibrant cherry tomato red. You see these kits here. You yeah. See the little pot. This one. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. There should be, you've got four different sizes of bell caps yeah, in here. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, there's a, there's a second, there's a tiny that one, one yeah. uh, the next size up. Will that pop on top of one of those end beads? Oh, hang because on, I know can, which one you mean. You can glue. That one. Will it be that one? No, it'd be the next one then. There's definitely going to be one in here that's going to be, and all you'll do is you'll just glue the last bead into the bell cap. There we go. Do you want me to have a try? I think it's probably going to be that one there. Yeah, the yeah. second one down. Yeah. Will that go in? Yeah. Will that go in? Yeah. Perfect. So all you do then is you should just pop that in, glue it in, and then you've got, and with it, I said, this is why, for me, the toggle clasps and the bell caps. Oh, yeah, it goes fully in. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. Perfect. <laughs> yep, so Perfect. That's what I would do. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. There you go. And these are coming up in the next yep. hour. Yep. So um, now, we've had a few requests, as you say. Oh. Oh, this strand's amazing. Ooh. I'm so glad you've requested this. Is this the colour wheel? Yeah. Uh, this took two years to, to put together. Know, I made jewellery for the launch of this, and lovely Dave took it with him. Did he? All the Was pieces. that okay? Well, I, well, I don't know. <laughs> I, made, I made a set, a suite, using all the gemstones, and I made him a macrame bracelet as a gift. Yeah. And he took the whole lot. Oh. Yeah. Do, well, do you know what the mm. work, the efforts that Dave mm. goes to as well, mm. and yourself, obviously, yeah. but yeah. to make such opportunities like this, it's this gorgeous. is the, if you go on to Mason and Kane, you mm. look all the GIA, and you look at the Jadeite color wheel, you'll see the um, all the different colors that Jadeite forms in, and it was a, a conversation that happened probably about two and a half years ago, and it was a case of um, can we do a strand that incorporates all of the colors? Um, mm. it, like I said, it took over two years to actually put together. These are all totally natural. Now we're going to do this. We are at the top of this hour. We'll oh. do it in one price crash. We've probably got how many of these we've got left? Two? Three? Six. Okay. Wow. Six left. Five well, well now, because Hazel's got hers. Well done, Hazel. The, this strand is insane. It's gorgeous. As, it? And you could have a little look. Well, not right now, because you've only got a minute, uh, a few minutes to actually secure yours, if that. Um, have a look at wow. Gumps. Gumps Jewelers. G-U-M-P, um, Gump's Jewelers, Multicoloured Jadeite Necklace, and you will see prices, 10,000, 2,000. Wow. You know, that's the reality. And you'll also see how comparable the quality is. In fact, we've had a message from an empl uh, a previous employee of Gump's, because Jewelry Maker audience is international. Um, and they were saying the quality that Jewelry Maker provide in type A Jadeite is, ex is wow. equal to Gump's. The only dis your difference, <coughs> excuse me, is the price tags, of course. Two nine nine, goodness me! I remember the launch; it was part of our birthday, it wasn't was, it? It was, yes. Yep. We've got just six of them left. Um, Hazel, well done. Michelle, I can see you in Wales. Hello to you, Louise in Suffolk and Maker in Fife. Um, Swansea's also there. 
Um, I've got four left, so you need to be checking them out. Also, this hour is about to time out. So get it home. You still get your 30-day um, money-back guarantee. The quality wow. is off the chart. Karen, Margaret, Susan, you've joined us as well. So hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That I can see here in the studio, and there is a slight delay. Um, is that right, Ross? Seven people for the final four? Four left. So if you check out your baskets, it's well there's not going to be enough there's not going to be enough to go around obviously minute clock to close to close oh. not just this auction opportunity but to close the entire hour jewelry makers you have the wheels the color wheels you've got your apple blossoms your red your lavenders your imperial white your yellows your greens your blacks everything will disappear after this auction jewelry makers we have the black and white faceted um type a jadeite bundle when wow. do, since when was bundling jadeite i think um, so that's coming up immediately after the break. Jewelry makers and Mark's amazing Kumahimo kits. Yes, um, oh, I've got two left. Oh, no. That's it. Two. That. That's it. Once they're gone, they're gone. You know we can't buy. Look, it took us two years to actually to actually make uh, to put this together. Right, this opportunity. Yeah, well, right. we can't get red. We can't get yellow. No. We're struggling to get all the other colours. So we know this is an irrepeatable. Yeah item 15 seconds and we will be moving on from this item and everything if there's anything that you've got within your baskets check out safe in the knowledge of course you pay one potion packaging all day but don't go anywhere because we've got the lovely marks amazing kits and the jade light after this <laughs> Jewelry makers, head over to the website for our biggest web sale ever. We have over 2,000 lines with up to 80% off. So head over to www.jewelrymaker.com for our bling it back web exclusive sale and grab them deals before they disappear. I'm Carol and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is solid silver, I'm a silversmith. I want to win Britain's Next Gem because jewellery making and jewellery teaching brings me so much joy and I want to share that joy with other people. Back by popular demand, introducing the one, the only, Gemporia Festive Ball. Party with your favourite presenters from Gems TV, Hobby Maker, Jewelry Maker and Sewing Street. We're all together for a night that's going to be the talk of the town. Situated at the fabulous Stratford Manor, close to the world famous Stratford-upon-Avon. Tickets are just £99 per person, including a welcome drink, a three-course dinner, half a bottle of wine and music that'll have you dancing all night long. There'll also be a shop at the party, and even a tombola, if you're feeling lucky. Numbers are limited, so order your tickets today to avoid disappointment. Let's make it a night to remember at the Gemporia Festive Ball on Saturday the 25th of November. See you there. I'm Sally, I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My favourite gemstone is opal. I love the colour play and the iridescence. I'd like to win Britain's Next Gem so I can share the knowledge and teach the things that I wish someone had taught me in the beginning. and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is wire work. I love wrapping, I love counting. It soothes my soul being able to wire wrap with crystals. <laughs> I would love to win Britain's Next Gem. Um, it's basically something, doing something like this is, some, is like a dream for me. Being able to present and 
teach and do this is, yeah, it would be a dream come true to win this. Now, jewellery makers, welcome back. It's going to be an absolutely amazing show, truly. Back with, very nostalgic, I feel I like, know, this next okay, hour. We don't get to do it very often, so no. it's, it's ever so nice to have it back and uh, And it's, have a play. you know, mindful, I think, mm, Umihimo. Very, very. It's not something that, no, you, it, no. it develops quite quickly, depending on the cause, I suppose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no? Okay, am I wrong? Am I wrong? But you can pick it up and put it down, can't yeah, you? Yeah, absolutely, which is which is good. Okay, so it doesn't develop quickly. Um, it it does take a long time. It took it takes you longer to bead up your kumihimo right. than it does to actually make it. When, right. when, once all the beadings, you, you've threaded all your strands, mm. then it, it is quite quick. Yeah. Well, but it, again, you can put it down and come back to it, which is one of those techniques. An ancient very form ancient. of form yes. of knotting. Now, before yes. we get into Mark's amazing kits, we have. A strand that we can't, we don't want to oh, not bring to no, you. So no. it should have been, we should have played it in the last hour. Um, oh, okay, okay. We're going to try and squeeze that in. But right now for that amazing monochrome mm. um, bundle. Firstly, can I just say, bundle I think is something that, that jewellery maker, a term that jewellery, I know other shopping channels have mm. taken it on as well. Yeah. I think it does stem from jewellery maker though, the no, term. Right. Yeah. Um, because you, you see like bundles of skincare now and, you know, oh, that's true, actually. Yeah, lots of shopping channels, yeah, but bundled, and, and yeah. yeah, and I think it is definitely. I might be wrong, but I think it is. It's very much a jewelry makerism, isn't mm. it? Um, and there's strands that we will bundle, will or, or findings that we will bundle. Um, jadeite is not one of them. No, <laughs> it is not one of them because we've got to remember that jadeite is in the top ten rarest gemstones in the world. It is also in the top 10 most expensive gemstones in the world. And what we have before you, this little shopping channel in the middle of England, we have for you like for like quality comparable with the yeah. biggest names in the industry. And I know it's, it's almost unbelievable me saying that really, that mm. we're bringing you the caliber, the quality of jadeite that you can see in Cartier. You no, do see in right. Cartier yeah. and Gumps, for example, in San Francisco, the premium grade. When it comes to jadeite, it is um, different to your diamonds and your sapphires and your rubies. Um, instead of being the four Cs, so your carat weight, your color, your clarity and your cut, which is how you would actually sort of value and determine the value of those gemstones. Um, when it comes to jadeite, and I know a lot of you know this, but do bear with me because I must, I must never ever assume that everybody mm. knows. Um, with jadeite, it is actually translucency and color. So they're what determine, and or artistry, you can actually bring in artistry, which effectively this bundle actually does have. Because look, a round takes a huge amount of skill to actually carve. Um, you've got to remember this is a gemstone that's physically as hard as steel. It's still cut and polished mm. in, in, in the ancient techniques sort of using um, wet bamboo and polishing. Um, but when you're holding, imagine you're holding some jadeite rough or you're holding another gemstone which is a little bit more abundant, for example, still a rare, beautiful, genuine gemstone. Um, you as a gem trader will want to retain optimum mm. carat weight. So that's why our challenge when we started speaking to people like Bernard, for example, um, Bernard's the most, or Sally Hewer as well, you know, when we started working with them directly and we said, right, okay, can you do a bicone? What's a bicone? Hang on a minute, we don't do that with jade yes, because yes. you're cutting a big bulk of that carrot weight away. So we had to overcome that hurdle. The same absolutely applies to your faceted rounds. Firstly, it's easier to do a smooth round. We all know that, mm -hmm. that's fairly obvious, isn't it? But they are, 
I can almost imagine in their head them seeing pound signs disappearing out of the window. Every facet. Every yeah, facet. Every facet, yeah. Every, and it's yeah. artistry to create a faceted round. Um, so that's why, lovely jewellery makers, we really see jade eye in, in its faceted form. Mm. Then we also bundle it, like I said, which is very <laughs> much a jewellery makerism. There are certain strands we do bundle, certain strands that we absolutely do not. This is one of the latter. Um, and it, I, when, when I was, like I said, we've been teased with this bundle all week. It's been before oh, really? us. Yeah, we've not yet played it. We've waited to, till today. Um, perhaps perfectly, actually, because it would work with it your would techniques, wouldn't work it? Amazing. Both of them, yes, yeah. But I, it, I was actually thinking is there anything more perfect than monochrome? No. No, if you had to choose not. one one style, mm. I bet you a, 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 a high percentage of people would go with monochrome. Well, it would work. It works with everything in your wardrobe, doesn't it? Monochrome. Yeah. Whether it's a colour, whether it's whether again it's another monochrome. Every single and it's classic, isn't it? Yeah. The monochrome. Chanel. Yeah. Absolutely. You know, it works with Chanel, doesn't it? Yeah. You know, a lot of their um, accessories and jewellery are monochrome. Um, Take a look at this jewelry makers. It's absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. One thing I don't know though, Ross, how many do we have? Oh. 46. Oh. They're six millimeter faceted rounds bundled. So if I looked at that, that recording on screen now, I would think that was spinel. Yeah, because of the luster. Be because the luster and the sparkle and the sharpness of the facets. Yeah. It, it, it's absolutely amazing. Oh, you've just highlighted something yeah. by saying that word, Mark, um, mm. the sharpness of the facets. It was Confucius yeah. that said something quite similar, actually. Oh. The first ever teacher. Mm. Um, and he actually talks about the hardness and the right. facets, you know, that, that this actually produces. Um, so here's that gemstone that, that, like I said, has been discussed, written about, um, admired for hundreds upon hundreds of years. It's rare to get it in its faceted form because we are looking at something that A, is very ta challenging to facet, but B, incredibly expensive. You know, much like your bangles, you have to pay for what mm, you lose. That's right, absolutely. You know, yes. that, car that it, yeah. it's, uh, the center of a bangle is carved away in an abrasive manner. And um, you've got these dynamic, as Mark has just said there, dynamic flat surfaces creating that mirror-like luster. First price crash. I need to emphasize these are both totally and utterly natural. Black jadeite, by the way, forms significantly smaller than, than any other color. Um, so they're not big, vast boulders. They tend to be more like your... Uh, um, Cotan, so more pebble-like size, and it splints as well, so it's making it even more challenging. Um, technically, it's actually a very dark green, very, very dark green, but like I said, you'd no, have to put it under a microscope no. for that. Um, we refer to it in the West as piano black. First price crash to bundle this gemstone, the perfect balance, yin and yang, again, you've got all of those associations. First price crash, that's 250 per strand, which that's is amazing. amazing. Yeah. absolutely amazing and we've got a lot of wow. interest in this I can't Gosh. wait to see the pieces of jewelry I'm not surprised because it you know I, I might buy the black with the intention or oh, maybe one day jewelry maker will do a faceted six millimeter round in white you know but who knows to actually be able to get them both, both. together yeah. and get the most amazing uh, um, promotional deal how exciting is that straight away collectors getting involved my only wish is that we had more, it's jadeite, I shouldn't be complacent. 46 is a fantastic quantity. Um, be quick though, you've also got your 0% interest split payments. Pure white, what we call imperial white, natural type A, fascinating, that's been within the ground for thousands of years. And then jet black luster. First price crash, what did you say Russ? 250 per strand. How about 250 what? for the pair? Just buy one get one free then at the moment. Oh goodness sake, we can't say that about jadeite though, can we? We can't say bog no, off with jadeite. No, no. Oh no. How about then, jewelry makers? I actually don't know what you're taking this to, Ross. Oh my goodness me. Right, okay. Oh oh my goodness me. Everybody that has it in their basket, I promise. I promise you will be over the moon with the, with the final price. I promise. We have had this before oh, no. us all weekend. We've wanted to play it, then we had all those issues on Friday. 
And then with the advent calendar and also the Queen Conk, you know, that was, it's not rush, we don't want to rush it. No. And also it's perfect to go alongside Mark. Mm. I tell you what, it's worth the wait. I promise if you check out now, you will be over the moon with the price tag. Over the moon. In fact, let me just show Mark. There it is, uh, right at the top. Right. See what I mean? 19 seconds and it's happening. Hazel, London, Marion, Pauline, Maker, Maker, Meath, Sean, uh, Jane, Caroline, Sandra, Pauline, wanting multiples. Now is the time to multiply, I have to tell you, because this is less. What we are taking this to is less than what we should be paying for one strand. <laughs> <laughs> massively, massively, and that's that's oh, probably Lord. an understatement. Okay, how about this then? Hundred pound a strand. Ha mm. I know I have physically sat here and brought you non-faceted jadeite. One two nine, one yes. four nine, yes. six yes. millimeter in their size. We had a smooth round black jadeite in the first hour. And it closed up how much? 99. That's amazing. But that's smooth round. It's also not faceted. One strand. One strand. You're getting two strands, imperial white, completely pure. Remember what Richard Wise said? Like a, a single white jadeite cabochon, a pure white hue with a moderate translucency should be considered the finest of its type. You've got an entire strand and you have that piano black. In 17 seconds, nobody is paying £199. It's amazing. Is that anywhere near the price that I just no, showed you? Nowhere no, nowhere near. No, <laughs> no, no, definitely not. Imagine kiss crossing this, Mark. Mm -hmm. A big. And yeah, because you'd, you'd need a couple of bundles yeah. to do a really uh, to do a nice over the head. Well, yeah. there's probably never been a better opportunity no, to get a not. couple of bundles, <laughs> a bundle of jade. Oh, I almost feel wrong saying that word. Fifty pound a strand. Well, that's amazing, isn't it? What did it start off at? Two hundred and fifty a strand. Yeah, which is which is this not is unrealistic. Not at all. No. Not unrealistic at all. Thirty-three pound. That's crazy, isn't it? If these don't go on oh. all over this opportunity, so that imperial white, once upon a time reserved for uh, for imperial china, you know that forty-nine ninety-nine for the type A uh. black piano black uh, jadeite. Forty nine ninety nine. I you just, I just I just couldn't I can't get my I, I couldn't no. quite understand. <laughs> I couldn't quite understand that we're talking about both of them under yeah. fifty pounds. Yeah, yeah. It should have they should be a hundred and forty nine each, let alone let alone forty nine. Um, they are looking like they could be an on screen sellout. Jewelry makers Wendy Senger, Pauline oh. Sean, Hazel, Pauline London, Marion, Jane, new customer, new customer, Jane, Caroline, Sandra, Pauline, Marion. Don't let that put you off though, folks. You can still get hold of yours. Um, pick up the phone, speak to our contact centre. Guess who's on the on the app? Go on then. Amanda's getting involved. Amanda. Don't blame you, Amanda. Don't blame you. No sitting on hands She's when you've got, got an deals like this. Collection of jade, like Amanda. She absolutely. Oh, loves. you well then you do, it's she a given, isn't it, Amanda? Yeah, she recognise. Yeah. She knows as well. So I've got to stop naming you, mm. haven't I? Bless you, John. <laughs> <laughs> Outing you on TV. Bless you. Um, I'll be joining you. Don't you yeah, worry. But look yeah. at that. Why wouldn't we? When do we bundle jadeite? Yeah. Amanda works very hard. She's got a very stressful job, and and down jewelry maker has, has really grounded her and helps her relax. she's a veterinary nurse oh, and, bless and you. they're very very busy and and i couldn't i couldn't do it no i've got so nothing but admiration no, no. nothing so, but um, admiration so no she she does i wonder if she's gonna be selling jada on her stalls in november that would be yeah you said you had a very yeah. busy a yeah. busy uh, and five five fairs five fairs yeah. gosh yeah. gosh you are a busy person yeah. now hang on a sec yeah. one single bead on a bit of cord, you could sell for... 45, 50 yeah. pounds. It's, ja it's jade Jade, yeah. Put yeah. monochrome, yin and yang. One black, oh, one white. Yeah. You know, how, how much do you think? Mm. How much do you think? That's crazy, isn't it? On your, sh on your deal of the day, shop oh, yeah, yeah. Go for yin and yang. 60, 65 pounds. And do you know what Just I would do? Yeah, lovely. Yeah, yeah. If with your, on your shepherd hook earrings, I would put one, um, so I'd go black and white. Yeah. White and black. Mix it up so it yeah, is like yin and yeah. yang.
Quite sixties, you yeah. said that this morning, didn't you? It would be quite sixties in that. That was the first thing I said to you when you walked. Like, in oh, the door. you look a bit sixties today. It's the skirt. It's the skirt because yeah. I know from here, waist yeah. up, I always look like I'm wearing black. But I do wear colours. I do yeah. wear colours. Yeah. yeah, it came in with a big beehive. That was it. Um, <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, how beautiful. Wow. The quantity that we oh. have left, jewelry makers, 15. Wow. So many of you got involved. Lots of you multi buying. Sorry's got two. Well done. Des, hello to you. Debbie, Marion, Sharon, Alison. Hello, Karen. Good morning, all. Can I just say, I was thinking how handsome Mark looks in his plain shirt this morning. Bless you. Thank you. You do? Yeah. You do? And the hair, I'm loving it. It might be the way to go. Might be the way to go. Just go. It does suit you. Mm. Yeah. So we can have a dashing face. <laughs> um, hello to you, Christine. Looking very dapper this morning, Mark. Thank you. I should have not mentioned it now. No, no. I've, we, made, I've made it a see, thing we now. Haven't I? No, you haven't. We'd have all noticed. <laughs> We'd have all. I noticed it as well. Did notice looks very mm. handsome, does our Mark? Very it's handsome. strange when you watch TV now, and you because we love it, we are one of our favorite programs is a Channel Four program called Four in a Bed. Yes, and it's all about B and B owners. We love it. It's our it's our guilty pleasure. <laughs> and sometimes I'm watching and I think I've got that shirt. <laughs> oh, I've got that shirt. <laughs> Twice now we've been to family functions and I've been with the man wearing the same shirt. Okay. He's really, and normally it's ladies, isn't it, that feel a bit. <gasps> If you turn That's up wearing right. the same outfit, but uh, yeah, it's yeah. all right. Yeah, I love my I love my check. Yeah, it suits you. It, as well. it hides a multitude of sins. Check. No, not that you have <laughs> sins to hide. We've got ten of these wow. left, everybody. Would you put some pearls in there? Would you put I maybe a big so, brock yeah. pearl tassels, kiss cross? You could definitely do that. One minute yeah. left on your screens. That is an absolutely mm. amazing bundle. I think it was red. Yeah, red oh, and that would be gorgeous. Just, just, just knot it, alternate it with a red tassel, I just think would look so beautiful. Yeah, stunning. Yeah. Absolutely stunning. And what a high-end yeah. piece of jewellery that would be. Yeah. Um, we don't bundle jade I, as a rule, and for obvious reasons, jewellery yeah. makers, plus the fact that these are... I mean, look, even if they... Uh, 99.99 for a plain round strand mm. as we as yeah. ross said earlier on in our earmark we had a black jadeite strand in the first hour that was six mil plain rounds and it was what was on the yeah. screens yeah. um you're basically getting the two and they're faceted so they should be even more expensive um i've got just eight of them left wow. now um, let me just tell you shout out some of the names that i've still got in their baskets so maker on the phone lines you've just got two actually well done well senga done. um Anne in pembrokeshire lynn in cheshire london cornwall candy Jane, Caroline, Sandra, Pauline. As you can tell, there's more than four people with it still in their basket. So good luck. You can always wish list it, wish list it. What an amazing deal. Um, congratulations, everybody. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, Mark, where do we oh. go from there? Um, should we do a bit Kumihimo? Shall we? Kumihimo, am I saying this right? It's an yeah. ancient Japanese form of knotting. So Kumihimo, as, as you said, it's from the 14th century and it was originally made for, if you imagine a, a um, samurai warrior, they wear their, their suit of armor and made of lots of little pieces mm. and they used Kumihimo braids to join them all together. Ah. And that's how it originally started. And then it was used for belts your little net skis and all yeah. that sort of thing and uh, but it's, it's it's brilliant amazing and it's yeah. so beautiful like kumihimo kumi. translates to crossover does it yeah that's that's it that's crossover. what it means yeah. um and anybody yeah. can do kumihimo anybody can't they? anybody you need a minimum of tools you need you need a disc you need a cord and you need you don't need beads but if you no. want to do beaded you would have to need you have some sort of beads and that's it pair so of scissors yeah that's pair of scissors so so yeah. so my seven-year-old could do easy. this easy absolutely easy and what's really good about this is if you're going on a holiday on a plane they get a bit funny about taking tools and things yeah okay so what you do is you set up your kumihimo disc you set it all going you take it on board it's it's a bit of acrylic and a bit of foam and you're ready to go away you go so you don't need any tools and it's really very 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 th for me it's it's even more therapeutic than than macrame kumihimo yeah I guess Lovely. it's easier to do on the go as well, Absolutely. Kumihima, because yep. a macrame ball can be quite big, can't it? So yep. if you're doing like car yep. journeys or something like that, Perfect. just have that on your lap, couldn't Perfect. you? Amazing. Yeah. So, yep. but, 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 um, we don't often get the Kumihimo ends. Hardly ever. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Hardly ever. Now, um, can I ask, Chris, can you pass those oh. kits over for me? Thank you, lovely. Um, so, yeah, the, the, the Kumihimo ends, sorry, I forgot to bring them over. Uh, other one, that's it. Um, they're like, well, they call them bell caps, bell don't caps. they? That's right, yeah. But the, you get the, the selection that you get, and this is amazing, so you get, you get um, clasps, you get toggle clasps, then you get this beautiful 
double ended with a lobster and an extender chain. So you get that as well. Okay. You get this one as well. You get four in each pack, you get four of these um, carriers. So you slide that onto your braid and then you can hang tassels or pearls. And then you get a selection of four different sizes from the little dinky ones mm -hmm. up to the large bell caps. And you also get, and I'll show you why we have these oval jump rings to attach everything together. So you get, oh. so you get a whole pack of findings. And then as I mentioned, you get three sizes of your seed beads in each kit as well. Now, you as you lot. mentioned as well, you do yeah. get a lot. Yeah. And for the bell caps and the components alone, yeah. the I, would, I would just buy those. And yeah. just, you know, and the seed beads are extras. Extras. We hardly ever have them. No, absolutely. They are They're like amazing. gold dust. Now, yeah. um, let me just tell everybody that you have... Oh, let's have a look. Oh, uh, wait. What's the price we're going to? There's only 49 of each kit. Really? Oh. You need to be quick. Well, that's not very many. That's oh, not at all. Right. It'll be the bell caps. That's It'll the be, reason. That'll be it. Yes. Okay. Yes. So, um, yeah, whichever kit, get involved. They're all lovely colourways. Which one do you want us to start with then, Mark? Right, let's go with the one nearest to you. Yeah. So <laughs> this is this is the necklace. Have I... So that's the necklace I made. Yeah, so let, yeah, actually let's talk, look yeah. at all your lovely jewellery So you can first. see why I've called it spark plug, which isn't, as I said, it's not the most romantic, but it's the first thing that, that I thought of. So we've got the braid along here. Now this is your basic eight warp. I tend to do all of my Kumihimo braids using eight strands. I've, used, I've done a couple of pieces using 12, but mm. on the disc, if you wanted to, you could do 32 threads, wow. okay. which, would be, which would be amazing. I must do it one day, just to, just to prove that I can actually do it. So this is your braid, and this is using 0.5 S-Long cord. And the reason I've used 0.5 is I've used all three sizes of the seed beads. So we've got the 11 O's in the silver, and then we've got hex beads, which yes, I've, had, I, I've only had once before, and then we've got six O's in the middle. And all you, all you need to do is, is you just need to thread your, your cords before you start any of your knotting. And mm -hmm. I'll show you the order when I come to do the demo. So you place however many of the 11 O's and then the 8 O's and then the 6 O's. And you can see there that I've got the two dinky bell caps from the end. I've got the oval jump rings and then the amazing toggle. I mean, the toggles are beautiful. They're yeah, they are. Beautiful. You get a few of those you as get well. A, you get, I think you get four, at least four, I think. Or it might be even more than that. So you get your toggles, and as I said, you get, as you can see on the other picture there, you get four different sizes of your bell caps, varying sizes. You get four of your carriers. You get the, the set with the extender chain, which is beautiful with a little lobster claw. And then you get your, your toggles and your oval jump rings. Four so of your toggles, amazing, I can it's confirm. It's an amazing bundle. I can confirm four. Um, so here you go. I'm just, I've just literally finished laying it all out for you. Oh, perfect. So look at just all of that. Just a lot of findings. And this, yeah. all your findings just here, is what you get with each of the kits, just yes. different variations right. of your sea beads effectively. Yep. Yep. Um, so so obviously these are your bell caps. That's what They're you put your caps. braid into That's the right. end of, Absolutely. isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. What's this? So these are your carriers. So what you do, if you, because I've beaded all mine, so I couldn't use these. But if you were just making a cord, mm. so you could make a, um, um, a, a basic braid. Have I got a long braid? Let's just bring... Yeah, let's bring this next. So this is coming up in the next kit. But you could make a braid like this, mm -hmm. and then you slide your carrier on. Okay, so yeah. that so that would slide through. Yeah, yeah, through there. And then there. it would hang down. And imagine that with a with a, oh, um, a jadeite yeah, yes. high goo or something like that. That underneath. would be lovely. And, that, and then that would slide. It's like a bale, isn't it's like it? A bale. I suppose. Absolutely. Yeah. So you, uh, so you can see the size of the braid if you wanted to. So if you're using your thick two millimeter silks, for example, it would be quite big. So that would be absolutely lovely. And then you've got that, the loop then to hang things from. So well, you get four of those. Then you, four, yeah. then you get your clasp with the ends. With that, it's that little raindrop ending. It's yeah, so pretty, cute. isn't it? Yeah. So pretty. So you yeah. get that one as well. Oval yeah. jump rings, as yeah. Mark was just saying, four toggles. You get the different sizes of the bell caps. Yeah. And then you're also getting your hex beads, which are really pretty. Um, yeah. your, your galvanized silver and then this lovely 8 -0. So we have yeah. 49 jewelry makers. This kit is wow. extremely limited. Um, if you miss out on this one, shop ahead on the um, on the other kits as well. Um, this is going to be, and it's Kumihimo, yes, of course. These are were intended, and I think first brought to our screen of Kumihima, but you can use it for a lot, can't you? Yes, yeah, so if you're doing, do you remember the twist macrame, the helix? You can use those yeah. for, you can use the, the bell caps for doing your macrame as well, or if you're if you're doing, as obviously you've done the seeding, but um, if you do ropes, your seed bead ropes, so your, your peyote, 
or were you one with Alison the other day with the snake yes. ends? Yes, yes. Well, th those bracelets there that she made with the snake charm, the, the snake endings, you mm -hmm. can use your bell caps on yeah, the end of those. Yeah, you can put the sea beads inside. Inside the bell caps as well, so they're really good for your, for your sea bead ropes as well. Really Beautiful. Good. I think this is going to mm. absolutely go crazy. I only I wish we had at least 149. I know. That would I be know. better, wouldn't it? But it is what it is. There's 150 of, 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 of across the board, effectively. Um, good luck. And as always, if you have any questions for Mark regarding this technique, do drop us a message. We are live here into the studio. Um, they are silver plated essential findings as well. So it includes your tube of your hex beads, your galvanized silver, um, your ATO, which is a really pretty color. I'm trying to see what that color is. Uh, so sea foam line crystal AB, um, that's this one, isn't it? Your hex. Then you've got your galvanized 11 and this is lilac. It's described as a um, as a lilac colour. Okay, 49 available. Already going. Let's open up this auction opportunity for you all. It is. I think it's really mindful. Kumihima. Yeah. All you need to do is add your add your break add your cords, your yep, Eslons right. and things yeah, like that. Any cords that you've got at home in your stash. Yeah. I love the colour combination as well. I, I love those two That's together. Pretty. And the fact that we've got silver eleven O's, I don't know where they've managed to find those. They're like gold dust at the moment. They are, and I'm looking at the yeah. hex actually in this piece of jewellery. The way it as hits well. the line oh. with the facets. Yeah. So what's a hex bead? Are they hexagonal? Yeah, so if you look ah. so it's an eight O. But if you look down, instead of it being round, like a my Muki round, it's hexagonal, so you've got six sides. Right. So Alison had the triangles, didn't she? Yes. With her snakes. Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes. So that's a three-sided, these are six-sided. So if you look down, hold down, they're, they're hexagonal. Amazing. Now, they're already Lovely. going, Mark, you can see people making their checkouts already. Susan and Brian, Devon, Sarah, uh, Sarah Ruby's multi-bore, uh, Isabel, Pauline, Alison, Kimberly, Judith, Amanda, uh, Pauline, Patricia, Jane, Isabel, London. I can't keep up with you, everybody. There's only 49 available opportunities. Um, almost half the stock has gone already. You can, can we shop ahead on the other kits as well? Yeah. Okay, all available on pre-order. So basically... Yeah, I agree with you, Mark. For the findings alone. Yeah, no, it's a beautiful pack. 20, oh, wow. oh that's <laughs> lower than what it says on my standby sheet. A long, long way. Goodness me. Yeah. So these are different styles. So these aren't your um, spark plugs, but just to show you the different endings that we've got. How beautiful, it just, it, they it do just fi finishes they, it off so yeah. elegantly, doesn't it? And it would be quite difficult yeah. to finish them without these components yes, I suppose. No, absolutely, absolutely. I That's guess you could so knot gorgeous. it, couldn't you? You could knot it. I mean this one here, this this bright vivid again, this is this is a spark plug from from other kits I've had in the past. So I took my the, the Kumihima off the disc and then the eight strands I've plaited. Do you remember mm -hmm. I do this with with macrame quite often? Yeah. So I've plaited so this one doesn't have any findings, it just ties yeah. at the back of the neck. That's nice. Or you can do a wraparound bracelet if you wanted to as well. But I think the Kumihima endings well, I'll, it, it I'll gives it gives better. you that you know that yeah. that well easier to put on, I suppose. Yes. Much easier yep. to put on. Absolutely. But it does finish them, doesn't yeah, it, beautifully? No, yeah, yeah. So if those tubes of sea beads, how much are they approximately each? So you're looking at the large ones, seven ninety five and four ninety five for the small. Wow, that's amazing. Even the hex beads. Yeah. Really. That's yeah, a good price, pounds. isn't yeah, it? Yeah, really good. Yeah. Okay. We're not even stopping there. The best, the we're not stopping there. No, we're going even lower. <laughs> um, and is this the same across all of the kits then? So can we shop ahead on the others? Yes. You can right. shop ahead on those, everybody. They will be sellouts, though. 49 of each colorway is not going to be enough. I can say that for certain. Um, you get, so let me just say, two, four, six, eight of your bell caps, four of your lobster claws, four of your carriers, um, one of your yeah. um, lobster claw with ends, an extender chain. Um, how many of your, what's that? Two, four, six, eight, ten of your oval jump rings, um, a tube of your six O's, a tube of your galvanized, and a tube of, tube yeah. of your lovely sea foam um, hex beads. All of that, jewelry makers are not even stopping at 29.99. And it's not just Kumihimo, you can use these with your sea beading. Absolutely. Yeah, so this, if, we, if I just turn these over here, so these, again, these are all Kumihi mode, but you've got bell caps there that you can, you can just stop at the end there. Yeah. A glue or, or a melt off your core, so it ends 
with the seed bead tube and then place the bell cap over the seed beads there you if go. you wanted to as well. So you could do that. And they're nice well. and secure, aren't they? Yeah. And again, your, your peyote ropes, yeah. you can, that's yeah, a yeah. really nice way of finishing them. Lovely. So this is going to appeal to multiple yeah, yeah. mediums then. £24.99. <laughs> pence. Hang on, that's, that... that's that's the pack of the findings. It is, own, isn't it? Without a doubt. Didn't yeah. I remember way back when when we had like those because the bell caps used to come in those kind of plastic. Oh Do you yes, remember? that's right. Do you yes. remember those? I yes. used to get the little say, matrix boxes. That's right. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. And weren't they about eight they eight ninety nine or something, something like, like that? that? Yeah. Um, so. right, closer to ten pounds just yeah, for the yeah. bell caps, and you didn't get that many. Yeah, I don't think. Um, so you've got those, those toggles are beautiful. I they said are. you get the carriers. You've got all those different ways of finishing. That's wow. a bargain. Wow. Shop ahead on the other colorways as well, lovely jewelry makers. You get the exact same findings. The only issue is that we only have 49, or had, I should say. Wow. Um, let's move on to the colorway, uh, next colorway. Um, all I need to do, should we go this? This is lovely. Yeah. I think this is my so favorite. I'm using these, I've, I've mixed some of the colors, but this is what I'm doing for the demos. But look at, look, look at that yellow against. So this is the little spark, the little spark plug I've made. So this is, I've made this for the demo to show you later. But that green, so I've got the green and the yellow from this kit, and then yep. I'm taking the blue because I wanted the colds. Yeah, that's beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Vibrant, yeah. vibrant, happy jewellery. Yeah. Um, you know we're not stopping there. So again, just to talk through the colours, you've got silver lined fuchsia atos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're gorgeous, aren't they? Um, is that these? That's those. Yeah, right, the okay. atos. Um, mint green six O's, mm -hmm. um, opaque yellow eleven O's, and then obviously all your findings, findings. which include um, eight of your bell caps, one of your um, lobster claws with the caps as well, an extender chain, ten of your oval jump rings, four carriers, and four toggle class. We need these components, don't we? we? Do. It's something we that do. we could very easily overlook. No, I think after, if you're spending hours making a piece, you need to, you need the proper finish. Yeah, without a doubt. Twenty four ninety nine. Wow, it's pretty good, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. And you think how much, how many pieces of jewelry that's going to make? Well, did you make all of these? So the uh, so there are three pieces from these, and yeah. then all of these are other pieces that I've made using the finding ends, the toggle so clasps, and in, in terms of just the ends alone, you've got yeah. one, two, five three, pieces. four, five. Yeah five pieces yeah. just using the end caps yeah. but then obviously you've got your toggles as well mm -hmm. yeah why do we need oval jump rings so i will when i come to do the demo i'll, I'll show oh. you i'll actually put one together perfect yeah. there you go watch yeah. this space uh, make sure you're checking out love these colors quite festive i think mm. nice little yes. cranberry color yeah, there yeah. Um, very beautiful and then you've got your glowing yellows and you've got your wonderful mint greens in your eight o's are they eight o's or six o's six o's six o's in the six green. o's yeah. um mix the colors together because also i have to say yeah. that looks together really, yeah, yeah that looks really nice together doesn't it mm. uh gorgeous 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 um i'm gonna move to the next colorway and then Oh, this is the most popular. Oh, beautiful. I can see why. Yeah, is this your most popular? They're lovely, aren't they? Is this the one yeah. you would favour? It looks very you. And that's the. Uh, oh, we'll that's take that off lovely. And that's the necklace. Ah, oh, let's bring that over, Mark, because that's there amazing. That is so lovely. And I'll turn it around and show you the finding endings as well. Oh yes. It's gorgeous, isn't it? So, that's, so I've, I've taken two colours of cord because I wanted the uh, the spiral, and then I've done the same. So I've taken the red from the previous kit with the blue to make the spiral. So these sections are kumahimo Or kumahimo Wow. Yep. And then that central section, I've used the pink yep. to make that middle That's section. lovely, that pink. Yeah. yeah. That's proper fuchsia, isn't proper it? Proper fuchsia. Yeah. And then the end? And then the end, if I just turn this round, it's one of the, the toggles. Look. look at that. It just looks so expensive, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does. And, and it finishes yeah, it. Completely finishes yeah. it. Yeah. No, it's lovely. Without having to sort of see the mel melted ends yeah, no, or absolutely. Um, yeah. knotting. Obviously, no. we're not stopping at uh, 49 99 We're going to match that price. I mean, Mark, these. I love Kumahima. I always think the jewellery is so wearable and beautiful. And the fact that you've got that history behind it as well. And also the fact that anybody can do it. Anybody. Any age. No, it's a really nice, simple technique. Twenty-four <laughs> ninety-nine only. Do you know the other day, um, Wednesday, wow. just gone um, in Willow School, they do um, Mindful Wednesday. Aww. So it's nice, isn't it? So they actually have an hour where they can choose whatever they want to do. Um, so um, nice they could idea. do Lego, they could do reading a book or a story, and they could do jewelry making. And Willow chose jewelry making, and she came home with one of those loomed bracelets. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
which um, I was, and you know, this, they sh we should teach mm. them this, shouldn't yeah, we? Yeah, absolutely. I have to get yeah, Mark into really the school. Really affordable. Oh, I'd love that. Would you? Yeah, I'd love oh, that. I'll arrange that then. Yeah, no, I'd be up for that. That'd be amazing. Get yeah. your teaching that, yeah, how yeah. to do Kumahimo. That'd be really good. It'd be great for the kids, yeah. wouldn't it? And also us, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also looking for a Santa if there's one going. Yeah, nobody's. Uh, oh, Chris. Chris. It'd Chris. Make a good Santa. Listen, yeah. I can pad you out, Chris. <laughs> we can provide wadding. I do need a Santa. Um, anyway, <laughs> anyway, these kits are absolutely flying out the door. Well done, everybody. And if you've got any messages for Mark, do uh, text us because we are live here in the studio. When did you start Kumahimo? It was around about the same time as Macrame. I started Kumahimo in when, do you remember we had, um, it was about a year before lovely Prue. Do you remember Prue? I do remember Prue. Prue. The Prue, the Prue Mahimo, Kumahimo Queen. It was about a year before Prue started. And um, I think it was Jenny Cleary who actually introduced Kumahimo. It was her idea to bring it to the was station. It? Yeah, you no, know, she championed it, and uh, well, just, she was just right too. Yeah, she was love it. We don't, we don't see it on the show very often. No, we don't. So it's um, no, we uh, don't. And what's great yeah, is you can yeah. start Kumihimo with like a few quid, really, can't Absolutely. you? It doesn't cost a great deal. No, so you need discs and bobbins and a weight. You can probably get that for fifteen quid. There you and go. And then it's just cords that you yeah. can find. You and you can Kumihimo with absolutely anything. Can you? Anything. Yeah. yeah. So have a look on our yeah. website to get all the essential yeah. Kumihimo yeah. goodies, yeah, yeah. your discs and yeah. your bobbins and your weights, and Mark will talk you through all of that as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. If you think about, it, you start a new hobby. Mm. I don't know. Say you want to start silversmithing, for example. There is quite an outlay initially, yeah. isn't there? Yeah, Whereas Kumihimo, there isn't. No, not at no, all. Absolutely not. No, it's great. Um, great. Take it away, then, Mark. So what I'll are you going to show us? So I'll show you the finding. You're talking about the oval jump rings. Yeah. And I'll explain why it's really important. So. On the top of the bell caps here, you have, if I show Chris, if I can just hold it. So can you see, that's the top of the, the Kumihimo bell cap, okay? You, and you can see the hole, okay? Yes. The, the, the measurement from this side of the, of the top to the other side is quite long, and your, your round jump rings, the, the, um, the, what's the word? The diameter of the jump ring is too round to go through the flat surface in the top of the bell cap there. So if I take one of these little, so I've got one of the, I've got my flat nose pliers and we've got the oval jump ring, okay? Yep. So you'd open it in exactly the same way. You would place it on your bell cap. There we go, through the end. Mm -hmm. Get that through. So you see that goes on because it's the, it, it's got two flat surfaces i see and two, if you're using a round jump ring it wouldn't go through the, the top of your little um i won't say what the proper word is it's a sunday morning um <laughs> on the top of the little bell cap it, it, that's its proper name but i'm not going to say it on air no i but know you can, what you mean you know where I'm going. i know what you mean we and had all, that yeah. predicament didn't we and then all you do then is you just pop on half of your your toggle clasp and then close it up and what I'd recommend doing is whenever you're doing your kumihimo is do your endings first before you start anything. Because what you do at the end of your, let me just bring one across, let's bring this one here. So what you do is when you come to finishing off your kumihimo endings, you actually glue the end of your braid into the bell cap at the end. And once you've done the bell cap, it's quite difficult to do your jump ring attachment with your clasp when this is on, at already attached to your braid. So if you do it, if you do all your findings first, okay. then do your braid Ooh, and then tip. attach, you'll yeah. find it so much easier. There's right. been a couple of times where I've put my bell cap on, I've then put my toggle on and I've, the, the, the end has come off. Right. So just, um, now you can use, I use the glue that's super, I use the glue that's super for everything. I've got shares in that product, I love <laughs> it. So I, I've not got the patience, but um, if you do have a bit more time, then you just use your, um, your epoxy, yeah. red, you know, the pop with the little fine little yeah. nozzle, oh, or your the E6 valves, or the hypo yeah. cement. Any, yeah. But with that, you'll need to let it set for 24 hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't have time to that, so I, I use the, the super glue. Um, but you can see how elegant, as you've mentioned, how it beautifully it finishes it off. It does, it finishes yeah. it off perfectly. Yeah. Um, well, a 24 99 it means you can get all three yeah. kits. That's a lot of, uh, of um, bell caps. Um, all your findings and then also what that mm. would be like nine tubes exactly yeah. nine tubes of Mayuki seed yeah. beads and a nice mixture mm. as well no they're really nice really nice lovely mixture together. of nice your colors amazing so 
what you're going to do for if you're doing you are you are doing the spark plug design okay mm -hmm. so we've these are the bobbins and you get you get packs of eight i'm pretty sure we've got some on the <laughs> on the website yeah so first thing you're going to do is you're going to pop your cord on your bobbins you're going to yep. tie it to that central spool in the center and i, I tend to if i'm doing a kumahimo necklace i tend to do arms length six foot length of each cord oh okay is that yep. enough a little bit more than enough and then you attach it to your bobbins um, once it's on your bobbin, you can do your threading. So for each, I mean, you can do any combination, but it's, this is perfect because we've got the three different sizes for your spark plug. Okay, mm. so you need to decide how many spark plugs you want on your necklace. Mm. So I've done five. Okay. Okay. So I've done five. So for each spark plug, of which I do five, you need this combination. So I've threaded on four elevens, three eights, two sixes, three eights, four elevens. And then you repeat this combination however many times you want to do your little spark plugs. Okay. Okay. So if you want, because I've left, a, I've done a hundred moves on my disc in between the spark plugs to separate them. But if you wanted to, you can just go up and down, up and down, up and down on the whole length okay. of the necklace, which I've done on a few pieces. So you pop on all of your beads onto each of your uh, eight. So this spools. is where you were this saying is, that's a bit. This more is where it's quite time consuming. Okay. Once you've done that you attach them all together and you start doing your eight warp braid. So this is one that I've beaded earlier. So you can see um, we've got our little group of 11s and then our eights and then our sixes. And I think this is this probably the right amount for a spark plug. It's, it's probably two and a half inches long. Mm. Uh, they, they start getting a bit bulky and heavy. Um, but as I said, you can see that I've left. So this is a hundred moves of your braiding. Wow. Then I've done a spark plug, then a hundred moves. Okay, so they are, it is yeah, quite time consuming, yeah, but, but, but enjoyable. It, it really enjoyable, yeah. So what I've done is I'm using two colors of cord. I'm using a green and, I'm using a green and a red, because I like that. I thought it'd go a bit, bit festive. Okay, so I've done my moves. So all you do to do your adding of your beads is you, is, um, should I do a couple of moves? Yes. So we've got our disc set up, and I said, this is your basic eight warp kumihimo so what we're going to do is you're, you're going to when you start doing your kumihimo you have your so you separate your eight chords into groups of two you put one chord either side of north east south and west so you have your eight chords and all we're going to do is, is obviously I've been doing some so the numbers have moved yeah is we're going to pick up this do you is start the, at north south yeah. east and west yeah, yeah. right so okay. I start at south to north and then so right. what you would do is you would, this is this is why I think Willow would love this yeah okay so we're going to take bottom left across to top left so we have one at the bottom and three at the right you can't have three and one you always have to have groups of two so you need to replace top right with bottom right and then you're going to turn your disc either clockwise or anti-clockwise 90 degrees but you have to continually go in that direction right if you start going the other way you're just going to unpick right. the work that you've made turn the disc bottom left to top left top right to bottom right turn. turn the disc and that is it top to bottom turn the disc bottom left top left top right bottom right and that that is it I mean there are so many different combinations and as I said I'm using eight threads you can use up to 32 for more elaborate goodness designs. me I don't think I could get my head around that many but top to bottom turn the disc and that is it okay so we've threaded on our beads so to, to add your beads to your kumihima all we're going to do is do exactly that same move but we're going to drop the first bead down so can you see we've got two vertical cords yeah sets that's the green and then we've got the horizontal which are the reds okay so you're going to drop your bead you're going to hook it underneath the horizontal and mayuki are brilliant for this because they're slightly flat on the top and the bottom and then you pop in your cord Take the top cord, slide our bead down, got two there, hook it underneath, take it across, turn the disc, pick up our next cord, drop the bead, place underneath. You see it, it hooks underneath, it, it, gets, it gets captured yeah. in effect. I'm going to take our next bead, drop it down, turn the disc. So you're going to repeat this until you've got all of your beads used up and as I said you've got your 11s you've got your 8s you've got your 6s you don't have to do all three you can do 11s and 8s you can do 8s and 6s if you want to 
but it's exactly the same technique. Drop it and bring and it you across. And you need the weight at the bottom for tension, is that right? Yeah, so at the moment it's quite light, so mm. it, it'll stay on near to your disc. So the reason that we've got the weight is to drag it down to keep the tension yeah. nice and firm. What you'll probably find after three or four of your um, beaded sections, it'll be quite weighty and you can take off the weight if right, you want okay. to. But uh, it depends how you're working. And then we're going to turn the disc. And that's all you're going to do. Is you're just so when you put this going. down, how do you know where to start again? So this is so, so simple. So if I just drop that, so I'm happily doing my Kumihimo and there's a knock at the door and it's DPD with my next jewelry maker kits. Yeah. So all you're going to do, so you remember, because it's really important you come back to exactly the same spot, is you're going to take your cord, you're going to drop your bead, okay, and then you're going to leave it, and then you're going to put your disc down. There you go. So you've got three cords and you've got one cord, so you know when you come back. So you start with that one. You start that one and you bring it across. There you go. And then carry on. That's important, isn't That's it? That's really important. Yeah. Yeah. Because if, if you, be it, especially when you're doing two colours, because you, you'll see the spiral, if there's a mistake, you'll see it a uh. mile away on the spiral. Okay. And then, so you're going to do all your beaded section, and then as I've done on, on here, I've done a hundred moves without the beads, and then I've done the next group of beads, hundred beads, then the next group, and then if I bring a completed, this one here, you'll see that, if I show Chris, so the beginning of my braid, I did 500 moves, and that's just your basic, I think that's about four inches. And a move is one 360, yeah? No, a move is bottom to top, that's right, a move, okay. top to bottom. Okay? Right, okay. So that's my, um, that's my braid, and then I've done exactly what I've just shown you. So we've got our four, three, two. So even just with two sixes, you get four rows. Yeah. So you get a nice little section then 100 moves, then your beaded section, 100 moves, etc., And then right at the end, once you've done your last section, again, you repeat your 100 moves. And then hopefully, it should be nice and symmetrical. Ah, lovely. Which that is, so it's, it's perfect. Yeah, and I love then, a bit yeah, of Kumihimo. Yeah. And then, um, as I said, um, at the end, all I've done is, is I've cut the ends and then used a bit of the glue that's super, just a drop, you only need one drop, into the bell cap, mm. not on the end of your kumahimo. Okay. Does and it then, soak it up? Yeah. Mm. And then put and then push the kumahimo end up into the bell cap. Hold for ten seconds, and then. Um, but as I said, my biggest top tip would be to do your put your clasp on with your jump rings and your bell caps before you place them onto your before kumahimo. You before you start. Do you know we have hobby starter? Yes. After jewelry maker yes. in the afternoon. Well, I've done two hour long shows all about kumahimo, one without beads and one with beads, starting, finishing, how to do your braids and things. So so always keep an eye on the hobby starter straight after the jewellery maker as well. Oh, there so, we go, so top tips. And a lot of our components well. will be on our website they as were, well, won't yes, they? Absolutely. So yes. you basically so, um, need disc bobbin and weight. Yeah. So if I quickly show you this. That's gorgeous, Mark. So this is without gaps. So I this is using 8 so I've got a, a white 8 a blue 8 then your six, and then all I've done is I've, I've not left the 100 moves in between. It's just a continuous rope all the way around. And again, I've used a bit of braid at the end to put the end toggle on, but you don't have to. Because of the bell cap sizes, you can place that straight over straight the end the top, yeah. of your beading if you want a nicer, neater finish. Fabulous. Thank you, Mark. Pleasure. That's wonderful. And Pleasure. I suppose, you know, I don't know, it might be a bit more substantial, but could I incorporate the mermaid courts? You could indeed. Into your you could. Uh, into yeah, your yeah, you I think that would work as well, yeah, wouldn't it? Be amazing. Um, yeah. make sure you check yeah, out your yes, baskets yeah. on those lovely jewellery makers. There was quite a limited nine o'clock kit I know, hour, wasn't not it? Not very many at all. Um, not many at all. Um, well done. And what are we looking at right now? What's on the screen? Thread thread bobbins, there you go. So for your Kumihima. Oh, there we so, go. Perfect. Um, and you get, these are obviously reusable. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And you don't, you don't, and you don't have to use them for Kumihima as well. Lots of our viewers buy them to store their sterling silver chain. Good call. They could, because they can wrap a meter around the bobbin and pop yeah. in an anti-tarnish. Yeah. Close the bobbins up, but the bobbins are. I just love the bobbins. They're nice and soft, aren't they're, they? They're yeah. really good. Yeah. So as then you, you you thread your cord to the middle of the spool and then just pop it closed, and it keeps everything nice. And if you imagine eight long threads, mm. they get tangled very quickly. Very quickly. So it, your bobbins yeah. prevent that, don't they? Yeah. This is probably one of my top three products. Oh, twelve ninety nine as well. Um, How many did you get yeah, there? A pack eight, of what? Eight. Pack of eight. Wow. So you can okay. do so you can do all your eight. Oh, boards. it's not your price. No. 
You'll be amazed at this. Really? Yeah. Even though they're, like I said, they're not single use, use these over and over, over, and, over and over again. again. And this yeah, is yeah. going to appeal to um, other hobbies, yeah. aren't they? Go out for 4 99 Four ninety nine. I definitely recommend getting three lots of these, so because you, you can work on different projects at the same yeah. time. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, five. Or so am I right bobbins. in saying crochet would use bobbins? Oh, I don't know. I suppose if you wanted to transfer a smaller amount of thread maybe. off of a bigger spool, maybe, maybe you could. Yeah, maybe. absolutely. Yeah, um, yeah four ninety nine. Goodness yeah. me, and I can't remember the last time we actually had bobbins. It's been Here a long, are. long oh, time, hasn't it? Yeah. Oh, there they are. Thank you, oh, Lauren. Yeah, they're the ones I'm using. Bobbies. For my demos. Bobbies. No tangle yeah. thread bobbins. There we go. There you go. Yeah. Perfect. No, um, it says ideal for macrame and kumahima braiding. Yep. Uh, uh, patented, sorry, patented protective uh, locking feature prevents threads from unraveling. Yep. Yep. Uh, stackable, pliable, and translucent. Secure loose mm. ends and prevent tangles. Available in three different sizes. Amazing. Amazing. And the actual photograph just here, look, yeah. is Kumahimo. You can yeah, see it just there. I love them. They are a must, aren't they? Yeah. I, don't think, I don't think you can successfully Kumahimo without them. No, because you'd be forever, forever mm. un yeah, untangling right everything, there. wouldn't you? Yeah. Um, 4 99 everybody, wow. to get hold of those. The phone lines have absolutely lit up. Clearly, I've you need weights. your bobbins. Amazing. Um, so, yeah, we need... Have we... Oh, sorry. I've just knocked over all the findings. Um, have we got everything to start, Roscoe? As in, because I can see the weight here, yeah, and we got the bobbies, so just add Kumihimo disc, have a little look on our website for it, so the weight, that's coming up as well. Um, that's a good idea with the silver though, storing yeah, the silver. it's a brilliant idea. Oh, your headphones, you know, your cable from oh, your headphones. Yes. <laughs> do you know what, I could so yeah. do with that, because yeah. I've always got like wires. Yeah, they're really good That's, for We for should use these in the studio. Headphones. Yeah, for your headphone cords and things. And yeah. Your leads. Yeah, they're brilliant. That's a genius mm. idea. Mm. And what about yeah. tidying up? <gasps> Oh no, you're on a roll now. Uh, no, you, Go yeah, on then. You've given me ideas yeah. now. Yeah. What about your like uh, all your your cords, your plugs? Yeah, yeah. Things like behind your, your telly. Behind we your telly. We hate cords. So we do hate I. Seeing leads. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you could use it for those, couldn't you? USB cables. USB and all that cable. Stuff. Yeah. Your mobile yeah. phone cords. It's always too long, isn't it? And yeah. I have to tuck mine yeah. up because otherwise the cats chew it. Mm. So yeah. yeah. Brilliant um, They're ace. I love them. Oh, I might have to get some for that reason. Yeah. Okay, let's do the weight. Do your weight. So there are two sorts of weights. This is the one that I just picked up for my demo. This one is 50 grams with a crocodile clip. Okay, so all you would do if I take it off is you, you would tie your knot with all of your cords mm -hmm. and you place your crocodile clip over. So this style, what you would do is before you tied your knot completely, you would place one of these, if I can take that off. Yeah, please do. So you'd place one end and then you would knot it. So you would knot it to the yeah. weight. Okay. And that's your, your weight. And that gives you that, yeah, that, 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 gives that, you the, that tension. That gives you the tension that you need. Perfect. Yeah, the there great. we go. So this is yeah. our artistic wire, I think it is. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, no, it's and brilliant. again, it's uh, it's reusable. You're not going to oh. have to buy. No, you just need it to buy it It lasts years, once. don't they? Yeah. Just buy it um, once. Yeah. Amazing. So again, use this alongside um, your Kumahimo disc, bobbins, and obviously you need your cords. Yeah. Well, Four pounds. Four pounds, yeah. Three it's nine, one of these nine. items that you don't realise you need and, until you get it. That make, is that the same? Yeah, no, I yeah. yeah, yeah, I can understand that because if you yeah. do, if you if you're braiding and it has different tensions, it's visible, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Because like, in in, when we first did Kumahima, we couldn't get hold of weights. So what we used to do is, you know, the little black organza bags we used to get in our kits back yeah. in the day. Fill one of those with either pebbles or a gem bead scoop or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that was far too heavy and it would stretch it. Yes. And so. These, these, you these need are to have the perfect made, tension. They're the right weight. Yeah, yeah and you, also you, it's not yeah. in your way. Because you can get 50 gram and 100 gram, but I've, I've always thought that 50 gram is just the perfect, Ample. perfect size. Ample. Yeah, yeah. Um, again, lots of getting involved. I don't often mm. see these on our screens either. Oh, so ever. Yeah. Ideal hour, isn't mm. it? Just to get uh, to, to get started yeah. with your Kumihimo. Amazing. And yeah. the fact that you, it's one for the whole family. Yeah. One Brilliant. for the whole family. Um, but we've still got loads to bring you. We're going to melt the phone lines on your deal of the day, lovely jewellery makers. We've Aww. got your uh, beautiful collections of shepherd hooks mm. coming up in both the yellow, rose and also the silver. We've got lovely chains to bring you as well. Um, very decorative chains. More necklaces, I'm going to say. Um, jewellery boxes. Oh, I we've love those little, um, those little the, the travel boxes. boxes. I love them. Yeah, yeah, they're amazing, aren't they? Um, so we've got both of those. We've got a, the 
the final quantity of the advent which was only launched yesterday so if, if you weren't able to tune in yesterday um, for the launch of that unbelievable price point on your advent this year the mm. best one yet um, and we've also got your your famous bag we have the famous yes. bag masterclass yeah. though jewelry yeah. makers how can i not mention this it is back by very popular demand it had to be reordered it's been what 18 months 18 months 18 months yeah. mermaid courts and you get 10 strands i know i know in the whole rainbow so you get five hots five coals just love it i love I your alhambra as well that's yeah. amazing amazing so yeah. that's happening at 12 o'clock be prepared for that to melt the phone lines everybody good job we've got 140 of them i still think oh. they'll sell out though yeah. I still think they will uh, don't go anywhere join mark and i after this <laughs> I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's next gem. My favourite gemstone is opal. I love the colour play and the iridescence. I'd like to win Britain's next gem so I can share the knowledge and teach the things that I wish someone had taught me in the beginning. Jewellery makers, head over to the website for our biggest web sale ever. We have over 2,000 lines with up to 80% off. So head over to www.jewelrymaker.com for our Bling It Back web exclusive sale and grab them deals before they disappear. I'm Carol and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is solid silver. I'm a silversmith. I want to win Britain's Next Gem because jewellery making and jewellery teaching brings me so much joy and I want to share that joy with other people. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Back by popular demand, introducing the one, the only, Gemporia Festive Ball. Party with your favourite presenters from Gems TV, Hobby Maker, Jewelry Maker and Sewing Street. We're all together for a night that's going to be the talk of the town. Situated at the fabulous Stratford Manor, close to the world famous Stratford-upon-Avon. Tickets are just £99 per person, including a welcome drink, a three-course dinner, half a bottle of wine and music that'll have you dancing all night long. There'll also be a shop at the party, and even a tombola, if you're feeling lucky. Numbers are limited, so order your tickets today to avoid disappointment. Let's make it a night to remember at the Gemporia Festive Ball on Saturday the 25th of November. See you there. Hi, I'm Ellie and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is wire work. I love wrapping, I love counting. It soothes my soul being able to wire wrap with crystals. <laughs> I would love to win Britain's Next Gem. Um, it's basically something, doing something like this is, some, is like a dream for me. Being able to present and teach and do this is, yeah, it would be a dream come true to win this.
Welcome back, everybody. I love Sundays. It's good. I love Sundays. Oh, I've lost actually. my puppy. Oh no! I've just realised. It's around somewhere. We'll find another. We have a yeah, box. We have a box. We have a box. Yes. Now, I always think here at Jewelry Maker, we give you such a, a, a wide menu of item opportunities, don't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. Bring your gemstones. Yep. Bring your storage, tools, and sometimes you know your findings are kind of like sort of put in around those yeah, components aren't like an they? afterthought aren't they yeah it's a they shame. are it it's is a shame, shame because yeah. a finding can be so integral mm. as we've just discussed I'll really just, yeah, to the to the completion um to the completion of uh of your piece of jewelry so um it, it gives you that professional finish doesn't it and a shepherd hook you know yes you can have your fairly generic almost like coat hanger ones mm. that kind of yeah, wrap yeah. around yeah, yeah. um or you can have um you can have ones which are Far more detailed, far more embellished, far more, uh, um, I don't know, luxurious, I think would mm. be the word that I would use to describe these. And that's what this deal of the day actually is. Um, you don't just get one pair of shepherd hooks, you actually get three, and they're three different they're designs. They're so yeah, pretty. Yeah, you know, if, uh, pearl drop earrings, let's use that. I only say it because mm. I've just seen on gems some pearl drop earrings. Um, you know, you can have your plain shepherd hook and that's fine, you know, they're functional, aren't they? But when you've actually got, say, um, they're in, encrusted with further gemstones, which these are, these are zircon. Mm, yeah. So not cubic zirconia, they're genuine zircon. Um, and you've got like lovely little motifs on them, which I'm going to show you in a few seconds. So they're all available on pre-order jewellery makers, but um, in terms of quantity, let me just double check this. You've mm. got, okay, you've got 50 of the rose, you've got 100 of the gold, and you've got 150 of the silver. But they're integral, aren't they? Because they're all available on pre-order, so you can shop ahead on each of those, and I can guarantee a true deal of the day price tag. But yeah, you know, it, it does. it's so important. And I think it might have, I can't remember who it was that messaged in um, to the studio that said, we need a 50 50 split oh yes that's you right you know we need yeah. you need the gemstones text in if you're watching right now we need the gemstones but we need as many findings as we mm. do the gemstones no, no, too absolutely. because otherwise we're kind of trying to making we're making jewelry with much more or well, with limitations mm. i think that's fair yeah. um so we're going to start with the rose gold it's the most limited of all of these and i'll talk you through show you each um each of the designs oh. they're stunning aren't they like I said, luxury would be the term that I would actually use to uh, to describe these. I mean, look at those as a pair of earrings. It's attention to detail for me, that little flick at yeah. the end of the tail there. I mean, it's such a little thing, but it's so helpful. Well, it helps put them in. It helps put them in. It also helps stopping them falling out. Stopping them falling <laughs> out, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, look um, at these. Look how gorgeous they are. And it becomes part of the design. Why, you know, why wouldn't we want to decorate Oh, the finding that. they're genuine zircons that are set within so you're in three sets i can tell you as well the wire is nice and thick um so you're not going to put them through your ear they're not going to buckle and bend the moment you've tried you've worn them once um you've got that investment of precious metal within these so they are sort of uh, uh, sorry this my ocd is just driving me crazy i have to turn that one around there we are um uh yeah, they are going to, they, you know, they're, they are made to last, if you like. So they're a definite luxurious shepherd hook, um, I would say. Um, already they're going on pre-order and we've already got people, uh, people multi-buying. First price crash jewelry makers, because what can we say? And like I said, in preparation for the show, I can, t I can chew your ear off about gemstones. And I know our designers can you know, absolutely educate you on all of your tools and your essentials. But um, what do you say about shepherd hooks? They're needed, they are needed, but this is a level of luxury um, in your shepherd hook, in the fact that you have actually got um, your genuine zircon in there as well. 29.99, that's 10 pound per pair. Amazing. That's amazing, isn't it? I've got my eye on the butterflies yeah. because I'm imagining if you put on maybe just a drop of five or six 
two, three millimetres of microfaceted. They oh, turn lovely. them into dragonflies. Ah, beautiful. Mm. I, I That's a that nice idea. idea. They're gorgeous, aren't they? That's a lovely idea. And what you might yeah. not see on the recording is there's a very uh, strategically placed loop. Yes. So it's kind of hidden behind mm. um, that detail. Miss Janet, hello to you. Same beautiful ear hooks. Perfect Christmas presents for yeah. snowflakes. Lovely. Oh, yes. Lovely. That's a lovely idea. And they'll work with everything, mm. won't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Work with everything. All your techniques. You could kiss cross from these if you Absolutely. wanted to. Yeah. You could just yeah. wrap loop directly onto them if you wanted to. You could remove the loop mm. and wear them as is, couldn't you? Oh. You could it literally just wear them without that loop, cut that up off, maybe give it a little... Uh, is little it an open loop, like a jump ring? Oh, I don't know. You might need to ask. Yes, it is. Is it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, so, perfect. But hang on. £20 for all three pairs. Oh, I no. would wear these on their own. Wow. I think they would look absolutely amazing on their own. Nineteen ninety nine. Look how pretty they are. Oh, yeah. So that's so we're talking six pounds sixty six pence per pair of earrings. They're not cubic zirconia, folks. These are genuine zircon. Look how gorgeous they are. Do they look six pounds sixty six? No. <laughs> Definitely not. I mean, imagine those are like a big fireball pearl or something like that underneath. Or some of your type A jadeite from the first hour. Or maybe a section of Mark's amazing kiss cross underneath. How beautiful. And it's that level of elevation, isn't it? There is nothing wrong that, for, that a, you know, a generic shepherd hook. They've absolutely got their place. I truly believe that. But this is for that something special. Mm -hmm. Maybe in the gemstone or the design, the technique, whatever it might be. It's taking it to that next level. These are my favourite. I like these are lovely kind of like floral well, lovely, detail at the top. A lot of stones on them. There are. Yeah. Full of luster, aren't oh, they? Look. 1999, the phone lines have lit up. The rose gold is the most limited maker in Devon's got two, Meath has got two, Jennifer Dawn, Vivian, Sharon's got two, Lorna's got two, Miss Janet, Elaine, Sarah, hello to you, Susan, Teresa, Jacqueline, Carol, Lynn, Karen, Carol, Carol, Maker, Five. <gasps> There's loads of you there. I can't read everyone's wow. names. Um, make sure you are, check it. <coughs> oh, excuse me, sorry. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> um, excuse me. I felt I felt that one coming. I was like, I can't, I can't stop it. <laughs> um, Six sixty six, amazing. Shall we move oh, into the next colourway so you can actually sort of shop alongside? Flying on pre-order, says Roscoe. Look at those. And you know where they're going. I mean, we must <laughs> never assume, never make assumptions, because you know I might be wrong. We'll do it in one price crash. No dilly dallying. Oh, they're gorgeous. I need to get some of these. Oops. Here we go. There's a lot of silver, isn't there? As there well. is. You yeah. can feel the weight yes. in them as well. Yeah. Not too heavy, so that they're going to be uh, uncomfortable, of course, within the year. But yeah, enough of an investment to, to, to absolutely um, say that these are solid. They're quality made. Um, yeah. Now for the yellow gold plated 925 sterling silver. In 38 seconds, we're doing it in one price crash. They're beautiful, aren't they? You obviously know anything like I love the design, they're quite an art deco design, aren't they? The, the, the leaf with yeah. the little, little diagonal. That's lovely. The kind of intersection, mm, yeah. cross section, and then genuine zircon encrusted within. Um, straight into the gold plated, and I can tell you these are flying. I have how many? Was it about 100? 100 of the gold. Wow. It's all down to your personal preference. We're guaranteeing deal of the day price tag. Already half the stock has gone on these. You can't beat gold and zircon, can you? No. You really can't. Well, look how expensive they are. Yeah, yeah. They look. They look. It's not an expensive no. price tag, is it? But they, they look amazing be. on the top of those um, zircon and I think a little kiss cross oh. earrings I made you. Yes. With, the, with that little snowflake flower on the I top. I wear those look amazing. a lot. Do you? Yeah, well, if ever I go anywhere, yeah. then chances are, and I'm looking for a drop mm. earring, I'll wear mm. your, the ones that you made oh. me. Yeah, it's just like an inch, isn't it? Yeah, of micro right. kiss cross and yeah. zircon. Yeah, perfectly complemented. Mm. The phone lines of the web have gone absolutely crazy. Um, yeah, if it was you that, that messaged into the studio that was saying, look, we absolutely need the gemstones. Of course we do, but we also need the findings. And this is a luxury finding. Um, you know, like we discussed the other day, we were saying that the, the bolt rings have their place, but when you actually start looking at your decorative toggles mm -hmm. and yeah, yeah. Um, clasp like that it's or, or the ones we had as an early bird yesterday in fact these were going great with they the would. early bird that we had they yesterday yeah. Yeah. Um, it's taking it to another level isn't it and it's really giving that um, finish to your designs your piece of jewelry you know artisanal made jewelry doesn't doesn't have to be um, less a luxury no and each of those stones has been individually but are they prongs are they little prongs are they looks all? like it yeah 
they've all been individually set as well. So it's all that work that's involved making them. Stunning. 1999. I'd expect to pay wow. that for one pair. For one, yeah. one pair. Look at the phone lines though. Lots of you stocking oh up threes, twos, fours. I'm not surprised. Um, well done. If, uh, if there is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, do bear with our call centre. They will get to you, I promise. They are amazing. Um, and you're in the right place for to pre-order on your silver. Would you get all three colours? Absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Have you got certain gemstones that you'd put with rose, certain gemstones you'd put with yellow? Oh, I like big pearls in all of them. Yeah. I think they'd all work, couldn't they? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Hi, Catherine in Bristol oh. saying the leaf design is a mirror image, um, which is a true sign of quality and thought, oh. in, uh, thought in the design. Fabulous. Oh, well that's true, spotted. Actually, yeah. yeah, that's a lovely idea. So when you I wear it, they're going to, yeah. 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 Well spotted, because normally they'll all lean That's to right. one direction or to the other. Good point. Good point. I've not spotted are. that, yes. Catherine. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Amazing. Quite attention to detail. Proper so. attention to yeah. detail. Even down to the loop at the bottom, which you can you can use your cords directly onto that. Doesn't Absolutely. have to be wrap loops no, no, and head no, pins, does no, it? No, no. Um, you know, there's a there's an investment of your nine two five sterling silver. There's a real thickness to it. Well done, everybody. Again, they're absolutely flying, and I think there's going to be lots of people who decide to get um, all three of the colours. We had over <laughs> half have uh, gone on pre-order of what now? The silver. Yeah, oh, I'm yeah, not surprised. Yeah. <laughs> shall I leave? Shall I put these behind, or shall I pivot? Pivot. Of it. <laughs> there we are. Oh, oh yeah. Um, here we go. One, two. God, that's icy white zircon, isn't it? Yeah, that's look, look how crisp there. that luster is as well. Here we go. Oh, Adam's loving the silver. Yeah. I can, I can, I can feel Mark nodding next to me. You both loving the silver? Love these. I don't know, it's hard, it's a hard, it's a hard choice. The silver does look lovely. I would be getting all of them to be truthful because A, they're a great price tag, but there are certain occasions when I would gravitate towards a silver, a rose or a yellow gold. Mm. Look at that, look at the brightness of them. My goodness me, shows you the quality of the zircon that's encrusted within. 20 pound. We've got the biggest quantity of these. The phone lines have gone crazy. Oh. And I'm seeing quantities of fours and fives being shopped on these. It's rare for us to bring you essentially a finding as a deal of the day. Um, but more so, uh, this is a luxurious finding. So I do get why it's got that status. Um, yeah, like I said, we've all got shepherd hooks within our stash, haven't we? We've all got um, probably just your generic stud earrings, but this is for you're really special pieces i'm gonna say yeah, gorgeous, when you look because because they are effectively they could be earrings as is could imagine they? the number of shepherd hooks that i've used over, over the, the years. 12 years must be thousands how many pieces of jewelry be. do you think you've created over, so I over do, the 12 I, years so I, I, in an average year i do 12 kits mm. a month and obviously there's multiples of and you make kits. a lot of jewelry so i reckon you're probably yeah, 10 pieces average a kit. Maybe two of those are earrings, so that's six, six, thirty-six. That's 36 pair of earrings each month. Wow. At least. Yeah, so you, it does work I out. I tell you a what, lot. I hope you've got your loft boarded. <laughs> Have you got your loft boarded? My, yeah. Where'd you put it all? In, in my room, I've got, I mean, it's ridiculous. It's overtaking our lives. And ever since I've joined Jewelry Maker, I've not got rid of anything, I've kept every single piece. Wow. One day, one day you should do mm, go back to your yeah. craft. For, you won't need to make a yeah, single piece. You no, can just sell everything that you've made on air. 17, wow. wait, 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 wait. 17 99 Six pound a pair. Is That's that right, wow. Ross? Yeah, wow. Is that what it is? Six pound? Of course That's it is. Crazy. Six pound per pair. Okay, we had 150 of these. Had. Past tense about 45 of them left. So Chris very kindly was just offering me a tea bar. I think they'll have sold out by the time oh, I put them on there. Yes. That's the thing. Look how beautiful and shows you the quality yeah. of the zircon as well. Not zirconia is a very big difference. Cubic zirconia is man-made. Zircon is mother nature made. So if you put these in your ear without anything, they'd be quite static, wouldn't they? But as soon as you've got a weight or a pearl or something on the bottom, yeah. acting like a pendulum, those zircon are just gonna come alive, aren't they? Oh, gorgeous. Mm absolutely gorgeous so you know we said earlier on about the difference between a drop and a dangle oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. you're gonna tell us so yeah. this 
would be classed as a drop. Okay. Because it's just below the lobe. Right. Whereas a dang as soon as you put something on it, I don't know, actually, that could be a dangle. So if it was closer to my earlobe, that would be a drop. If it was a bit, as soon as you put something on it, that's a dangle. That's the difference. There you oh, go. Yeah. <laughs> I, I spent an hour last night reading about these kind of things. And then I was like, you know what? I'm not going to bother putting it in a PowerPoint because um, I don't think you need mm. it. I think you know, you recognize that these are components that we're all going mm. to use. I wonder in history, whatever whatever went through someone's mind to actually pierce your well, ear. Well, that's what I was reading about historically. Yeah. It dates back thousands of mm. years. And there was a guy called Ot Oti, I think it was. Right. They called him Oti, um, that had been perfectly mummified. Um, so um, thousands of years old. And he had pierced, pierced ears. ears. So oh. yeah, it goes goes oh, back yeah. thousands upon thousands upon thousands of it's years. Amazing, but it? at one point, we fell out of love of earrings. Mm. Fell out of love of earrings and then it came back, you know, the re Renaissance. So there was a period of time. But other than that mm. short spell, earrings have always been one of the most popular, yeah. haven't they? Yeah. Um, and oh. bringing it to today, it, it's, it's, it's one of the most frequently changed pieces of jewellery. That's true, yes. You know, we change our earrings more than any other piece. I think, uh, have they pretty much sold out then? That's amazing. Oh, they've gone. Okay, oh, well definite, done. definite gone. Well done, everybody. Amazing. So Have a look, look, keep an eye on the other colours. Time um, to pack them. Oh, bless you. Thank you very much. I get to have another <laughs> look. So helpful assistant. <laughs> We've also got some lovely necklaces to bring you, um, but I want to bring Mark's. Got to be one of your favourite auctions. Oh my word! One of my favourites this year. In a long, I've got it just down here. Have you? It hasn't left my side. I did wonder where it disappeared to. So, so you said oh. earlier on, with all that jewellery that you've made, um, storage is oh. really crucial, isn't it? <laughs> you know me and my storage. I absolutely. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, just before we get into it, you know the the other ones that we showed earlier. Oh, These ones. I want those. Oh, I mean, really want those. These are all on pre-order, so they're lovely little jewellery boxes. In fact, we've got a little mini storage run. I want three uh, of these. I know exactly who I'd get them for as well. I just think they're so lovely. Aren't they? So you get little rings and then a little thing for your necklace oh, or your bracelet. They're oh, so nice they? beautiful. They're gorgeous. So nice. Just having one on your windowsill in your kitchen. Do you take yeah. your rings off when you wash up and... Sometimes. 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 Like Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes not all the time. Because lots of people do, don't they? Just yeah. to be able to put your rings somewhere safe while you're doing the washing I'm up. I'm more or... concerned about it disappearing down the plug yeah, hole, exactly. to be honest. Yeah, but yeah. Um, yes, yeah. Uh, but uh, you know, if you go Gorgeous. away or something like that yeah. on holiday, you don't want to take your old jewellery box, do you? So um, lovely colour, this one. So yeah. this is like an emerald yeah. green. And let me get the pink one out as well. Um, and they come boxed. You know it's posh when it's yeah. a box in a box. I walked past Heinz uh, Jewelers yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, fairly generic. I mm. think we'd all agree. Yeah, yeah. I think by his own admission, it's an affordable jewelry mm. brand, yeah, yeah. Um, which is great. Um, and they have like a window of, of, of jewelry boxes. They're so expensive jewelry mm. boxes, so expensive. Plus you've got so um, plus you've got these, which genius. Yes, they're lovely, aren't they? Even or, the top and the, the top lid slides off as well, so you've got another one. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, you got that. And another one. And another, uh, yeah. another one. And another one. Yeah. There they're you go. Brilliant. Oh, look. All lined as well. Yeah. All lined, so you it's not And I've got all oh, these are nice. Oh, you don't know about these, do you? No. Lindsay and Scott did a deal with these the other day. You will not believe where we're going to. I might these. have to get some of those. You will All on pre-order right now, really? Yep. Oh, yep. See, I mean, I'm already shopping, but they're going to be added mm -hmm. to my order, aren't they? Yeah. Right, let's start with this. Yeah. Mark, um, you launched the original, which was half. Which was half layer, half so it had height. 60 tubes. Okay. So we did we did two on the launch. We, we had a smaller version of this, which has had 60 of the tubes. And then we had another same size, which had 30 tubes yeah. and 30 of the little Tic Tac boxes. Yeah, I remember those. Um, those are the two. This is the first time we've ever bought, I love this so much. This is the first time we've ever bought 120 tubes, double layered. Even the bag on its own we love, don't we? Yes, the, way it's the quality, made, the quality of it. it's just I wonder, beautiful. if I lay that down just there, yeah, Look, there you get go. so you get another layer here. You've yep. got this compartment for you to put I don't know, whatever you want, tools, yep. whatever. And patterns. each of these little tubes, as I mentioned, are beautifully screw capped. Yeah. And each of these tubes holds just under a full tube of your seed beads. 
So uh, Ross has got a picture that of the one that, um, that I've got at home that I store my Super Duos in. Mm -hmm. So it's absolutely perfect. Look at love that. It. And as you can it. see, it's all laid out perfectly. Yep. They're not sort of piled on top no, of one so another. So you can use this for your seed beads. Yeah. Uh, and you can use this for all your findings. If you're into diamond art, if you've yeah. got the diamond art drills yep. at home, this is absolutely perfect storage for this. And as I said, you've got two layers. The box is so well made. We were talking we were talking about the handle, which is a really, again, another nerdy. Oh, we, need, but we, we love definitely it. need to get out more, yeah. Mark. It's you and ergonomic I. handle. It, it pops into the bag. Yeah. So Let for, me show for, you. For storage, it's just beautiful. Nice sound and zip. Ready? Yeah. And you can stand on this bag it's that strong i've stood on it and it's brilliant here yeah. you go but you can see oh, the, the handle it disappears yeah Nick. ready lifts up lifts up clicks like an attache case oh, that's a good word it's attache yeah attache. it's a, a, yeah it's a quality and i can't emphasize that enough. this no. is this is probably the most luxurious case that we've no, actually had really holds good. loads findings you can put all your findings in here all as well them. couldn't you absolutely yes um, it's, it's, it's tall enough to put your head pins in yep yeah. And all your, your your shepherd's hooks, all of your your head pins, your yeah, eye pins. Yeah, your deal of the day that you've just clasps. had there. Now yeah. we launched this. When was it? Last week? Last Tuesday. 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 Monday or Tuesday? Last oh, Monday. Monday. There you go. Monday. Last Monday. Yeah. Absolutely flew. Did We've got you. the last remaining quantity of them. Exactly. Oh, oh, there amazing. we go. We've got a third of the stock Brilliant. left. So um, if you weren't able to tune in, maybe you were um, working that Monday morning, then um, here's mm. your chance to get hold of it. I've got a message into the studio from Mandy. Got two of these the other day oh. for my diamond painting. Perfect. Um, They're amazing storage. So sturdy and the lids on the pots are very tight. Highly recommend. Because yep. I actually asked that question. Um, uh, Mandy, thank you so much yeah. for messaging in. Um, because it's all very good. Good, well, well and good us getting excited mm. about them when it comes from a viewer that's Absolutely. watching as we speak. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But as a sea beader, how many of you have encountered the fact that your lids come off? Yep. Or you've got the little, you know, you've got half a tube of this and a third of a tube of that. And, and it just take, that does take up a lot of room. Yeah, I bet. Of, and if and we worked out, do you remember on the show, we worked out that you can get a full 38 centimetre strand. Yes, six of mil. Two, four, six yeah. mil in each of these as well. So, so it'll if you hold want, your strands. It'll hold the whole 38 centimetre strand of up to your six mil round. Again, they take a lot of there. space, don't yeah, yeah, they? they do. yeah. So, and you can see it visually, Absolutely. you know, it's really important yeah. to be organised if you're no. creating because no. um, you don't want it to hinder no, um, your lovely. creativity. Now we have the final third of stock jewellery makers. This is going to appeal to not just jewellery makers, I bet our hobby, uh, our hobby oh, yes. um, friends next door. Yeah. All your glitters, all your sequins, yes. all of your little, little faffy things. Your yeah. little faffy, faffy things. things I call them. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Absolutely, and the lid is secure. Yeah. Um, well, we could stop here. It's a quality storage bag. You know, think about the prices yeah, of suitcases amazing. and briefcases oh, and things. That's effectively it's great. what it is. Yeah. You've got a nice solid, nice solid box. Um, <laughs> um, I think it's going to appeal to lots of you know nail technicians. Mm. Yeah, brilliant idea. Work with that. Yeah. Model I mean, you could, makers. You could, if you were if you were collecting all of our pearls, you know our South Sea pearls, you could oh, put wow. a little bit of sponge in the bottom of each, and then just store individual pearls in the little tubes just to keep them all safe. Because they don't like plastic bags, no, they like to be able no. to breathe. So yeah. there is a certain amount, That's and right. I'm not saying they've got little breathable holes in them, but no. they'll be much, much, kinder, much kinder, much yeah. kinder to the actual pearl itself. Um, and aesthetically, you know, you can put, there's nothing saying you can't put finished jewellery in there if no, you wanted to. Um, even here at 99.99, amazing. We have the final third, but we did not we stop know. here. No. We went a lot lower, didn't well, we? Oh yeah, we did. We did, do you remember? I vaguely yeah. do. Yeah. I think I remember. Well, it's half that price. If you want to treat yeah. yourself to, pro I'm gonna yeah. say it, the best storage we've had. And we mentioned on the show that you can buy bottles, this little, um, yeah, that's little right. bottles like this, 10 pound for a five, six pound on the River website, the just, just for 10 of the loose little bottles. Just yeah. for these? Just for those. 10 pound? And you've got 100 in this, haven't you? 120. 120, yeah. goodness me. Yeah. So simple maths then. Yeah. You know you're already quids in. Good luck, everybody. This is no. not where we no. closed. 120 of these 
yeah little tubes effectively that are them. screw top yeah. amazing even down to the foam the foam is quality yeah, it's quality. goodness that's a sentence i never thought i'd yeah. hear myself say but you can <laughs> feel the quality of you the can. foam yeah that's very strong that's because that's what keeps and that's important that's well, what it needs keeps to be if these, are, if these are all full of product you know, yeah because they be probably strong, get quite they? heavy don't they yeah. you got that nice sounding zip again <laughs> nice quality it's zip gorgeous. i'm gonna lift that open just one second yeah, yeah. and you imagine you've got everything in here right i've done i'm done for the day i'm gonna put yeah. my put my jewelry making away now and you've still got excuse me for interrupting but with one slot with, with one tray out yeah. you've still got depth there to put a couple of tool kits you can put a macrame board Normal, in there you probably put a macrame board your small macrame board in there your tool kit anything yeah. you need your patterns or your threads and your needles nice in the top. Yeah. nice idea that's so great. that's like portable then isn't yeah. it yeah. but again without without like a um a solid foam this would be all floppy it would. wouldn't it oh, whereas absolutely. i can easily pick this up and pop it into yeah. place now we had quantity we had 300 on the original launch we are down to the final few of these jewelry makers um and they are they are flying we, we launched it on a monday morning we were saying at the time 39.99 <laughs> we were saying at the time that this is a saturday product weren't we or product, a weekend right. or a saturday yeah. or a sunday we couldn't yeah. believe that it was actually well, chosen monday. to put on a monday yeah, yeah. Mark, that wasn't when no. we closed, though, was it? You've got a great memory. See, mm. I thought it was this. <laughs> it's amazing. What I like about them is they're not—they're not too long, so you can actually put them up vertically in bookshelves or however you store yeah. your, your, your products. My shelving unit at home, this is perfect. It just slots in beautifully. It's you can see the quality of them. Yeah. They're amazing, aren't they? We went even lower, jewelry makers everybody mm. pays that final low price tag good luck only launched on uh monday last week even down to we were saying like there's that brand zip exchange yeah, yeah. they did kind of kit exchange, kit exchange. That's, that's it, it. Yeah. not zip yeah, yeah. um kit exchange. Right. um but they mm. were quite expensive weren't they mm. yeah they're great they are great yeah, and, yeah. I, and i know we use them all the time um this is our own this is our own version of yeah, yeah. look at even down to this look Double zip. Look, look at the quality of the zip. <laughs> no zip exchanges going on here. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. Um, good luck, everybody. It's multi buy because yeah, you know it's going to ultimately help your creating, yeah, isn't it? Definitely. Um, we've got another message coming into the studio. Twenty nine ninety nine. That's an amazing yeah, price tag, isn't it? Yeah. It really is amazing. Yeah. You know, for the pots alone, on when you own. said you can get what ten for how much? Ten for a fiver. Ten for a fiver. That's sixty pound just on. Just, just on, on the on little those. pots, yeah, yeah. without the actual without case, the double the price. Yeah. Um, hello, yeah. Elvina, saying oh. I bought two of these. I love them. The supporting sponge is good and strong when yep. taking the top layer off. Absolutely. It is. Yep. The supporting sponge. Supporting sponge. Yeah. Amazing. Good yeah. and strong. Um, Julian, we're all great for anglers too. Absolutely. Good, good. That's yeah, a good yeah, idea. Yeah. Because yeah. I bet my dad used to fish. I, I bet you know. He flies. He was a, was he a fly fisher. <coughs> yeah, go, used yeah. to go down to the River yeah. Osk and oh. spend hours. Yeah, you know, hours there. Apparently, when my mum started doing it as well, um, she was much more successful. But apparently, fish are attracted to the pheromones. Oh, is that right? Female pheromones. Oh, there you go. Oh. Um, I can remember my dad being like, <laughs> "Yes, but that's a really good call because they're quite sharp, aren't they? Yeah. So you can Individual keep them." Individual flies. That's yeah. a good idea. Great yeah. idea. And your weights. Yeah. Yes. All Lovely of that. Idea. Did you used to fish? I fish with my dad. Yeah. Do you know? I always wanted to go fishing. With, my dad used to go fishing every Sunday morning. That was his thing because mm. he because he worked really hard during the week. And I always said, "Can I go? Can I go?" And he said, "No, you're not old enough. You're not old enough." Do you know the day that he agreed to take me fishing? The day, 1981, July, the Royal Wedding. And I've oh. been so excited to watch the Royal Wedding. So I had to decide, do I stay at home and watch the Royal Wedding, which is a once in a lifetime opportunity, or do I go fishing with my dad? And I went fishing with my dad. Did you? Oh, we, oh, we got back in time to watch the wedding. So oh. we, we did come back early, but it was the first time I went fishing with my oh, dad. Oh, bless you. I was eight. Bless yeah. you, bless yeah. you, bless you. Um, hello to you, Mary in Yorkshire saying, top tip, I got my case and quickly filled it, but realised that the silver labels will peek, um, will peek out of the bags and stick on the tubes. Fantastic. That's a good idea. So put the silver labels yeah, inside. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. 
because that keeps it then that's your protection isn't it from yeah, uh, um, from tarnishing fantastic yeah. Yeah. they are amazing and it's yeah. quite cleansing i think to have a good sort out isn't it yeah. this is like our loft boarding and jewelry it making is, yes. <laughs> um lots of you messaging in these are live messages by the way as well june oh. and sorry i have three, three of these well uh, storage cases for all my oh. crimps and findings one for each uh, each silver rose and yellow gold oh. they are fabulous and make it easy um absolutely yes. nice and organized i like the idea of having one specifically for findings yeah, yeah, yeah. that's a good idea because you can literally look at your layers yeah. then couldn't you um yeah. well done again they've flown out we have got multi buyers getting involved as well remember what mark was saying because we tested the theory last monday was actually cut a six mil strand and they fit in one yep. of those an eight just just short of yes right, but a six so obviously anything smaller than a six as well you can get a whole strand in a tube that's fantastic isn't it yeah. and great yeah. if you like i said you want to take them somewhere yeah you know so you can just put what you're working with you don't have to keep it no. all in there do you no. if you're not using everything no. um it's yeah i mean are they designed specifically for sea beading this is the this is specifically for diamond art and the drills right but it's such a good way of storing for everything else that yeah. you have to have them and for jewelry maker One. and i think i think hobby maker may be doing it at some point as well because obviously with the, with all their sequins and sequins and, and, and glitters glitter and, and all that sparkles sort of and yeah, yeah. Um, I agree. Right, leave that one with you. Well done. Ooh. Are we ready for how many? I'm kicking myself now. My phone's in the gallery. How many have we got? Oh, have we? Okay, there's a good quantity of them. That's good. Really? 150. Um, 150. Have you been shopping, Roscoe? No, Adam. Oh, with oh, your Adam's phone. <laughs> <laughs> Adam's been shopping with my phone. Oh, fair enough. It's all right. That's okay. I love um, these. They're Come gorgeous, the aren't they? So they come in the nice little posh white boxes as well. Very nice. Posh. You know, it's very you know, strong. Ooh, posh. Ooh, Easy know. wrapping, I'm thinking. Yes. Great for under the Christmas tree. Oh, look at that. So oh, I, I used gorgeous. to, when I worked in the jewellers, we used to sell little travel jewellery oh, box cases you? like this. And right. I can remember one year my dad saying, I don't know what to get you, mum. Don't want to get your mum for Christmas. Mm. Um, and I think that year they were having something done to the house where he was like, oh, you know, I don't want to spend a fortune. No, it's a little no. present, basically. And he chose a little travel jewellery box, basically. It was still best part of 50 quid. And I'm yeah. going back 20 odd years. You know, they are expensive. Next time you're uh, passing a jeweller's local to you, like I said, Heinz near us, they are expensive mm. jewellery boxes. Yeah, yeah. Um, and it's important, isn't it? You know, because. I'll, I'll admit it I've been guilty of chucking my jewellery in a little bag and mm. then you lose it stuff don't you or they get tangled whereas this is going to prevent that um, so really nice shape beautiful like a plush velvet and then you have your uh, Kimby branding on the front there and um, if I open it up which is magnetic as well I can say you've nice got nice. here we go let's do it room oh, for yeah. keeping them nice and secure nice and safe I reckon you're going to get at least six rings yeah. in there, at least, yeah. and then you've got room there for um, you've got room there for your necklaces or pendants, yeah. whichever earrings, whatever you want to be. Nice. Look, listen to this. Oh, I am. Good get a double click. Double click. Nice little double click, yeah. and then it's a box in a box if you wanted yeah. it to. But look at those! What great stocking fillers I think these it's are. Brilliant stocking filler. My mum would use these if she was going away. She'd use this compartment for her tablets good idea for when she goes away that's a really good back. idea yeah yeah because you don't want to get a gathering dust and things do no, you no, no, great no. idea and sometimes no. like the tablet boxes no, are quite big right. aren't they yeah, yeah, um yeah. yeah especially if you've got to take yeah. a few um, a few mm, a day yes. um so we have it in the two different colors we've got it in your um emerald green and you've got it in this lovely kind of like dusky pink so you could put two rows of your where well, you could put a row of your rings so, so you can get three rings Three pairs of your studs, yep. your earrings in nice. there, and then your, your, your necklace or your necklaces, bracelets. Drop one of these. That's going to yeah. work perfectly. Yeah, drop one of these in. Yeah. Now we've got 150. Here you go. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. It keeps it nice and safe. I'm going to catch. I'm not going to break no, or anything yeah. like that. Nice and secure. We spend you know money on jewelry these are wonderful adornments that we all love them often got sentimental value the last thing you want to do is to break them nine pounds and 99 Honestly. pence only oh first price crash we've got 150 of these i want to get some i think they're great presents. i think they're amazing yeah 
I that would be quite difficult to wrap, wouldn't it? Yeah. Unboxed. Yeah. So the fact that you are getting it boxed is You could even make a piece of jewelry could. to put That's in nice there. Idea. Yeah. That's nice. We do table presents. Do you? Yeah. That's nothing nice nothing idea. huge, but yeah. you know, I'll do um I mean it's it's kind of grown. I sometimes put like a little stocking on mm. there, but there's nothing massive in mm. there, like colouring books and things oh, like yeah, that. Yeah. Um so nothing huge. But what a nice little table gift this would yeah, be. Lovely. You know, for, for one of your grown ups. Amazing. Well, I say that actually. You know, Willow would probably yeah, like this. Yeah. A nice little jewelly box for her. Nine ninety nine and going even lower. Lots of multi buyers. I am joining you on that. Yeah. It's whether you prefer the emerald green or whether you prefer the dusky pink that we're also bringing you. You've got more than enough space there. Double click. Look. It's not. Is it navy? No. I'd say green. that's more green. That's basically green, isn't it? Yeah. It is like a bluey, tealy green. Hmm. Dark teal, let's call it that. Okay. Dark yeah, teal. Yeah. I wouldn't call it navy. No, definitely no. not navy. Definitely a teal, I would say. Um, we're going even lower. Lots of you there. There's 150 available. Perfect little stocking filler, this. I mean, especially if we're under £10 and going even lower. Goodness me. Twos, threes, I can see getting purchased. So, uh, sorry, Devon's got two. Chantal's got two. Mirtha Tidfil and Sarah's got two. Susan's got two. Nicolette's got three. Carol, oh. well done. Seven ninety nine. No. What are you taking these <laughs> to then, Roscoe? Pardon? Wow. What can you get for the price that you've just heard? Well, I'll tell you what. Carver. If you're lucky. Bottle Ooh, of, a bottle heart of, a heartburn inducing bottle of carver. Yeah. Bottle <laughs> of prosecco yet? No. No, I don't think no, you can. Not no. for the price that we're taking these to. No. Four pack of cider. I don't know. I think I think you can get can four you? pack of cider for that they, price. That's what, yeah. And it's a jewellery box. Mm. It's something that's gonna last years. Yeah, it's a lovely. lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. And I really like the idea, jewellery makers, with your talents if you make a piece of jewellery to go in it. Because actually then you're, you're, you're uh, killing two birds with one yeah, stone, yeah, horrible expression, yeah. but you know what I mean? You haven't got to worry about sourcing the box then, have you? No. You can put it in that too. Seven ninety nine already amazing. Do shop ahead on the dusky pink. Um, that's available as well. We've got a, nice, so a, a few nice jewellery boxes still to come. I'm going to join you on these. You won't believe those. Yeah, I need those. I des desperately need those. That's amazing. Six ninety nine. I just love the fact that it comes boxed. It's posh then. You know go. it's posh yeah, and it's yeah. got a box in a box. Yeah. That's amazing. Right now for your dark teal. That's how I'm gonna describe it. It's like a dark yeah. teal. Really pretty colour. Nicola, I can see you've just upped your quantity. Well done. Uh, Holland, hello to you. Sharon's got two. Chantal, well done. Marion's multi bought. Mirtha Tidville, I can see you've just upped your quantity as well. Isabel, Brenda, phone lines have completely lit up. I'm not surprised. Um, if there is a short queue on the phone lines, please do bear with our call centre. They're, they're owning the crust today, aren't they? They are. Um, <laughs> Earning their crust. Um, so maybe if you want the dusky pink, have that conversation with them as well um, to add it to your order. We've got other jewellery boxes still to come. They're fantastic for travel. But at the same time, I think you made a really, made a really mm. good point. Just pop it in your kitchen. Yeah, you on know? your windowsill or in your, your bathroom. Sill, bathroom. Keep bathroom. everything safe. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So it is a bad mm. habit, isn't it? Doing mm. things like your dishes. I garden in mine. It's not so, the best. So do I. So do you. Oh. I do put gloves on yeah. though. No, I don't. I don't like gloves. Don't you? No, I, I do. Put, I like to feel because you soil get. I, I can't get soil. No. In yeah. No, I do put. I do put gloves on. No. Although I can tell Tom does the the little knowing glance. You know, no. like just as one of these. <laughs> 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 just glances towards. And you lost his wedding ring in the garden. Really? We don't, we'd only had it two years yet, so he thinks that it came off, and then he went over it with a lawnmower, and then threw it in the compost bin oh and, no yeah, oh no yeah. has he got another one now he's another replacement yeah, yeah. there we yeah. go that's all right then but well they, we, we had them in, we got them engraved with our initials oh, and so we lost not, all that yeah, bless you do you know um we'll bring the pink one to wear now you know what's ah. going to happen jewelry makers good luck everyone um when i was a when i was a child i was on holiday with my mum and dad and i can remember just swimming around my, my brother and sister were at that age they didn't want to come on holidays with us anymore 
Um, and I was swimming around the swimming pool and I could see this couple, this, this couple, um, looking on the bottom of the on the bottom of the uh, um, swimming pool, and you could see they were both quite upset. And anyway, they, they I was like, I had goggles, like those little snorkels, and they'd lost he, his wedding ring. Oh, no. I spent the entire day scouring that pool, and I found it. You found it, did yeah? you? Yeah. I tell you what, I earned that bag of skittles that they bought me. So they gave yeah. you a thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hours I spent looking for their wedding band, but I did find it. Um, yeah, so it's worthwhile. It's yeah. <laughs> it was a big bag of Skittles at that, yeah. and I was happy. Aww. I was happy. Um, that's a pretty colour, isn't mm. it? Yes. That's <laughs> that's a really pretty colour. So there you go. You can see in the dusky pink as well, all down to your Beautifully personal made, preference. Aren't they they yeah, are. You really feel that well quality. Made. Look. Yeah. Again. Yeah. Sturdy. Rigid. Strong. Nice and strong. They're not going to crush if you put them in an overnight bag. You know, we're not stopping there. Have we got the same quantity then, Roscoe? No. Oh. Same quantity. Same quality. Same price. It sounded like a furniture advert. It though, did, didn't, didn't it? it? Yeah. There you go. There you go. If yeah. you do get made, um, if you wow. do get shoved, Roscoe, that's what you need to yeah, go yeah. into. Come up yeah. with slogans and things like that. Yeah. You could be an ad man. Absolutely. Yeah. I think you'd be really good at that. You know, like the buy one, get one free. You could do that, you could yeah. do that. Uh, yeah. um, same design, same quality, same, same price. price. That's just 699, that's <laughs> right, 699. <laughs> <laughs> do you reckon you could do cheesy voices, Roscoe? Oh. He, oh, he, oh, oh. No, I think that's oh. no, he doesn't like being <laughs> cheesy. I think that's a negative. Um, <laughs> 699 for these, amazing. Absolutely beautiful little Kimby home jewelry lovely, boxes, and even down to the some of the travel ones that you see are quite big. I didn't know until now that that was a thing. Yeah, a travel yeah. box. Yeah, you can yeah. get travel boxes, right. but they usually say about I don't know. Mm. Um, how how would I describe that? <sighs> CD size. Oh yeah, yeah. Like a CD size, like that, like mm. that, aren't they? You can get variations, I suppose, but these are the most. They are. They're really good. Yeah, they're the small, probably the most petite, yeah. and yet you can still hold the same in there as yeah. well. Um, again, lots of you there. It's all down to your choice whether you prefer the dark teal or whether you prefer the dusky rose. Um, hello, to you. Is that Sharon? Did you say Christmas prezies sorted? Thank you. Absolutely. Brilliant Christmas prez. A really useful one as well. Yes. Yeah. Even if you're not travelling, I need these. I've got a jewellery mm. drawer in my dressing table and oh. Tiggy's located this drawer and it does worry me mm. that she, you know, sneaks off and goes, I'll have a little rummage, like I did, I puts lost things my, down and puts things down, put, exactly, yeah. so it does yeah. worry me. So if I could just, even if I just took a selection of them out, mm. somewhere safe, um, and that's, that's what, a nice idea. Yeah, yeah, just take some of them out, that's what I'm thinking when I'm actually uh, shopping along with you on this opportunity. Um, they're flying again, we had 150 of them, lots of twos, threes, fives, lots of purchases for Christmas, the I stocking think. Stocking fillers, yeah. Stocking filler yeah. gifts, secret Santa gifts, amazing. So there's your dusky rose, amazing. Should we do the circular ones? These are cool. They're ace, aren't they? And they don't have to be jewellery. These could be no, like they, your, they, bid, your you bids could. and bobs. Yeah, your bits and bobs. I just thought the way that it all collapses, you can put it on your bedside cabinet. Yes, it's not, you know, that's it's what not, I'm thinking. Oh, it's quite discreet, isn't it? No, it's nice. You know when you have, we all have like little little bits like needles mm. or oh yeah, little things. haberdashery pieces. You can put your haberdashery yeah. pieces That's or nice your idea. cottons yes. and things like that. Yeah. That they always grow legs, don't they? Yeah. And wander off. We've got a drawer like that with the tape measure and yeah. miniature <laughs> screwdrivers and Christmas crackers and Absolute, thimbles which and have their all. place. They do. I love them. You need yeah. those. Yeah. You could like That's your nice little idea, watch actually. batteries and yeah, things it's like a good that. Idea. So you could put those, and it's nice and wipeable. So because yeah. you've got the Kimby uh, branding on the top there, we do have it in the black by the way as well so you might have well, have one each maybe yeah, on your bedside tables idea. you might have them for different purposes but again you can really feel that quality of them so they basically fold out and open out like this even down to the bottom layer so you've got that nice yeah. and secure uh, plinth so um, yeah lots of uses yes jewelry of course so you can have your earrings your bracelets your nice necklaces second. your brooches whatever yeah. it might be 9.99 I Very am happy, happy. yeah Next price crash though, or for your bits oh, and bobs. I like the bits and bobs, yeah. We've thing is my bids and bobs drawer is tends to tends to grow. 
Tens, have elastic bands. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah elastic bands. Turns up bids and bobs. I think what's in mine. Yeah, there's everything in there, isn't there? Six ninety nine, Mark. That's good. Six ninety nine. Um, we're putting a minute on your screens. Oh. A purple clock. Is it meant to be a purple clock? Oh, we're oh, going again. Okay. That's fantastic. Wow. You know, little tiny li toys. You mm. can put those That's in there as well. Yeah, yeah. Paper clips. Oh, for a desk. Oh, yeah. You can put your paper clips and your elastic bands and your book clips. Yeah, little, clips. little stationery. That's nice all a All your bit. stationery I like that in idea. there. Yeah, yeah. That's Stamps and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, That's yeah. That's nice idea. All yes. of those cartridges for a fountain yes. pen. For those people that use, use fountain pens. Loads of bids and bobs that we'll probably have. You're thinking of all corners of your, of mm. your house yeah, now, aren't you? Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> all corners of your house and places that you've just got things cluttering around in the bottom of the like, drawers. I bet Willow would put sort of her hair, what are they hair called? Bobbles, bobbles, yeah. Bobbles and slides things that's yeah, a good no, idea sort of actually stuff, yeah. bobby clips get yeah, everywhere yeah. and you don't want them going up your hoover no they don't they, they are no. <laughs> you don't know because a bobby clip will wreak havoc on your hoover yeah. it will so yeah bobby clips you can put those in there as well um perfect <laughs> um good luck everyone Keep them all Where's safe, nice and organised. Yeah. Oh, we're cleansing, aren't we, right now? Four ninety nine. It's fantastic, that That's is. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you've put that idea in my yeah, head yeah. now. I need to get these for the hair clips and yeah. hair bubbles and Keep things like together. that. And also the cats. Yeah. The oh, cats get hold yeah. of a, a of uh, an elastic of a band, oh, yeah, hair yeah. band, and they play with yeah. it and. I always worry they're going to get something, yeah. you get their paws caught or something like that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, keep them safe, plus you don't lose them. Um, Teach them to look after things at an early age. At an early age, things, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. No, that's a lovely idea. Absolutely. Plus, again, you can get them in the white, you can also get it in the black. Um, what's that? Makeup. Makeup, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, Put your makeup. Yeah. False eyelashes. Oh, yes. He knows a lot about I false know. eyelashes. There you go. Doesn't Chris he? knows. <laughs> Chris knows. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be doing with them. I wish I could. I just look all wonky if I put oh. those on. I can't do them. And also, you wake up in the morning and say, like, you know, after a few glasses of wine, you've peeled them off, left them on your bedside table. It oh. looks like a big spider. Nice. So, no, not nice. I can't mm. do them. Yeah. I can't do them. Um, 4 99 we We've spoken about some really funny have. things today, we have. haven't we? Um, <laughs> onto the black. Let me show you the inside of them as well so you can see they're nicely, oh, they um, actually, yeah. nice and soft. Yeah. And they've got non-slip, oh, non-slip, non-slip little yeah. feet. There you go. Oh, you, you, yeah. There you they go. Come out, you oh, can you, wash them. Yeah, you can take them out, wash them, and rinse them if you want oh, that's to. That's a good idea. It's good, isn't it? So show you all the way around it. Opens up entirely. That's so um, clever. And then let me just show you on the back. You've got your little rubber feet just here, so that if you are Ooh, they click closed as well. Click nicely closed. Yeah. Nice and secure on the desk, look. Nice and secure. It looks like a little oh, mini yeah. sound system. Yeah, little speakers. Doesn't it? Yeah. It's great. Nice and neat and tidy. Yeah, you haven't got yeah. clutter bits everywhere. Because even I bits agree. in a bowl, I don't like mm. that much. Because it's just an invitation, isn't it? Yeah. You don't mind if it's in, in a bowl. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, <laughs> I almost repeated what you just said yeah. then. Almost. <laughs> no, it's all good. Um, but you're good. Cufflinks. You can Cuff put those nice in there. Your chap. Yeah. Watches. That's nice idea with a watch. Cufflinks. Yeah. Put watches in there, couldn't you? Yeah. They'd fit in there. Chains. So you could have like his and hers. Hers and hers. His and his. Whichever. Um, you could put, I don't know. Listen, we go. Yeah. You, everything. Yeah. You could put absolutely everything in there. Well, not everything. Size permitting, that is. Not batteries. What about batteries? That's a nice idea. Yeah batteries because I always worry about batteries just rolling around mm. you are meant to store them in a certain way aren't you are you yeah apparently oh. uh, apparently you are mm -hmm. um, I'm no expert on this but apparently so so I wonder if you could maybe put the different types of batteries um, yeah. within there too lots of you getting involved all around the world well done amazing I want these I do I want this, these I think I know where these are going so I can we do one of those little sting things Okay. Yeah, Can we turn? Have I we got enough to you, turn? You've no idea where these are going to. Have we? And uh, um, Scott, Scott did the price on these with, with Lindsay. Are you giving me a window of opportunity here? 
Oh, I see. Oh, I didn't think that, but that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. would. I would seriously would. Yeah, okay. You won't, you won't believe Because I do going. want these. Yeah. How amazing. Now, we've got them in the two different colours. Mm. They are like a velvet, and as you can see inside, they've got a really beautiful, they've got ring dividers. I need these. I do genuinely, genuinely need these. Um, mm. So, thank yeah. you, Mark. Yeah, yeah. You've done me a favour there. Um, yeah. These are going to have to be a star buy. So I, I happened to see these. I think it was Wednesday. <laughs> it was the day. It was the day that the the hold all with the five trays in the um yes, in the, yes, in the yes. purple and the teal yes were launched. So that went very successfully. And then Scott bought these to air with Lindsay. Yeah. And um, apparently Wayne wasn't in the building. I think. Uh huh. Okay. And then, anyway, Scott's the boss, so yeah, he's, he's but, allowed. And uh, no, it, they just went. And they seem to be getting less and less and less. I think he was showing off in front of Lindsay, to be fair. Do you reckon? If you watch the whole hour back, uh. it was a bit, yes, it was, it was hilarious. And he just, he just thought, in for a penny, in for a pound. And I guess Lindsay then was really shocked by she these prices. Well, she, was, she was coming up with prices, because they sell them on Gemporia yeah. as well, uh, boxes like this. And she was, she was absolutely, she just couldn't quite believe it. Because They're beautiful. They are beautiful. And that's the yeah. thing, you know, you could very easily find an alternative mm. to these mm. you could go to most jewelry jewelers shops and they will have a ring box of this description maybe bigger maybe smaller whichever it might be but one thing the price that you just told me in the break they're no mm. way near no no way near i think the viewers will all know where we're going to either it's just phenomenal well i've literally just run out no. and got my phone because mm. i'm going to get a couple of these mm. as well because mm. As we just said, I have. We all store store our jewellery differently, don't we? Mm. I've got a drawer in my dressing table, and like I said, my two-year-old has established that they're there, and she's, ooh, mm. you know, following in in, in mummy's footsteps. So, um, and it does worry me because there's obviously sentimental jewellery. There's pieces that I don't want to get lost, obviously. Um, so my thought was, right, I need to get a smaller something like this that I can put up, up high yeah, yeah, up high out the way or That's hide it yeah. or at least hide it yeah. and also I have to say I mean you could put those if you've got a safe mm -hmm. Yes, that's true, actually. If you've got a safe in your yeah. house, you could fit these in. And it's the fact that we were, they were, Scott was mentioning the fact that it's got this clear lid yeah. so you can actually see that's what you've lovely. got inside as well. I yeah. love them and it's in like a, yeah. a lovely velvet colour. You've got all of your ring dividers just here. I'll, I'll take my jewellery off again so you can actually see. And you can get a lot in these. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll go to the top row and I'll go to the very bottom row so you can see just how yeah. much you'll actually get within. So the graphics are live. I am joining you on this because I also think, again, great gifts, yeah. amazing gifts. Everyone's going to have a use for them, aren't they? Um, it's not just rings. You can use them for earrings as well. You could bracelets, study all necklaces. your stud earrings, yep, yeah, all the way along. That's brilliant. Yeah, necklaces, bracelets. Because yeah, yeah. I've got, because I, I, do you remember when we used to have at, um, oh, it was here, we had a gift shop didn't yes, we? it was. It was and there. It, that was. It. Was it there? Yes. Yeah. And I bought quite a few rings for Mum, and and I've I've kept them all, and I've got them in the, in a wooden Gemporia box. Yeah. And obviously you can't. It's quite cumbersome and quite, quite heavy, heavy, and you have to. Look, but this is this is perfect because you can actually see everything underneath. Yeah, and you might not want to open it each no. and every single time. Mm. Just actually having yeah. them sort of yeah. on display, I suppose. But what? Nine ninety nine, and that's not our price. No. How no. many do you say we've got 100 of these available? 100 available opportunities. The next price crash is still not your price point. We've got that really nice secure catch just there. You can yeah. see everything, all your pieces of jewelry within. Not our price. No. <laughs> Are you joking? Sorry. No. These, this is the last time you're going to see these, says Roscoe, because yeah. they will absolutely it's sell ridiculous. out. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Look, and again, imagine yeah. that all full with your wonderful pieces of jewellery. There are yeah. so many of you getting involved right now. And I'm joining you. Whether you get the black, the white, I don't really care um, what colour. I reckon this is one of the deals of the year for me. Did they have big quantity of them then? They did, yeah. 
Yeah. 300 of each of them. Yeah, yeah. Was that on a Saturday or something? No, it was on Wednesday. I think, was it Wednesday or Thursday? Yeah, it was Wednesday. It was the British Next Gem, Britain's Next Gem day. Uh -huh. Yeah, we had the hold alls in the in the teal and the purple, and then yeah. him, Scott brought these in as a little extra. Oh, I tell you what, I'm seeing. Can we shop ahead on the other ones? Is it? Wow. Is it on pre-order? Amazing. Um, sorry, I've just got my phone out and just you know, getting involved with these as well. They're amazing. Yeah, incredible. So well made. I mean, even the little catches on the back look. They're just the little hinges. They're so. It's just so well made. It's just beautiful. Oh well, jewelry makers. Look, 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 look at the price. No. <laughs> no way. Isn't that just ridiculous? I'm trying I mean, to in somewhere like this is really nerdy again, but somewhere like B and Q, you'd pay that for that catch. Yeah, that's true. You would. It's a really you good would. point. Yeah, you would. That is a really just, good point. You must remember your rings, don't. Yeah, no, I, yeah, I will. I, I reckon will. you could probably get how many slots? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight slots. You can probably get eight rings, that's 64, 64, 70 rings in there. Or you can have, as you said, your stud earrings in the slots. Ah, oh, has it sold out, the black one? Oh, okay, black one sold out, right, <laughs> okay. Oh, that's it, really? Yeah, I oh, just no. went to check out and it's oh. already just sold out, so I'm doing oh. this live with you. Check out, check out, check out, check out. Amazing, we'll do it in one price crash, just sold out, that's lovely, isn't that's it? That's gorgeous. I think Scott went onto the River website, for some for something I can't remember where he found it, but the the um, most the least expensive he could find I think it was about fifteen sixteen pound something like that was yeah. the closest he could find. But it's just it's just very well, and here serious. we are at what was yeah. it what what did it close at six pound six pounds rubbish isn't it honestly six pounds yeah, yeah let's do that oh they look lovely in they do actually even more high end doesn't it that's beautiful. Come on, Wi-Fi. Wi I'm going to miss out if it doesn't hurry up. Okay, cool. There you go. Done it. I done it. I done it. I done it. Oh, well done. Amazing. Look how beautiful. Yeah. Now, how much you can create from those. Love the window. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Just give it a buff up when you get home. Yes, yes. <laughs> ours, ours, ours could yeah. do with a little bit yeah. of a polish, but it's all yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. Um, and it's nice and secure. Yeah. Nice and secure. Really well good. done, everybody. Yeah. The phone lines have gone absolutely crazy on these. Stay where you are on those phone lines. I'm not so, and they will stack on top of one another as well. They've, they've got a really good depth of them as well because some of the some of the rings that I've bought for Mum have really big chunky stones. Yeah. And and sometimes they they would just be the the gap would be too shallow, but the the gap between your diamond and then the top, you've mm. got at least another centimetre. Yeah, they're so wide enough big apart. cocktail rings, that's Yeah, yeah, going. yeah, that's cocktail a really rings. good point. Yeah. They're wide enough apart. Yeah. Amazing, the phone lines have gone crazy on those. I'm not surprised that, yeah, but, well, Scott was showing off. He was, yeah. He was showing off, I agree. <laughs> but, you know, let him if he's going to do yeah, those yeah, kind no, of prices. Absolutely. I'm all absolutely. for that, yeah, all yeah. for that. Um, amazing, down to, how are we doing on yeah. stock levels on these? 10 there's only oh. 10 of them left wish list it if you do miss out jewelry makers um they will be a sellout i'm wow. not surprised now Amazing. just before we dive into a Ooh. break um these chains are gorgeous yeah i had a look oh. at them during the break look at that Goodbye. should we put these on pre-order they're amazing aren't they that's not a chain that's a necklace yeah likewise that's yeah. not a chain that's a necklace what's this one here oh these are brand new oh, look at this so you've got a square beaded, tubes, like a tube beaded, and then you've got the infinity as well. All available on pre-order. There are less than 100 of each of those. Um, they're coming up just after the break, jewelry makers, but I've got one more auction that I want to squeeze in now, um, and we're going to do an extra special price tag. Oh my goodness me. These are rosebud pearls. Ooh. So I learned about rosebud pearls quite recently. I never, I, I didn't know what they were. A likelihood of even some of the um, your pearl specialists actually seeing rosebud pearls is very remote, because of all your culture pearls, saltwater pearls, uh, um, freshwater pearls, there are different varieties out there. Barok, mm. Keshi, Biwa, you know, um, South Sea, and that's not necessarily talking about the locations here. Um, a rose pearl, often referred to as a popcorn pearl as well, is oh. up there with the rarest. 
Um, and let me just, because I didn't know about this, so just in, uh, uh, let's read, this is only a couple of short paragraphs. A list of the rarest culture pearls in the world. Um, there is a misconception in the world of pearls, cu pearl cultivation that all of the world's culture pearls are mass produced and affordable, but there are some that are just as rare as a true natural pearl. And that, what we mean by natural pearl is the ones where they're free dived. You technically can't call a culture pearl natural because it's cultured. Um, even though the formation is natural, um, that yeah, natural pearls are free dive pearls. However, uh, here we have compi uh, compiled a list of the rarest such varieties, and they say about popcorn popcorn pearls, which are rose ones. They say pearls are, are pearls. Pearls are pearls of any shape on which the surface nacre has a granulated appearance, so that they uh, look like fresh popcorn. Um, we call them granulated pearls, but they're also known as rosebud or strawberry pearls. Uh, and in China, they call them hairy pearls. Oh, that's cute. Hairy pearls. I know, it's very sweet, isn't Aww. it? Um, but they are lovely. You've kind of got these lovely little on undulations, yes. um, um, really textured, really lovely textures within. But again, if I, if I sl uh, skip forward, here we go. Oh, it goes look. on to say, look how lovely they yeah. are. They've got an abundance of luster, and that's because they are such thick nacre. Um, these rosebud pearls are very special. This is our supplier, by the way, that supplies this strand. Um, this is a harvest from before COVID, and we've produced this collection for, our, uh, for a Japanese luxury pearl jewelry house. It took our team 15 months to collate wow. these pearls, um, and this is all that remains. Uh, with these pearls, they have the luster of an acquire because of the rich amount of nacre. In some mollusks, they overproduce nacre and when this uh, sorry when the I can't read and this is when it folds over and produces these organic shapes uh, that have the brightest orient uh, pearl mm -hmm. in the world only about 1% of mollusks do this and no one knows why uh, but they command high prices in line with your Bahrain pearls so 1%, oh. so incredibly rare and again just to give you a visual um, on the next slide I think you've actually got uh, they've actually got the chart wow. of the different types of pearls there. Uh, the rosebud is always considered natural, even if it is nucleated or cultured, because there is no way of intentionally no. producing pearls of this quality. Um, these pearls always command the largest premiums because of their luster and nacre. They are the rarest pearls that we have sourced. They're considered the most premium pearls on the planet, and we can uh, provide only one closeout for your birthday. So the, these were got hold of during the uh, Gemporia birthday, uh, uh, just celebrated. Yeah. Uh, these are only sound usually as one of a kind, um, and these are the only strands available in the market in wow. the market so there's no other rosebud or pearls available and you can see on that chart rosebuds are right up the top aren't they um right up there so are we going to do the most unbelievable closeout deal they gave us a closeout deal their words i've just said it to you there we'll bring you that closeout deal as well totally natural thick with nacre which is the rare precious material of course yeah, that yeah, makes yeah. up the pearls they are beautiful you like hairy pearls don't you I like hairy pearls and wrinkly pearls. Wrinkly pearls, yeah, nice, yeah, nice. Yeah. yeah, they are quite sweet, yeah. aren't they? They've got, um, they've got a very sort of endearing. You know, they're up there with your mellow mellows. Mm, they are. That's the reality of these. Astonishingly rare. We are going to do a closeout deal. If our supplier produces a closeout deal, we will pass that closeout deal to you. So you saw they were only, they were acquired, stranded for a luxury jewelry brand. Um, we have the remaining quantity. Launched uh, um, as part of the. Emporia birthday, 19th birthday. We had a multicolored strand, natural multicolored wow. strand, and I'll show you where they closed. Natural, not dyed. You would never dye popcorn pills or rosebud pills. You never would because of the rarity of them. We closed oh, that wow. multicolored strand at £149. This, you know, we've brought you high end pills at like £299, yeah. 399 499 These should be more than but all of those because they're rarer. Gosh. But when they say close out deal, we can provide only one close out for your birthday. So they went to this pearl supplier and said, we want the rarest of all pearls. What can you bring us? We go lower. Wow. And we do so really? in a big way. Oh gosh. Let's just do it in one price crash. Ross, how many do we have? Really? 
There's oh. 38 remaining out of the 150 that we first launched. These are not with silk, 18 karat gold in my eyes. Yeah, you, I, I, I personally, it is only my opinion, wouldn't put these with silver. Personally, these would go with your 18 karat or your rose gold or your platinums even, and you can get them off like the auction sites. Get a vintage one, it'd be perfect. Mm, yeah. Perfect, wouldn't it? Or you might even, if you're a silversmith or goldsmith, you could create like a, replicate the popcorn pearl or the rosebud pearl. You know, create that lovely undulation. 149 pounds and we go even lower. Jacqueline, London, Cynthia, Maker, Maker, Oxfordshire, hello to you, Wrexham. Um, as people on the phone lines as well, I can see you there. Susan in Devon, London, hello to you, Barbara. I've got, what do you say, 38 available. And we do not stop here. The, you know, I want you to, we've, I've never heard of popcorn pearls or rosebud mm. pearls. I'd never seen that diagram before. I knew there were rare, pearls like Bahrain pearls were astonishingly rare and valuable. The fact that this supersedes that in terms of its actual rarity and desirability. The phone lines are about oh, to go man. crazy. There is no other opportunity for us to bring you in your rosebud pearls. Oh my goodness, we didn't do that, <laughs> did we? Did we really? Did still we? on split pay? Is that still on split pay as well? Yeah, it is. That's a good point, Mark. Sixteen pounds oh, sixty-six. No, really? Ross, we didn't. You, surely we were meant to stop at one four nine. I oh, look. We bring hundreds crazy. of auctions in any given day. Oh, oh that's what Dave, Dave did. did. Are you um, sure it, Dave did that? Okay, that's fine then. That's fine. If Dave did it, that's all yeah. good. Because yeah. it's his, his baby. <laughs> he bought them. Yeah. He, so he, he acquired this. And this is the thing, you know, uh, lots of our, our, our pearls, jadeite, gemstones are acquired from relationships that have been built and, um, and treasured over many, many, many years. When we say, oh, it's our birthday, the Gemporia Partnership's birthday, 19 years, it's a big deal, isn't it? Massive. It's yeah, a big yeah, deal. Yeah, yeah. You know, what can you bring us? We want something uber rare, uber exciting, but we want it at a close out deal. You know, they want to maintain that relationship as well. And, you know, to be fair, you know, they've more than fulfilled that with mm. Rosebud Pearls. Yeah. Um, I wasn't expecting it to be 49.99. That's more like a wholesale price, isn't it? That's amazing. Unbelievable. Phone wow. lines have gone completely crazy. Well done, everybody. Lots of multi uh, multi buyers on this as well. You'll see really lovely, like little popcorn. Stunning. They're gorgeous. No, see, I and it's like all them. all nacre. No. It's all about the nacre. Um, look at the phone lines. Gail, get in too. Amelia, Sandra, Linda. Hello to Liz, Cheshire, Catherine, Maker and Devon, get in too. Conway, Sarah, Philippus, you've got two. London's got two. Catherine, Diane, Marie, Alan, Sarah. You disappear off the bottom of the screen, so well done. That's how many we've got left. Oh, my word. So, and I can tell you, I've got Marie, Debbie, Christine, Jeannie, Pat, Maker, Brenda, Carol, Cheryl, Lisa, Amelia, Helen, David, Anonymous Maker, Pamela, Wrexham, with it in their baskets. Marie in Yorkshire's just got two. Brenda's just got hers. Amazing. So that quantity is not hanging around. It's not hanging well around. Done. Karen, you're there. You can do it, but you just need to check out super fast. You can do it. It's going to say those two words soon. Sold out. But then you wish list it, don't you? Yeah, I've got one left. That's incredible. One left. The chains are coming up the other side of the break. Don't forget, wow. jewelry makers, this Sunday, 18 months in the waiting, the return of your mermaidial courts. That's exciting. Um, with uh, Mark's masterclass and stunning designs, as always, Mark. Shop that's ahead amazing. on your lovely necklaces. Well done on your uh, on your yeah. storage. That's been that's fabulous. Amazing. Did you get yours? Yes. I think it said thank you, Ooh. so I hope so. Ooh, better check. I hope so. <laughs> um, so make sure you're ed with us for the remaining of the show because we've got so much still to squeeze in. Congratulations, and we'll be back after this. <laughs> I'm Charlie. I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My favourite gemstone is Opal. I love the colour play and the iridescence. I'd like to win Britain's Next Gem so I can share the knowledge and teach the things that I wish someone had taught me in the beginning. Jewellery makers, head over to the website for our biggest web sale ever. We have over 2,000 lines with up to 80% off. So head over to www.jewellerymaker.com 
for our Bling It Back web exclusive sale and grab them deals before they disappear. I'm Carol and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is solid silver. I'm a silversmith. I want to win Britain's Next Gem because jewellery making and jewellery teaching brings me so much joy and I want to share that joy with other people. Back by popular demand, introducing the one, the only, Gemporia Festive Ball. Party with your favourite presenters from Gems TV, Hobby Maker, Jewelry Maker and Sewing Street. We're all together for a night that's going to be the talk of the town. Situated at the fabulous Stratford Manor, close to the world-famous Stratford-upon-Avon. Tickets are just £99 per person, including a welcome drink, a three-course dinner, half a bottle of wine and music that'll have you dancing all night long. There'll also be a shop at the party and even a tombola if you're feeling lucky. Numbers are limited, so order your tickets today to avoid disappointment. Let's make it a night to remember at the Gemporia Festive Ball on Saturday the 25th of November. See you there. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Hi, I'm Ellie and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is wire work. I love wrapping, I love counting. It soothes my soul being able to wire wrap with crystals. <laughs> I would love to win Britain's Next Gem. Um, it's basically something, doing something like this is, some, is like a dream for me. Being able to present and teach and do this is, yeah, it would be a dream come true to win this. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favourite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Fidgeting then at the we're last minute, weren't we? Yeah. Getting ourselves comfy. I meant to say something to you the other day. Next year yeah. in May mm. is the 50th anniversary of ABBA winning Eurovision with Waterloo. Do you oh. fancy if I put it to the powers that be doing an ABBA themed show? Absolutely. And you'd be Anita. <laughs> I could be Anita. Yeah, I don't know which. I don't know if I'd be Benny I or Bjorn. I'd have to. <laughs> yeah. Would you, be, would you be up for that? Yeah, I can't that sing like her. That's right, an ABBA theme show. Yeah, okay, sure. Okay, we'll come up with kits and things to match. I love that. Do you know what I yeah, also love? The yeah. fact that um, it'll probably wind Tom up. Oh. He's not an ABBA fan. Oh, we love ABBA, obviously. Who do, how can he not <laughs> like ABBA? You know, ABBA's yeah. jolly, isn't yeah. it? 
We've been twice Surely. to see. We've been twice to London to see the Abba, the Abba Tars. Mamma Mia. No, no, no. The um, the concert with them as holograms. Oh. Incredible. Absolutely amazing. Gosh, that's very cool. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. I'll put it. I'll put it to Georgia and Chloe and see if we What's can come up What's your favourite Abba song? Super Trooper. Yeah, I used to love that as a kid as well. Yeah, I didn't know what a Super Trooper yeah. was though. No, I didn't then, back in the day. No, no. it's a no. light, isn't it, a Super yeah. Trooper? It's a spotlight. Spotlight. Yeah, yeah. yeah spotlight, yeah. Super Trooper. I'll put that to them, I'll put that to them. Absolutely, I okay. actually have a Super Trooper. Do you? In our living room, yeah. Oh, amazing. It's on a on a like oh, tripod. Yeah, tripod, yeah. Yeah. Oh. So we could bring in the super trooper. Okay. <laughs> a yeah, minor we'll do that. detail, yeah. I feel, for the show. No, we have to have and one. what would be yeah. the like components then? Don't know. We have to come up. Well, we'll take song titles and then come up with, yes. with kits and things around the song. I like titles. it. Okay. Like this. I'll put it to them. I'll and the winner them. takes it all. That's, That's my favourite. As well. I like that one. Yeah, we'll do um, that. Okay. Are you ready? Because we've still got what what an hour and. I can't see. Is it an hour and 40 minutes? Yeah, yes. about that. Yes. Left on show. We've still got to bring you the last remaining quantity of the advent calendar, which can't lovely wait. Lauren is about, oh, to, about to hand in. Thanks, lovely Lauren. Oh, um, so we're saying the best one yet. It's if you, heavy. It is. I didn't realise it would be so heavy. Do you know so what heavy? each straw costs? What, b before the our price or? At, at our price. Do you know what oh, it goes to? Um, isn't it four pounds 16 and you bear in mind the components that you've worked with christmas eve especially yeah exactly well you mm. shouldn't be able to get the whole box for that pro that one no, product no. um exactly F well it's on pre-order we had 500 we launched them yesterday i think we're down to the, about the last hundred is that right yeah. okay there you go so um it's on pre-order right now you have got to think about it this way and i've been f i follow lots of companies on instagram places like that look fantastic have done their own um for example you've got beauty pie loads of different brands we showed a load yesterday they'll have a they'll have an advent calendar for probably best part of a month in stock a tiffany's doing theirs this year i don't know because last year it was 125 grand oh. for the tiffany's was it what was in the Tiffany's? We did get a diamond tennis bracelet and there was a Tanzanite pendant nice. amongst other things and okay. it, er, in earrings and things, but it was all Tiffany jewelry. 125 grand. Yeah. See the Porsche one? Yeah, Porsche. Porsche. What's in the Porsche, Porsche. one? Um, well, we'll talk about that, but right, let's just let's, say it costs yeah. a million quid and you don't get a car. <laughs> what? I know, it doesn't make any sense. I know it doesn't make any sense. You get every, right. lots of other things. Okay. Um, but yes, so stock up, uh, right. um, shop ahead on your advent calendar jewelry makers. And we were talking yesterday, Alice and I. You know, it's it's the history of the advent is wonderful and how it's progressed over the years. I'm running ahead now because I get excited. Mm. I get excited about the advent. Yeah, so I, do. I love it. Yeah, so, yeah. but you know, the, gone are the days where you just open a little little. Or at little, least have a little chocolate or something yeah. behind the door. We just had yeah. uh, when I first had advent calendars, it was just a, a picture. Mm. That's what we used to have. It's on yeah. pre-order right oh. now. But anyway, enough of that, L. We'll get to talk about that some more at the time. Um, we're going to have to bring this one it's because beautiful. we put it on pre-order and it's flown. That's gorgeous. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Mark, also, oh. your kits. Let's talk about oh. those at 12 o'clock. You're not putting them on pre-order, are you? Oh. <laughs> oh for, I had a mild moment of panic. I think we should. Just, just, what? Just have a gamble. What no, do don't, Mark. Should no. We no. Do you think we should? No. What do you reckon? Because there'll be people Message that... in. Message in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh goodness, yeah. no. I think we should. We're going to sell out of them. Well, it'd be worth a... Okay. It'd be worth a pump. I mean, it's your kit, your yeah, call. I think we should. Just go for it. Message in. Do you want Mark's 12 o'clock kits on, on pre-order? The, the return of Mermaid Courts. Really? The coated gemstone that started it all. It is. It was the first one. Yeah, it was. Straight oh. away, message in, Mark. Yes, please. How many do we have? 150. I think we should. Let's do it. Let's do it. I don't think that's a quantity that should be pre-orderable, <laughs> but OK. okay. I'll go. Right. Listen, I'm easily led. If you go to jewelrymaker.com as we speak. Has oh, he done it? Has he done it? Oh, no. Click on watch oh. live. Oh, no. Has he done it? Scroll oh, yeah. down, you see Mark's jewellery just there. There it is, there oh. it is, there it is. Has he done it? Click on coming up on today's show. Yeah, there's yeah. a change, yeah, yeah, yeah. on pre-order right now. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Nah. 
mermaid cords. And it's nowhere near that price, I can guarantee that. And the, and the seed beads we've just thrown in for an extra. Can I, can I just say, I, yeah. I, I love you all dearly, but I think you've made a <laughs> massive, oh. massive mistake. Okay. I think they'll sell out before 12 o'clock. Right. It's all good. Look at that. They are so beautiful. Do you want to know how many have just gone on pre-order? They've just gone on already. Yeah. 22 have just gone on. I told you, Mark. <laughs> well, we're living life on the edge today. I like that it. That was me. It was my fault. I know. We are living it on the edge today. It's all good. Okay. It's all good. 22 have already gone on pre-order. Amazing. So that's your 12 o'clock kit. It's wow. already going to be sold out. That <laughs> necklace in the middle, that, that Harlequin necklace, I would sell for 200 quid. Yeah. And that how isn't long, the price we're going to. How, how long does that necklace take? Seven hours. I mean, look how amazing it is. Mm -hmm. Absolutely yeah, beautiful. I love it. Absolutely and you can see it. you've also got Canadian Serpentine, you've got the Advent Calendar, and all these yeah. prices, they go lower, oh, yeah. obviously. We'll do the Advent Calendar very soon, but as we've said, we need, oh. to, we need to do the Infinity Necklace. I refuse to call this a chain. It's not is a chain. Is that what we've called it? It's not a chain, is it? It's a necklace. It's a necklace. It's, it's got a clasp, I think. Yeah. It's yeah. got a clasp. How, yeah, so it's a neck. So. Oh, I love it. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Put this in one of your posh boxes. It's flying oh, on pre order. Yeah. I can see why. There's a big investment of sterling silver. 18 inches. That's beautiful. All the meaning behind the link as well. I would cut it into bits and have them as individual infinities on bracelets uh, and as little that's charms what I would and do. connectors yeah. that's a nice idea yeah. can we can we then um, multi-buy so you can actually have one matching necklace as well oops join two together for an over the head oh that, that would be amazing, gorgeous and you just yeah. mentioned tiffany's this is very tiffany's to me it is. Yeah, yeah very very tiffany's i can imagine this and they do obviously an amazingly successful mm. collection of sterling silver how much would this be if it just had one little charm oh, no. tiffany's and co yeah. you know it's no that's the only difference is the branding effectively how much is it going to be there what do you reckon 500 pounds at least at yeah. least yeah. yeah um there's a big investment of the sterling silver we're already starting at a low price tag again uh, it, very commercial lots of meaning be behind the infinity of course it's that endless love friendship um and the fact they're interlocking into one another 24.99 wow 24.99 oh my word. How, what's the gram weight on this then roscoe i can't see 5.75 grams that's so elegant isn't it it really is yeah, elegant yeah. you don't need to add anything to this you can of course because no. you've got those nice open links so if you wanted to add little bubble style sections you could do that if you want to put like a i don't know a pendant oh. on there you could absolutely do that 20 yeah easy to add to because you've got the larger links but it doesn't have to be the case um yeah our graphics do say the word chain i re yeah. I, I think this is more of a necklace um message from debbie hello lovely saying good morning lovely people this would be great for layering yeah gorgeous yes 18 inches of course you could especially if it's a case of just adding length you've had a great idea just maybe get two mm. um but you probably could get the silver wire and recreate that shape if you want mm. it to be a little yeah, bit yeah. longer yeah because yeah. it's basically soldered isn't it soldered in the center created like an hourglass shape we're not stopping oh. at 24.99 i think we've had christmas covered today i have to tell you absolutely yeah, yeah. that's beautiful i like the way the links sit as well yeah they tessellate yeah, don't I they like 19.99 bear in mind this is just a, a whisper under six grams of sterling silver wow yeah they tessellate beautifully you get that lovely movement they between them like they're dancing a jig dancing a jig yeah very nice solid 925 already collectors how yeah. many have we got roscoe 82 oh. available debbie you've got yours well done amy's got two lanarkshire's oh. got two mandy's got two nicolette well done we're at 19.99 and that's not your price it isn't your price what i would do is i would take i'll get two I'd take off each other, every other link yeah. and use them for other projects. And then I'd rosary link a birthstone in oh, between lovely. for a spectacle chain. I think they'd match beautifully, wouldn't they, with that same sort of look. That's lovely. Yeah. We're That's back to the mutant teen, teenage, whatever they were. What are they teenage called? Teenage Mutant Ninja the Turtles. Yeah, it just reminds me of those. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh you I, i'm trying to think of their names there what was the uh, what was the um vanilla ice song that he did for no that he did for teenage mutant ninja turtles 
There is one. Oh, I didn't know he had another hit. Yeah, he oh, did, yeah. Right. Tiggy loves it. Oh. <laughs> you have to Google it. What's the ice, uh, vanilla ice Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle song? Uh, is it for the film? Probably right, for the film. Right. Yeah, probably for the film. Oh. Um, that's going to bug me now. Um, already people getting involved. We're at 19.99. We're going even lower. Yes, like, hey, the ninja rat. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> See? Can you play oh, it on your phone just yeah. so Mark can hear that song? <laughs> just play it down the earpiece. It's amazing. Just about vi uh, visualise right. Tiggy dancing to this. Um, uh oh. Always oh, pressed the wrong I've button. I've distracted Ross and he says I've got a little oh, bit no. lower than I was meant to. <gasps> it's six grams of sterling silver. Oh, that's ridiculous. Just under. A whisper under. A whisper. Again, just present that. I'd take one of the nice square boxes, I think. Lay that out. Yeah. That would be beautiful as a Christmas gift, wouldn't it? You, I like the idea of just putting just one individual wow. birthstone on there. Uh, you could set gemstones in if you, you wanted to. That's nice. You could wire wrap them in, couldn't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, kind of glue it, secure it. Loads of you getting involved. Um, lots of multi-buyers on this one, too. Um, 5.85, did you say, grams of sterling silver on this? Uh, Dawn's got two, Mandy's up the quantity to three, Debbie's got four now, well done lovely, Sharon's got two, wow. Rita's got two, Anne in Pembrokeshire's got two, Manchester you've got two, I can't keep up with you all. Amanda in Leicestershire you've got yours as well darling, congratulations, but why wouldn't we at 12.99? Even mad. if we saw that in a, in a, in a, I don't know, let's just say someone like Samuels. Yeah. It's not going to be twelve ninety nine, no, no, no. is it? No. It, it's going to like Argos, probably £25, £30. Pounds. Yeah. Yeah. At That's least. Brilliant. At the very, very least. Yeah. If you're talking Tiffany's, then it's going to be way more. And their yeah. silver's no different to no, our silver. No. That's right. Roscoe, you've got to play that song. Please. <laughs> you can't find it. Ninja Rap. Honestly. It won't play. Okay, fair enough. I'll do, I will do it <laughs> after the show, especially for you, Mark. Um, <laughs> hey? <laughs> I don't. I can't think how it goes. Otherwise, oh. I would. <laughs> I would sing it. Uh, Twelve ninety nine. There was eighty two of these available. Chris is like That's thinking, amazing. "What is going on? <laughs> what on earth is going on?" I do love you do. You do movie. like the, Who doesn't love the Teenage Mutant exactly. Ninja Turtles? Mm. You know what's not to love? Turtles live in the sewer. Mm. Let's save people. Mm. <laughs> save people. <laughs> amazing. Um, and the fact they can do martial yeah. arts. Love pizza. I can relate. I can relate. <laughs> Amazing, well done. Again, there's a bit of a queue on the phone lines. We can see you there. It's busy now. Oh, yeah. You're, you're all you're energised from your extra hour in bed. That's what it is. We all felt refreshed this morning we because we had that extra hour. It's yeah. like ah. Oh, I, I was in bed at half eight last night. I was were so you? Tired. Yeah. Some days yeah. you've got, you've got to do that, haven't mm, you? Yeah. Some days, yeah. We um, started watching this. Um, this series on Netflix and it's it's quite heavy going and you really need to concentrate and we're on to episode four and after five minutes I started going I thought no because I'm gonna miss something vital what 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 it's, it's got Stephen Graham in it and it's called Bodies oh I've seen that yeah is it good it's really it's really yeah, you no, really I need to concentrate it. it's yeah. a bit odd isn't it yeah you really need to yeah. concentrate so persevere yeah. okay yeah. all right yeah we did start uh, yeah we did start yeah. watching that yeah. one um there we go yeah you needed an who's, early who's night. at the end of bought three? Oh, there's loads of threes and fours. Oh, the, threes getting Christmas involved, Christmas yeah. Presents. Christmas yeah. presents, yeah. absolutely. Jane, Amy, Julia's got three. Well done. If I scroll down, you've got Mandy's got three. I didn't yeah. see Oh, my Lord. Look, the list goes on. Oh, we didn't have that on the TV, did we? No, there's definite perks to have. Do you want me to yeah. show you? Wow. Definite perks to having an iPad, everyone. So, Gosh. because the TV screen, you can only see like the <laughs> top. Can you see it? Did I tilt it forward? Um, you can only ever actually see the top portion. That's all we so, see, isn't it? Yeah, yeah basically. Yeah. But look. Scrolly, 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 wow. scrolly, 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 scrolly. There you go. So you go right the way down. That's amazing. Amazing camera oh, skills there. Yeah. Fabulous. Um, and like, like I said, that's double rows. Brilliant. So when we say we've got like three rows of names, four rows mm. of names, you realise just how yeah. many people that is getting involved. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Um, these are beautiful. They're lovely, aren't they? <gasps> Which one should we do first? What do you reckon? That one? I love that. Absolutely love it. Very elegant, Look at those elongated it? beads. Look, aren't they beautiful? Great for positioning pendants yes. as well. That's um, gorgeous. 
How beautiful. So again, you can see yeah. the investment of sterling silver, and then you have these lovely intersections or bars um, of, uh, of silver that really give you that kind of mirror-like luster. Again, solid 925, it's a complete chain. Um, you've got your beautiful kind of belcher. They, would you describe them mm, as belchers so. in between? Uh, which is much more circular um, on a classic bolt ring clasp. You know, you mentioned earlier on actually, was it was it Miss Janet who said about layering? Mm. I think so. I yes. think it was, wasn't it? Um, and this is what layering is all about: mm. mixing up all, mixing up all of your patterns, if you like, of the chains. Because you know, a chain is not just a trace; it can be a multitude of different designs and it doesn't necessarily sorry debbie i beg your pardon debbie um yeah and, and that's the whole look i think is actually mixing up the design uh, miss janet oh. however has just messaged in oh. hello my lovely and she was saying um i was on a, a 25 kilometer charity walk yesterday um so late at night very glad for that extra hour i bet you were my darling a uh, great show team and looking uh, looking lovely mark and l oh bless bless you congratulations wow. congratulations yeah Yes. That's amazing. So you deserved that extra yeah. hour, my lovely. <laughs> well you definitely done. did. Congratulations. That's a, it's an achievement. 25 kilometres. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's good for us. That's a, a big jaunt. We do quite a few 25 kilometres and they are quite long. Yeah. yeah. What's that in miles? Because I speak miles. Oh, gosh. Approximately. Yeah. 15? 15 miles, something like that. 25, 20, kilometers 25 kilometres in miles. Yeah. 15.5. Wow. Kind of yeah. That is a long way. Fair play. Yeah. Fair play. Well That's done. like from here to to Warwick, would you say? Oh, Stratford. It's like Stratford, here to Stratford. Yeah. Yeah. Here to Stratford upon Avon. That's a long walk. Mm. It's a long walk. Um nineteen ninety nine for this, Mark? That's brilliant. With all those beautiful kind of almost El Sparetti inspiration, you've got the stations of those lovely bars. I can see why you like this one, Mark. It is beautiful, very elegant, mm. not overly complicated. Um, have I got quantity of these as well? Hundred of these available. Oh. I think lots of us have, have sort of clicked into Christmas mode this I past hour so. or so. <laughs> um, because yeah, perfect, perfect <laughs> Christmas gifts. What's not to love about it? They're beautiful. And jewelry is not just gemstones, is it? No, you know, no. yeah, we all love gemstones. Of course we do. I think if you shop, wow. uh, if you shop with us here at Jewelry Maker or ultimately Gemporia, you're gonna love gemstones. But you know, take a leaf out of Roberto Coin's book, and it's more precious metal focused, in actual fact. Or someone like. Uh, um, Oh, what's his name? Um, quite oh, Celtic in their design. Macintosh. There you go. Mm. It's all yeah, very yeah. much it is um, precious metal uh, techniques. Um, Twelve ninety nine only. Loads of you there. Don't forget you can shop ahead on Mark's Masterclass kit as well. I think that was risky, folks. I think it was really <laughs> risky, but there you go. Also, you can shop ahead on your amazing advent calendar. It has launched officially this weekend, 2023. We're already approaching double figures remaining. Um, yeah, most businesses will have them on, our, on their website for a good month or so yeah, before, the, yeah. before Christmas. We're looking at a weekend, mm, um, yeah. which is fantastic. Claire, well done getting two. Sharon, getting two. Well done. Down to the final six seconds, and then we're dropping that price tag. London, Mary and Cambridgeshire, Denise and Pamela. Again? Yeah, oh, going oh. lower. I've got just over a hundred available. It's busy on the phone lines. Tap the app or shop on the web if you can. If not, when we say busy, it, we're talking a few minutes. It's not a huge amount of time. 9.99. What's the gram weight on this, please? 2.75 grams. 9.99. With those beautiful bars of precious metal, loads of you getting involved. Really elegant, very Elsa Peretti, diamonds by the yard kind of inspiration where you have those kind of two inch sections. Um, um, and, then, and then you have that sort of bar of precious metal there um, in between. Nine pounds and 99 pence, multi buyers getting involved. It's elegant in its simplicity, isn't yes. it? Yes. Elegant and simplicity. Rita's got two, Jeanette's got two, Claire's got three, Sharon's got two, Gillian, you've got yours, amazing. Um, Tracy, Lydia in Pennsylvania, hello to you. Uh, new customer, Maker in Kent, London, Mary, Denise, Pamela, Carol. I can't keep up with you folks. Another minute clock on your oh. screens. Roscoe says it's not going fast enough. 
Need to pick up the pace on this one. We've got loads to squeeze in between now and masterclass, and I'm worried. I'm concerned about the masterclass. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit nervous. You've not Ro checked yet. Ross hasn't checked it. Oh, no. It's not one of those. You can't stick your head in your sand. In the sand, Ross. Ross, you can't bury your head. You are an ostrich. <laughs> You've done it now, haven't you? It's on pre-order. Mm. You can't keep burying your head. You need to address, has it sold out? Because if it's sold out, we need to mention it on air, don't we? And maybe dive into the masterclass that little right. bit earlier. Yeah. Uh, 9.99. We're going even lower, though, folks. It's lovely to have different variations and styles of chains, Mark. So well, we must have had hundreds of different styles. Yeah, it's Figaro, lovely, isn't it? No, it's beautiful. Figaro, Belcher, Curb. Uh, and those would be different thicknesses and yeah. different lengths yeah. and different metals. And Ball chain. Yeah, yeah. Snake. I'm trying to think of all the different designs yeah. now. But actually, these kind of spaces, not so much. No, no, I don't know how no, to describe no. these. These would be perfect. This chain would be perfect if you have the pass-through earrings. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they? yeah, because they would match that, perfectly. That bar, They're a little you? bit Morse Cody. Mm. Yes, yes, actually. The dots yeah. and dashes. Um, oh. 7.99. You get, I mean, that's a great price for your generic chain, isn't Amazing. it? Your very generic chain. Yeah. And again, I think the thick places like Warren James, Heinz Jewelers, um, Samuels, Argus, even they would struggle to compete. And I'm talking about your generic chains. Um, this is anything but generic. I'll leave that with you just because we want to squeeze lots in. Um, I love this oh, one. I this one well. to me, if you think about the diamond by the yard, and I know it's a funny oh. terminology, it doesn't actually make sense, but there's history behind it. Um, we spoke about that, didn't we? Yes, yes. Um, it's the stations of diamonds that Elsa Peretti uh, um, came up with decades ago. Um, now this is that beauty, but without, you know, without the diamonds, without the diamond price tag. Now your advent calendar is coming up next, but you'll see where I'm coming from, I love this. Because uh, uh, with sterling silver being the most lustrous of your precious mm. metal, the joy is that it gives you like a mirror shine. So it looks like there's a gemstone encrusted within. So for me, this is as close to the Elsa Peretti diamond by the yard necklace mm. that we could possibly be without a diamond, without a single diamond in place. Um, 60 pounds and 99 pence. So we've got quantity, Roscoe. And it's gonna stop your pendant sliding as well. Yeah, yeah. It's because oh, yeah, nice idea. Yes, the, 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 the dots yes. will basically keep it secure and central. Are we doing this in one price crash? Is there quantity? 100 available. These wonderful little pops, little beaded details, approximately every, what, two inches, maybe? One price crash jewelry makers, lots of you choosing this as well. <laughs> Seven pounds and so ninety-nine pence. I think wearing this pence. with the first, with that one there. So you're this talking one. about Morse code, weren't you? So you've yeah, got your dots yes. and you've got your dashes. Oh, that's a great idea. Yeah, wearing them both together. That's a great idea. Yeah, that looks lovely, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Mm, yeah, layer yeah. them up, dots and dashes. You've got that too. Uh, and then don't forget your infinity chain because we spoke about layering, didn't we? Where's the clasp? Gosh, I love that. I have to look you for have the clasp. To look for it. Yeah. There it is. So you put that on there as well. Perfect. That's lovely, Perfect isn't it? Perfect layer, isn't it? Yeah, beautiful. Obviously around the neckline, they wouldn't bunch together so much, but look how lovely that is as a combination. You can get all three, all three today, or oh, stop permitting that is. Right now we're talking about the lovely uh, beaded um, dot necklace. We had a hundred of them, but there's a lot of multi-buyers. Even for a fairly generic sterling silver chain, which absolutely do have their place, that's a great price tag. But for something like this, which is very design-led, uh, design um, amazing, well mm. done, well done. It's time though, Mark. Um, it's got to be. Look, we launched this yesterday and we're already rapidly approaching the final double figure quantity. You know, when when Joe Malone or Clarins or White Company or Dior or all of that, whenever they do their advent calendars, they at least expect it to last probably a month, I'm going to say. Ours is probably going to see the weekend. That's the reality. Yeah. And I have to commend our team that work all year to put, to put together your advent calendar. Now, if you were busy yesterday, you might have missed this window of opportunity. We have the final opportunities today. Um, it's the best advent calendar oh, yet. Without a doubt. By, yeah, yeah, by yeah. a mile. Um, 2023, your Christmas advent is up next.
We spoke about, Mark, uh, yesterday, we were talking about the history of the advent, and we were saying that, you know, it's as nostalgic as, like, traditions like picking up the Christmas tree mm. or making the Christmas pudding or your mince pie, sausage rolls is always a big thing mm. in our house, you know, me making the sausage rolls for Christmas. Um, it, it, it becomes part of the, the, the tradition, you know, and I think very much, I always buy my family's advent calendars and last year I actually didn't have one. Oh. I didn't have one at all. But And this year I think, you know, it's really important. It's something Alison said yesterday. We're all busy, aren't we, all the time. We're busy, we're working, we're, you know, we've got cost of living and you're, there's lots, there's lots to, 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 I don't want to say endure, that's the wrong words, but there's a, life is, is intense, isn't it, at times. Mm. Lot to contend with at the moment. Isn't yeah, it? exactly. Mm. So take time. That hour that you get with this advent calendar on the back, live by the way, and make along with our designers for free mm. with the contents, take that time or at least record it so you can watch it back. You time. Because particularly in, in Christmas, Mark, and you love Christmas, don't you? Mm -hmm. you're, uh, you, you know, you're probably <laughs> more Christmas than me, yes. and that's saying something. Um, but you know, it's so busy the build up to, isn't it? It's crazy. How often yeah. have you actually reached Christmas Day and been unwell? Had a cold it's or something? It's Boxing like? Day for me. Is it? Yeah, I, if, if, if I'm going to go down with anything, it'll be Boxing Day. Yeah. Because you're, you're, you're so energised on the big build up. Yeah. And then Boxing Day has that really sort of deflated sort of, oh, that's. That's done. And that's when I tend to, okay. to get a bit, yeah. But it. it so it's actually mm. not letting that happen because I mm. always get a cold or something yeah, like yeah. that at Christmas because you're running around frantic yeah, yeah, here and there. You still yeah. got to do your working day. You still got to make pack lunches, clean the house, walk the dog, whatever it might be. Just take that moment to sort of treat yourself and rest. Ultimately, you do what you want to do. But it is, you know, very traditional. I think the advent calendar. It certainly takes me back to my childhood. Chris was saying yesterday. Sometimes used to recycle the mm, yeah, calendars year yeah. over year. And I found this article. These aren't my words, but it talks about the history of the advent calendar. I'll briefly run through oh. this because I did this yesterday as well. Um, but yeah, it's actually something that dates back to 1903. 1903, oh, you can recent. see. Yeah. yeah. Uh, before we get into this, a quick reminder of what Advent actually is. In the Latin, it's the Latin word for. Uh, sorry. In Latin, the word Advent, Adventus, means arrival or coming. Um, it was originally believed that in the fourth, fifth century, um, it was a period of time before we knew, uh, before the new year, that involved prayer, penance, and fasting before Christian converts uh, being baptized. Basically, the exact opposite of dubious office parties and seasonal overindulgence that usually takes place in the run-up to Christmas. Um, the tradition of marking the days until Christmas on an Advent calendar likely started in the 19th century Germany oh. though the question of who uh, the original inventor is still in uh, mm, still contested right. one strong contender for the title of the inventor of the advent calendar is Gerard Lang or more specifically Gerard Lang's mum incidentally oh. <laughs> the other contender was an Austrian Protestant who in 1902 uh, sold calendars from his bookshop uh, but his invention didn't come with anything edible and everybody knows an advent calendar must have chocolate at least. Um, more on that later. Um, you might disagree. Mm. Um, anyway, Gerard's enterprising mum attached 24 cookies uh, onto the square of a cardboard uh, for the young Gerard to scoff in the days leading up to the festive season. Uh, when he was all grown up, Gerard remembered his mum's inspired idea and went on to manufacture his own uh, his own advent calendar in 1908 uh, with his business partner Richold. Um, he didn't bother with the cookies, but introduced the concept of sealing little pictures hidden oh, behind little closed doors lovely. I remember yeah. that um, unfortunately the business came to an end in 1930 um, but the concept had caught on a few years after Richard and Lang went into liquidation the sank Joannis I think I've said that right, printing company, amongst others, started producing advent calendars, uh, but in this instance, with a distinct twist on the original concept. Goodbye, 24 little doors concealing little pictures, uh, and the vague possibility of chocolate. Hello, 24 little doors concealing Aww. biblical verse. Um, okay, I need to swing round a moment, because <laughs> I can't quite read that from there. 
Um, so the best advent calendars are not always the chocolatey ones. And Mark, you will totally agree mm, with that. I totally agree You with don't that. like chocolate, do you? Um, sometimes they are perfumed, the alcoholic, the beautiful, or the bejeweled. While there are plenty of cocoa treat calendars to enjoy, should you be wanting a traditional moment this Christmas, there are also collections that look to the other sweet, uh, uh, to other sweet treats, biscuits, for example, or candy floss. Savory calendars are proving more and more popular too, with uh, a refrigerator version oh, yes. filled with cheese uh, one of our favorites um, in short the luxury advent calendar market is a cozy and exciting world of excess where the difficulties we all face each morning fade away in the thrill of opening a new window mm. I like that I like that particularly if you're not a morning person no. <laughs> you know great give you a little bit of joy first thing in the morning our <laughs> advent calendars worth it in a word yes even if you opt to wander to your local supermarkets and pick up something simple as a Cadbury classic, there's something thrilling about enjoying a treat every morning of the month in terms of building excitement for Christmas. Popping the window open on an advent calendar ranks up there with choosing a Christmas tree and putting up the decorations. Now, we certainly think you should be buying a classic chocolate calendar, but we're also here to recommend treating yourself or someone else uh, to a more upmarket morning surprise. <laughs> Okay, right then. <laughs> uh, amazing. Shall we show you some of those upmarket morning surprises? Shall we? Amazing. Porsche, as we spoke about, yes, one million dollars, but it does include a yacht and a watch, <laughs> and Honestly. a free kitchen, and a kitchen. I'm betting if you can afford to spend a million on a, on on a on a, an advent calendar, you can probably get your kitchen before yeah, Christmas. I think so. um, yeah. Clarence, however, seventy-five pounds, but twelve days, just twelve days. Twelve. Oh, yeah. Twelve days. Lovely, very nice, seventy-five pounds. So do you open that one after Christmas yeah. rather than before? Then I, I would don't imagine. know. Do you? Yeah. Yeah. Would it not? Twelve days of Christmas. Yeah. But it calls that, it calls it an advent. Mm. They don't they don't know what they're no, talking about. No. Give them, have a word, Chris. Yeah. Uh, say, look, Advent is coming. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. the arrival. That's Not smart. after. I love Jo Malone. I like the box, yeah. Very nice box. By the way, our box is made from the same location. How much? By the way, £350. Three in, uh, jo Malone is expensive, I have to tell you. Very expensive. For Jo Malone, like one of their bottles of perfume, you're talking about £100. Right. For one bottle okay. of perfume. Lovely. Still 350 quid. Wedgwood? 695 I don't know what you get in there. I reckon, they're, it? I reckon they're Christmas decorations, maybe pottery decorations. Some little baubles. Oh, just, well, is Swarovski on your list? Oh, it's not. Oh, I wonder I if think, they I do. I think Swarovski do one, don't they? They'd be yeah. missing a trick if they didn't, yeah. for sure. Next one. White Company. I like the White Company. Um, £175. Gosh. Nice. Still expensive, isn't it? Um, so very expensive hotel chocolat, posh chocolate, basically seventy-five pounds. It's nice. It is delicious. Is it? Yeah. However, it's still seventy-five pounds. Right. Next one, Molten Brown, lovely, one hundred ninety-five pounds. That's do? all like uh, shower gel, soap, oh, shampoos. Okay. Lovely, right. beautiful. Yeah, yeah. If you go to Bista Village, by the way, oh yeah, yeah. Um, there's a Molten Brown oh, shop right. there as well. Yeah, right. um, really nice. Really nice, but they are, again, they are expensive. £195, <laughs> and they'll be little bottles, by the way. Oh. Little tiny bottles. Next one, Lockitan, same. Soap, right, okay. basically soap, yeah. £99. You've got Body Shop, £145, which seems ex steep. I think that's expensive for Body Shop, yeah, yeah. personally. Just saying. Next one, Lush. Now oh, the these soap people. Yeah, they dissolve in the bath. The bath oh, bombs, bath basically. A right. hundred. I love walking past their shop. It smells nice though, yeah, yeah. yeah. But let's just say they dissolve in the bath. Mm. And how much is it? Hundred and eighty-five oh. pounds. At Mac makeup, one hundred and sixty-five. Wow. Uh, worth over four hundred pounds. That's a good saving. It's not a bad saving, is it? To be fair, but it's all about your makeup, which. I always, I'm always sceptical of makeup because I always think they're going to put the ones that don't sell. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, the colours. Uh, Carluccio's. The restaurant. Carluccio's. The yeah. <laughs> so what do they have in theirs then? Is it oils and spices and things? Yeah, or? cheese. Oh, okay. Balsamic. Right, I nice love though. balsamic. Yeah, love, that's nice. £95 for that one. 
95 pound i'm sure you get or dior oh you can go all out with dior this is um i mean obviously a totally different price point once upon a time the house uh, sorry once again sorry the house invites you to experience the magic of the season with its most prestigious gift of the year let the dior stars carry you to a galaxy of unforgettable treasures uh, with the year's exquisite festive calendar crafted in the visionary imagination of artists i can't see what's his name petro petro, petro rufio, rufio. Yeah. um amazing so lot pretty i could be we could talk mm. about this for hours couldn't we wow. pretty much every single big brand does an advent calendar and we work all year they'll work all year on creating theirs as well um, what we really wanted to include is your most popular products some of our biggest and most exciting launches um, and items as well that we know we're not going to be able to get maybe for next year's calendar can i tell you that within i'm not going to tell you all of it i don't want to spoil the surprise there's a mellow mellow pearl there's south sea what else did we see in there there's lovely bales all oh, neck yeah. carved jadeite bales all this jewelry is created by our talented designers and i can tell you mark do you know where it goes to mm-hmm you wouldn't pay that for the one compo one component you were given would you no you wouldn't pay that for the carved guatemalan jadeite you wouldn't pay it for the south sea no should we do it now we would have expected this to last maybe a month in the lead up to christmas however we're actually already in double figures in fact, exactly 99. 99. Exactly well, we 99. We haven't spoken about the most important bit, I think. Because we, we have really worked hard. Go for it, because you're right. You know, And, and when you yeah. work out the price tag, £4.16 per draw, that's... So for every draw, of which there are 24, not only do you get a most beautiful item, but at 1 o'clock till 2 o'clock, every day of those 24 days, the guest designer, who will be on that show in the morning, will then come on live at one o'clock to do an hour long make along with the so forth item. So you've got 24 hours of demonstrations and, and work alongs with the guest designers. They've got me for five hours in December and yep. I'm very lucky to have Christmas Yay. Eve with Elle. I think Alison's got five hours. I think Claire's got five hours, and then you've got you've got Monica and Jan, and Jan. you've got Yvonne, you've got um, Natalie. Natalie, you've got you've got Susie. How Menham. amazing is that? Yep. How so amazing! What to do with so it's products. not just the contents, which are no. unbelievable. It is yeah. abs. I mean, that's invaluable, Mark. I mean, I'm, and I said this to Alison yesterday. I was like, I'm fairly sure your hourly rate is more than four pounds sixteen. Which <laughs> you know, this is the thing. You know, you are basically. £4.16, even if you were to pay that for the tutorial, the live tutorial, mm. and everything else is for free. Yeah. It's unbelievable. Now, you know, you can make all of these all amazing of pieces. This. Yeah. Let's not mess around. Let's take this to the price that we are meant to close at. And mm. I'm going to tell you, Wayne was sat with us live. He was, on, uh, was at home, granted, watching at home. Um, and he was like, look, this takes up a lot of space within the warehouse. They do because I don't really want them to hang around. So let's reduce the price. The original plan all year, 365 days of the year, this was the price tag that they had in mind, the powers that be. I vocalized that. They were very uh, vocal about that too. You've got to think about it. There's a Guatemalan carved haigu that I'm fairly sure we have sold for about the price that's on your screens. You know, a mellow mellow pearl for definitely the price that's on your screens is absolutely amazing. We did go even lower even lower mark you worked with a very special piece didn't you mm -hmm. yeah well i was just working out we were talking about the the, the, the make-alongs afterwards we used to do workshops yeah do you remember and the average price of a workshop an eight-hour workshop was a hundred pounds mm -hmm. so you've got three eight-hour workshops in this so you're looking at 300 pound without any of the products without any of the products that's a really yeah. good point yeah really yeah. good point yeah. Now, Wayne instructed us, our sale manager, he said, look, okay, we meant, we intended 179, let's do a mega deal, we've got 500 on, this is exciting, we love bringing you the advent calendar as well, you know, we absolutely love to do it, the savings, you would not get 
That's five pound That's per yeah. per draw. Let me just I don't wanna spoil yeah. the surprise, but I, I opened a couple of these. Do you want me to just a couple? Just a couple. Would we bring a bead scoop for, for, for five pounds? No. The product you worked with, would that mm -hmm. be five pounds? Well, I ha I, I'd never heard of this product. Hadn't you? And I had to phone Georgia and get clarity to what I was actually working oh, it's with. One of the and rarest. I could not quite believe what we had. No. Oh, no. So I don't want to spoil. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is this. <gasps> um, <sighs> All I'll say is coast of Australia. Mm. So I found that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll give you that little sneaky peek. Don't show the number. Okay, I won't show the number. Can you see the number? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sterling silver, wow. jadeite. It's a flower. It's a rose. It's a slider. How beautiful is that? How amazing is that imperial white? Okay, uh, I'm not. I won't. I won't get any more out. I'm not going to get any more out. I'll oh. look, but I'm not going to show. And you get the make-alongs, Mark. You're so right. These are reusable boxes. They're quality boxes yeah. as well, made in the same location that many of those big brands are as well. We did an. Oh, I showed. I showed this one yesterday. Look. Mm. That's lovely, isn't it? Abs no, I'm not showing you. 60 seconds because we did not stop here either. We're going to match the price tag for you. Whether you put this under the Christmas tree and save it till Christmas Day and then record the make-alongs. I've got a... Str Go on. Am I allowed to? What? I've got, I won't tell you when it is. I've got a strand that I've never worked with before. Okay. That is the price of the... One strand? Of the box. Okay. Yeah. Whereas you've still got all those in there yeah. as well. And this, the, it is our proudest, uh, we're, we're most proud of this one out of all the advent calendars that we've done. And I think I have to say, your credit where it's due, the team really yeah. have excelled on yeah. this one this year. Yeah. Um, 500 were ever actually commissioned. They do take space in our workshop, so uh, in our warehouse, sorry. So we don't want them to, so we do want to get rid of them as quickly as we possibly mm -hmm. can. Um, and also, you know, you can have them there, say from the, on the 1st of December, you get that joy of opening that little yeah. drawer, all that nostalgia. First thing I would do, and I think Alison mentioned this yesterday, is when you get, when you get your advent calendar, yeah. all the numbers will be in order. Yeah. Okay, I would mix them all up and jumble them up. Yeah, because that's part of the fun, looking yeah, for the number. Yeah, looking for the number. Yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. You jumble them all up, you wouldn't have them in order. No. I don't know, is that a new thing that the advent calendars are in order? Know. I don't know. Love them. What do you reckon, Gerard? Is it are they meant to be <laughs> <laughs> Are they meant to be in order yeah. or are they meant to be all jumbled yeah. up? Not entirely sure. Um, and afterwards, you know what? Yeah. You could turn this into a cheese one. You could. Next year. That's a nice idea. Turn it yeah. into cheese. I quite like that. You could use your bar. <laughs> Don't they have a gin one and all sorts gin, of Gin, yeah. I bought Tom a beer one I one year. I thought of a rude one. Did you? Did you? Are we allowed to have a rude one? Why not? What would you put in your rude Victoria's one? Victoria's Secret. Ooh, do you reckon they do one? Probably. Do you think they would? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you know, I've, yeah. I've got this thing about Victoria's Secret. I love, if I've got a spare half an hour, yeah. I go onto YouTube yeah. and I watch all the catwalk Are shows. Are they goddesses? They're incredible. Yeah, absolute goddesses. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I know. I, I don't. I don't find it a coincidence that if ever we fly anywhere, that and you know when you stop in the, you stop in an airport and you mm. go go get yourself a breakfast or whatever it is, I don't find it a coincidence that my husband always finds a table outside the Victoria's Secret shop. Always, oh, and yeah. I can't even blame him. No. Um, hello, Dorset. Can you show us close up the high goo again, please? I'm so tempted. I tell you what, yeah. Can you reach can out, Mark? We'll show Monica's piece of jewellery by all means. Oh. And you're going to be shown how to make this. Yes. Can you believe it's it? It's a make-along, an hour yeah. make-along with this. This is right. incredible. Um, that's Guatemalan Olmec Jadeite, which we don't often see in carvings. No. Um, there it is. That alone for this advent calendar. Yeah. For me, you've bought your Guatemalan Olmec Haigu. You've for got that. everything else for free. Yeah. The make-alongs, the rest of the content, everything else for free. Genuinely, I think our team have excelled themselves this 24 year. 24 hours of one on one. I think yeah. that's amazing, isn't it? 24 yeah, hours. I think that's incredible. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. And all the yeah. techniques that you could learn, you know? 
It is one on one, yeah. lovely, you know, new time. Yeah. And all of us guest designers, we've worked so hard. Yeah, on these yeah, pieces. you always do. Yeah. Uh, Gillian, hello to you in Lanarkshire, saying, um, "Hi, don't worry about spoiling the surprise. Most calendars show all the contents." That's true. Oh, That's even Christmas very cracker true. people, do, even Christmas crackers now have the pictures of the items true. on the back. That's very true. Yeah, yeah. True. Am I going to get chocolate yeah. today? Yeah. yeah. Yes, you wow. are. Yes, you are. We're going to hold this on your screens for one more minute, jewelry makers. Amazing. Does that list go up and down again? Um, it does. Oh, amazing. Well yeah. done. Literally tons I think of you it's beautiful. there. We are down to the last. I think. Oh, we surely must be approaching the last ten percent, Roscoe. Is that right? So hang on a minute. So there's this item. Yeah. Okay. Plus the one I've got on Christmas Eve. Yeah. Which, in my opinion, that's that's got to be at least the, between the two items, that's 150, 160 pounds. Yeah, more. But Plus yeah. the 24 hours. Yep. And then you've still got 22 other boxes and. Mm -hmm. Oh my word. Yeah. That's and you haven't got to pay excess postage for this either, no, because no. it's a bigger item. Yeah. You know, it's still 3.95. I can't. Honestly, the quality is amazing. Oh. And there's a sneaky peek of one very oh. special item, isn't there? One very, very, I had very no special idea. item. Oh, I've let it written. I've told everyone there. No, I've I've mentioned. Oh, so oh okay. that's a mellow mellow. I've never heard of it. Mellow mellow, I've ultra rare, it. ultra mm. ultra ultra rare. How I can't wait amazing! To do the demo on that. It, you, you, we yeah. should not be able to get mellow mellow for a hundred pounds. Should not. Oh. Unbelievable. Now, last warning, everybody. Pre-orders on Mark's masterclass. Oh no! Don't, Oh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Ross, have you get your head out the sand now? Where are we at? <laughs> hey. Oh no. Oh, uh, we're close. Very close to half the stock. That's all right then. That's all right. But mm. there's loads of you with it in your basket <gasps> now. Look at that recording. Eighteen months. The bundle that started it all, Mark. It did. I think it did. It. I think you're right. It started it all, you know, the yeah. popularity of these wonderful mermaidial yeah. coated stones. And these are quartz, they're not glass, they're quartz. No, no, so no, no. Gemstone. No. Genuine oh, I, I gemstones. Love, I love gemstone. Oh no. You can get it on pre order right now. Mark, the price that's on the website is no way near, no way is near. it? No way near. No way no. near. Now we're going to do one more auction before we dive into the break. I love this jacket. This, yeah, we launched this, I think, together. Yeah, I think we did. Yeah, I love it. It's the most beautiful. Yeah. Oh yes, we did. Green. Yes. Um, this color, and I like the fact that jewelry make oh, this yes. is my favorite color actually. Yeah. It's that kind of dark Racing forest green. green. Yeah, yeah, I think it's yeah. so elegant. Um, when we redo in our studios, with which it's not finished, I was going, yeah, have dark green behind. I think that would be really elegant. Um, well, it's that. It's the, it, it's that beautiful these. color. Um, faceted as well. If you've got serpentine, again, gem, we don't get a chance to speak about it very often. It's a beautiful gemstone with distinct similarities to like your nephrite jade. It has lovely translucency. Um, often actually a, a carved uh, um, in the same manner that jadeite mm. and nephrite actually is. It's a full meter long length strand. I mean, look, how, look how gorgeous that it's saturation is, that color it. is. I love it. I think this with gold mm. looks we absolutely don't have amazing. Much serpentine, do no, we? couldn't do a showcase. No, it's such a shame because it's gorgeous. We did, uh, didn't, didn't we ask when Wayne, um, when he asked the question, he was like, "What gemstones would you like?" I was like, "Serpentine." We don't get it. No. Really, ever get it? Serpentine, seraphonite. I'd like that as well. Like to see the return oh, of those yeah. uh, those gemstones. But it's yeah. all this wonderful deep green. Um, now, very limited. Now you get a full oh. meter long length. Well, are they six mils. Mm. Oh, lovely that was gold oh, yeah just be beautiful wouldn't it and i would just bead it long line necklace i know that mark you could turn your hand to some something like the yeah. kiss cross super super limited shall we quickly talk about serpentine because we don't get the opportunity very quickly serpentine is a deep green crystal made of hydrated magnesium silicate uh, seldom blotched or splattered similar to a snake or a serpent skin um, the crystal of the serpentine group have uh, comparable bodily attributes and comparable forms frequently they appear as fine grain compounds and are hard to discern in a stone it's hard mm. to cut effectively yes, yeah. in sim simple english uh, the typical physical 
characteristics of this gemstone um, are its greenish color, enhanced uh, appearance and light texture. It recalls the viewer um, of a snake from which its name was rooted from. Serpentine's translucent subtlety, slippery brightness, ease of shaping and ability to achieve a polish are highly renowned. Um, it is a familiar gem, con uh, construction element and ornamental materials with these characteristics. Mm. I, I, that, 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 lots of words confuse me a little bit there, um, but it is a very difficult gemstone to actually get hold of. Uh, the meaning behind the gemstone, the name of this gem is rooted, as we said earlier on, to the snake world. While its green hue very definitely has given its name, it represents various beliefs about the characteristics of the serpentine gem, dating back to the old times. Uh, it's a magnificent cleansing gemstone. It purifies the blood and the entire body, or is believed, I should say. Serpentine eradicates bacteria and parasites, promotes calcium oh. and magnesium intake, cures hypoglyc hypoglycemia and diabetes. I should say believed too, by the way, folks, and assists with, the, uh, with endurance and durability. It aids with anxiety alleviation. It's incredibly powerful and is reliable. This gem can help um, in cellular restoration and replenish of your strength levels. So if you're feeling a little bit, yeah. you know, zapped, maybe yeah. at Christmas time, we need to be wearing this. Um, but again, not the best quality in this no, photo, I have to say. say um, yeah. A little bit, a, a bit murky, uh, a bit too limey in its colour, but still 210 pounds. Oh. It's 115 pounds. It's not great, is it? Not for no. me, anyway. No. Not for me. How about a faceted metre long length strand? That same beautiful deep green colour, that's very clouded, very included, not very translucent. Again, oh. stone and may, very matte. Very, very matte. You want translucency within your serpentine, ideally. £50 for that. Uh, not for me, that one. I know which I would prefer. Um, these are six millimetres. You get the full metre long lengths. So you can make that bracelet multiple times over, everyone. We've only got a limited quantity of them, so good luck, everyone. As we lead right. ourselves into Mark's amazing masterclass jewellery maker, use the time during the break to secure yours. £499. £499 of this wonderful deep forest green. There's no other gem like it, is there? No. I think it's gorgeous. Of this gem, we couldn't oh, do a showcase. Stopping. No. Oh. No way near. Oh my gosh! Right. If we did have enough of this to, I tell you what, though, we haven't helped ourselves. We could do a showcase if we didn't do meter long lengths. Yeah. Yeah, if they were full, if they were thirty-eight yeah. centimeters, then you know that's more possible, isn't it? That's more doable. Let's take it to your closing price. Translucency with deep forest greens, flex of silver within, 99 pounds and 99 pence. For this gemstone, that's an absolutely unbelievable deal. I'd have to knot it with red cord, Yeah, I that'd think. be gorgeous. That'd be beautiful, wouldn't it? Absolutely that's gorgeous. Lovely. And there's more translucency. I don't yeah. know if I hold this out for Chris. Look at that translucency. That quality is amazing, isn't it? Oh, this with the jadeite bundle we had earlier oh, on. Yes. That would be wonderful too. Pauline London, well into you, Fife, Elaine, Pauline, Maker in Oxfordshire, Susan, Sarah in Yorkshire. Um, again, it's busy. How many, when you say limited, how, how limited is limited? Ten. Ten? Oh no. Yeah, because using that black and white, so I would go black, green, white, green, black, green, white, green. Nice. That just look beautiful. Lovely. What go for like a wrap around mm, yeah. long, long, long line so. necklace? That'd yeah. be gorgeous. What knotted as well? Stunning! I love that wow. idea. Check out though, because there is only ten of them left. Um, we're moments away from your masterclass with the ten strand bundle of your beautiful mermaid quartz. It is back after eighteen months of mm. waiting. Of course, any questions? Um, uh, drop your messages into the studio for Mark's demonstration. There's just four of these left now. Sorry, you've done it. Well done, Pauline. You've done it. Well done, London Fife. 
Lane. Uh, I can't, there's loads of you there. Uh, make sure you are checking out. Wall of Fame is coming up this other, the other side of the break. Um, again, you can secure your masterclass kit, and I would strongly encourage that. Um, already approaching half the stock has been allocated. You know, I thought it was risky. You, 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 you were right. Yeah. You were right. You were right. Um, maybe it's because you don't realise just how low this uh, this masterclass kit is going to. Um, trust me, it's good, isn't multiples. it? Multiples. That's a big mm. statement, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Amazing. Make sure you are ready to check out your baskets, everybody. Um, secure yours and join us for your masterclass after this. <laughs> Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My favourite gemstone is Opal. I love the colour play and the iridescence. I'd like to win Britain's Next Gem so I can share the knowledge and teach the things that I wish someone had taught me in the beginning. Jewellery makers, head over to the website for our biggest web sale ever. We have over 2,000 lines with up to 80% off. So head over to www.jewellerymaker.com for our Bling It Back web exclusive sale and grab them deals before they disappear. I'm Carol and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is solid silver, I'm a silversmith. I want to win Britain's Next Gem because jewellery making and jewellery teaching brings me so much joy and I want to share that joy with other people. Back by popular demand, introducing the one, the only, Gemporia Festive Ball. Party with your favourite presenters from Gems TV, Hobby Maker, Jewellery Maker and Sewing Street. We're all together for a night that's going to be the talk of the town. Situated at the fabulous Stratford Manor, close to the world famous Stratford-upon-Avon. Tickets are just £99 per person, including a welcome drink, a three-course dinner, half a bottle of wine and music that'll have you dancing all night long. There'll also be a shop at the party, and even a tombola, if you're feeling lucky. Numbers are limited, so order your tickets today to avoid disappointment. Let's make it a night to remember at the Gemporia Festive Ball on Saturday the 25th of November. See you there. Hi, I'm Ellie and I'm through to the semi-final of Britain's Next Gem. My medium of choice is wire work. I love wrapping, I love counting. It soothes my soul being able to wire wrap with crystals. <laughs> I would love to win Britain's Next Gem. Um, it's basically something, doing something like this is, some, is like a dream for me. Being able to present and teach and do this is, yeah, it would be a dream come true to win this. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewellery Maker. Thank mm -hmm. you.
need to swap back. I don't. It's, it's quite. I can't, yes. <laughs> we've just realised we've swapped chairs. Our chairs have swapped. That's all right. We'll do the Wall of Fame. And yeah, then and we'll, then we'll. we'll then then I'll do it. We'll I'll do G. it. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wall of Fame. In fact, where is my Wall of Fame? I'm so sorry. I, I should have been this. preparing this. Oh yes. Yes. I do recognise this. That's beautiful. Right. Isn't that what Susie demoed the other yes. day? Yes. And I think you messaged in about this as well, Marishka. It's beautiful. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's lovely one. You've seen it literally on, I think this was Friday's show, it wasn't was. it? It was, that's right. On Friday's show. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't have it. Sorry, I should have said this in the break, shouldn't I? Sorry, Adam. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Adam. That's my fault. That's my fault. i tell you what. Wow. Should we talk about the kit and then come back to it? Let's talk about the kit and then come back to it because um, you can be shopping ahead then and we'll get your wall of fame all sorted. My bad, should have mentioned it on the break. Um, okay, Mark, 18 months in the waiting. So I launched this on May the 7th. So it's just started. I remember our, the video start, in start your start garden. birthday week. Oh yes, that's right. I remember it. Yeah, yeah. So it's been a long time getting it back. Yeah. And uh, it, as, as you said, I love coated gemstones. I love coated glass, anything that... that that, that we can mess around with to make it look even more beautiful. And mermaid quartz, it's, it's such a clear, I, I, I was making all these pieces and I just can't quite fathom out how they do it. So they take the gemstone, the round six mil quartz, and then half of it, they leave clear. Yep. And the other half, it's not coated, it's internal. I don't know how they do it. It's absolutely amazing, the, the procedure. I've just yeah, no idea if how it was, it's- If it wasn't coated, I guess, Oh, sorry, if it was coated, then you've got. Yeah. Oh I just my don't good. Oh, I can see. see. I mean. No, I can see. Yeah, I just don't know how. I know they how do. they do it. I oh, can you know work it out. I can figure it out. Okay. So you take. Look, I don't know if you can see this here. They take two effectively cabochons, and the oh. colours inside. And then they drill it. Can you see? And then they drill. Is that how they do it? No. So imagine you've got two cabochons, two round cabochons. And then they put them together like two slices of bread and a sandwich. But they still must drill through. Yes, true. So then is they that, drill is that through. Before yeah, or yeah. After? Well, I don't be, know. Be after, wouldn't it? But the colour is in the centre. Can you see it? Can yeah. you just about make it out? It's amazing. That is fantastic, isn't it? And yeah. obviously to do that across all of these. Yeah, I Thank know. you, Lauren. I'm so sorry. I should have asked for this during the break, shouldn't I? Um, anyway, shop ahead and pre-order. You get ten strands and you get your additional, um, your additional. As a freebie. Freebies, basically, if you see yeah, beads. No. Sorry, Mariska. So back to you, lovely. 929. Oh. Uh, Mariska says, good morning, jewellery maker. Oh. I was so inspired by are. Susie uh, that I decided to have a try with Shell Pearl, built, bought from jewellery maker. Spaces were bought a few years back from jewellery maker um, when they bought Finding Packs to Air. Mm. I know. Yes. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> I remember that. Um, is that a hint? <laughs> I think that's a hint. We can try. We can definitely try. Uh, 930 yeah. is from Jade. Hello to you, Jade. Um, hi, Jewelry Maker. This week's entry is a Ruby Zoocyte stretchy bracelet. Good luck, all, and thank you. That's lovely. That's gorgeous. Love I Ruby love Zoocyte. Ruby Zoocyte. Yeah. Yeah. Again, I can imagine that. That looked beautiful with the Zoe, with the um, sep the serpentine. serpentine yeah. That we just bought. Similar greens, yeah, aren't they? Yeah. Um, do you want to read the next one? So, Lynn, number 931. Oh, oh that's very pretty that's Look amazing that. hello everyone <laughs> hope you are well please find attached to my entry to the wall of fame it's a long line kiss cross necklace inspired by an idea mark discussed on a recent show using ombre colored acrylic beads with black seed beads this was an absolute joy to make my heartfelt thanks to mark and all the fabulous jm team for all that you do best wishes and good luck to everyone in this week's draw that's amazing isn't that it look at that photography is yeah. stunning thank you lynn number 932 is from barbara and barbara says hi everyone this is my make diamond colored at the front with yellow diamonds at the sides finished with zircon gold spacers and clasped with blue diamond earrings never thought i would own diamonds thank you jm well that is quite a suite of jewelry isn't it isn't it just incredible our last entry for today is 933 oh look at this isn't oh, that wow, beautiful, beautiful from diane and diane says hello everyone this is my latest make it's for a friend who saw a necklace she liked on tv asked if i could make one similar it's a 925 one millimeter silver wire hammered mm. and then soldered 
with 923, 923 silver connectors and gold-plated silver spacer beads with a twisted silver toggle clasp. Every component from JM. Good luck to all the entrants, and thank you from the bottom of my heart for your fabulous shows. Aww. Best wishes to all, and that's from Diane. Diane, that's gorgeous. Isn't that amazing? How you see it when you can see something, and yeah. then can you make something similar and then produce it? Yeah. Incredible. How lovely. And thank I, you, I, thank I you, I everyone. I hope you take that as a compliment as well, that people are like, yes. I've seen this, can you make me one? Um, amazing. Oh, amazing. Oh, you're talented, you really are. Well done. Um, still time for you to get involved. The official, or the draw happens on a Wednesday, so that'll be with myself. Um, so get your entries in. The only stipulation is, of course, that they are jewelry maker products. Now, Mark, mm. are you ready? Mm -hmm. Where it all began. Where it all began. No, it's just, it's just beautiful. And I think you're right with how they make it. It's, it's quite time consuming, I would imagine. Very time consuming. Gosh. Very, very. I mean, they often oh. use quartz on top of other softer stones because mm. it's seven point five on the yeah. blue scale, so very yes. durable. So yeah. they'll use quartz, say, over the over the over a slither of yes opal, yeah. for example. So it does make sense. Within these, in the heart, you have got that beautiful, beautiful colour of your mermaid, um, but it's not just one strand; it's ten it's strands. Ten. Beautifully ombre as well. No, it's absolutely gorgeous. So you've got your hots and your colds if you want to, um, Shall we work through them? to separate them. Shall yeah, yeah, we? Yeah. I don't know. No, I hope you take this as a, a you know, no, no disrespect to the seed beads, but I am just going to put them down the desk. You get those as well. You get those as well. You get them as well. As a little freebie. Um, do you want yeah. to start cools or hots? Let's go cool. Cool. Dark? Yes. Look you know, at I've, just, I've just come from the lavatory break. You didn't need to know that. <laughs> and, um, and I looked out the window. There's a beautiful blue sky and sunshine out there. It's lovely. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, it's lovely. Yeah. Did this remind you of that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at that. It's gorgeous, isn't the it? The price we're going to for this kit, this bundle, I would buy that strand yes. for. Yes. It's just beautiful. Absolutely. Right, yeah. let's keep with the cools. Yeah. Let's go to... Oh, look at this. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Amazing. And depending on which light source you're in, you get a different different colour glow on top of the colour. Yeah. It's, it's stunning. It's one of my favourites, I think. I wonder if I can put these in the right order. I'm not going to be able to hold all, all ten mm. of them. Oh, Purple. this is beautiful as well. Can you see the blues coming off every time you move? Yeah. You get the blue stunning, colour. isn't it? Look at that. Hang on, I've got... I've been very spoilt this year with, with stones because we've had the yeah. selenite. Yeah. And we've had the rainbow quartz. Yeah. And the coated quartzes. And now we've got the, the mermaid quartz. Oh, and I if love you them. love an ombre, you're going to be cringing at I, my, I, my, <laughs> my ombre. No, you're doing well. Really? Yeah. In that one. I've really championed the, the, the coated stones. and. I can see why, though, Mark. Them. They're absolutely gorgeous. Right, I've run out of hand. Um, hang gorgeous? on a minute. Should, can I go in this direction? Yeah. So let's go red. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing. Green. Yeah, yeah. Look how beautiful each and every single one of these strands. And you can see why it's taken 18 months then. They're obviously labor intensive to mm. actually create. It is genuine quartz. Uh, those of you that have all, oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah. And this one you're about to put down is my favorite. Is so it, if I, I say the why? best or last one? It reminds me of one of my favorite gemstones, Sveen. Ah, oh, yes. It's got, that, it's got that yellow undertone flash and then the green. green. Yeah, yeah, a flash of green. Stunning. You get all of them, jewelry makers. My only wish, though, is that we had more than 150. Yeah. It might seem like loads, not for a Sunday masterclass, believe me. Um, I can see why you've championed. I mean, Mark, this piece of jewelry here, like you said, you would sell that for 200 pounds, rightfully so. I, I think you're being very conservative there, personally. Easily. I know how much time it creates yeah. to make this piece of jewelry but how cool chris you mentioned it earlier on he was like how amazing is that you know it's 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 unlike any other design necklace that i've seen mm. in a in a jewelry Just house love it. I absolutely love it. so i did this with the selenite i did the whole 10 hell the, with the harlequin mm. uh, it looks random but you just lay the 10 colors in piles and you start number one number two number three yeah. four five six seven eight nine ten one two right three, four, five, so you get a different look. Okay. So that you've got the whole 10 colors. So it looks random, but there is there is method in it. There is method. And then the necklace to the left, as you're looking at it, I've taken all of the reds and the pinks, and the, I've tried to do an ombre, and you can see the yeah, ombre the sections, pattern, yeah, you can see the little sections. And just to show you the difference between the silver and the gold, 
And then I did a station necklace on memory wire with the cool colours, incorporating the yellows and the greens. Yeah. And that's just simple little stations again. Yeah. Just, just again, completely different look. That's gorgeous. You can see the yellows glow, the yellows glowing they reflect, on the bust. don't they? Yeah. Um, we've had a message from yeah. Susie Mark. Your what's that? Alhambra oh, design you. is simply gorgeous. Lots of thank love. You. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, I've never done one before. An Alhambra. It really works. And the Alhambra is is the um, the Alhambra is the start of a kiss cross. The you know the framing around the oh, outside yes. of the beads. Um, and so you could do this with four beads or three beads or five. I always do my my kiss cross with three beads, but this is the four. And it's, it's it's the framing before you do your kiss cross. Yeah. So you just make the little sections with a pico each end. And, and using I've, the beads to actually threaded, create the chain. And then I've threaded 15 O's from station to station. Now, Mark, I think we do one more minute on our Ooh, screens. Okay. And then we open the graphics. And all I'm going to say is do not wait. Don't wait until the price point because it will probably sell out in less than a minute. And that's me guessing. It might even be less than that. We've waited 18 months for the return of the most Gosh. beautiful mermaid, mermaid courts. Um, genuine oh, no. courts, this is not created. You know, these these are not glass, they are a genuine yeah, gemstone. Yeah. You get these wonderful, if I move my hand, you can see this lovely Stone light amazing, performance. And that's here in the studio, which let's be honest, is not the best light, is it? You know, what's it gonna look like when you're outside? natural sunlight even in the winter months mm, absolutely. you know that's when you see these really this is what you need in winter own. you need a pop of color oh you do put a smile on your face because yeah. let's be honest it can be i mean it's lovely today but yeah, it can yeah. be a bit dreary and dull like yesterday evening yes <laughs> yes absolutely oh, torrential in whitney last night was it yeah yeah let's do it mark you get your sea beads i'm sorry they've been oh Oh, they're like little multicoloured bubbles. I love that soft focus look. So the people who have come in on pre-order, yeah. I think will buy another one. I think so as well. I definitely would. And and these are gem heavy pieces, Mark. So you've they're created all of these. They're massively gem heavy. Oh, really? Half the stock's gone on pre-order. I'm not surprised. Mm. I'm not surprised. And you, can, you know that Jewelry Maker will bring it to you at the best deal. You yeah. know where it's going to, don't you? Yeah, yeah 10 yeah. strands. And your seed beads. First so price crash. So the seed beads there, I had to use. So I made that little pair of earrings using the seed beads. Because <laughs> I felt I had to use Oh, them. yeah, 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 yeah. Come on now. Oh, There's that much. Pounds. I can't hold all these. That's Ten pound per strand. Oh, oh they're lovely. Yeah. I'm not just using eight of your stones. Even yeah. if we were, they're lovely. Even if we were to stop mm. here and we... Yeah. Ross is yeah. saying, you know, that would be an amazing price tag. These are genuine gemstones. They're not glass. They're not synthetic. No. They're not um, crystals. They are genuine quartz. They're not coated, yeah. so you're going to lose the colour. It's in the core. Let me let's tally up, shall we? My my jewellery. So the the one nearest to you, yeah, seventy five pound, which is Two, an amazing yeah, price. Yeah, two hundred pound for the long one. Yeah, for the Alhambra, fifty. For the what for the memory wire in front, the um the the the, the colds again maybe sixty pounds, mm -hmm. and then the memory wire bangle would be twenty five, and the beaded bracelet at the end twenty. I like that beaded bracelet. That's mm. lovely. Yeah. So are we doing a are we doing a tally? Well, no, we're adding up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let's start again. So seventy five. Seventy five. Two hundred. Plus two hundred. Sixty five. Fifty. Ten. 25, 25. 450 really? pounds that you can... My word. Okay, well, we're at 79.99. That's £8 per strand, so you beads for free. That's ridiculous. But it is not your price tag, jewelry makers. Are you ready? We are going lower. Good luck. I wish we had more. I truly do. We're already rapidly approaching three rows of names. How about... No. Seven pounds per <laughs> strand of mermaid quartz and then your seed beads for free. That's mad. That is unbelievable. It's taken us 18 months. Yeah. It's, you know, they're not glass or plastic. These are genuine quartz. I think one of your tubes of seed beads are, are delicas as well. Yeah, that I one. I think, yeah, yeah. Oh and that one God. just there. What? That's a ten of your seed beads off of oh, that. Here it is, here's Mark Ready. Yeah. Soft focus. Yeah. Ooh, I love that soft focus. Uh, lovely little bubbles. Yeah. Amazing. And generally I'm really struggling to hold all of these. There's that much. There is that much there. Have you noticed that this this kit, Mark, 
is not on split pay and normally if it was 69.99 it probably would be oh, there's okay. a reason right we were never closing at 69 pounds and 99 pence this goes yeah. to a non-split pay <laughs> price jewelry makers you get 10 price per strand easily on our screens at 10 pounds each not ordinarily i think individually how about in one minute we take it to no, five really. pounds per strand and that's your seed beads for free as well Hot. oh okay we're now down to the final third jewelry makers a hundred of these have gone there's multi buyers getting involved it will be another 18 months i should imagine I, I don't know. Yeah, it's taken a long time. Hasn't do you know it? when the next supply no, of these, if no, at all, is no, going to be? No. So it's probably going to be, and you know, we would, we wouldn't, we wouldn't not bring them to you because we know how popular they are. We wouldn't not bring them to you deliberately. Unfortunately, much of your gemstones on your screens is kind of dictated by the supply and the supplier mm, and the shipping yeah. and you know that whole process. You can't just pick up the phone and say I'll have ten, of, uh, I'll have 150 kits for Sunday morning and expect them to be here DPD the following day. It's not how it works. It takes months and months and months. We are taking it to five pound per strand with the sea beads. There it is. Oh, oh, hang on. Every time. It's so on if you include the sea beads, you're looking at four pound a strand. Yes. To be fair. Which is ridiculous. Yes. <laughs> yes, we are. Oh, yeah. no. Well done to every single one of you that has already checked out. Securing yours. We have been hinting all morning that it was going to be the most unbelievable deal, haven't we? Good luck. Look at the call screens, Mark. Oh, no, look at that. Can Chris do that softy focus thing? Softy focus. Not many cameramen do it. Oh, look Aww. at that. That's just perfection, isn't it? That's what it's all about. Ah. You can see that Sveen colour coming through, can't you? Beautiful. It is gorgeous, it is isn't stunning. it? Softy, softy. I'd like 10 strands of that one on its own, I think. That'd look amazing. And I'd go for black seed beads or gunmetal. That would be gorgeous. I'm wow. genuinely struggling to hold all of these at once. Oh That's my goodness. Ridiculous. Softy, softy, softy. I just like the, the, the choice of colours, the, um, the, the scope for ombre it's just lovely yeah. isn't it oh uh, even if you just literally threaded them with mm. a with a spacer bead in between yeah. how beautiful is that amazing these are absolutely flying out there are people multi-buying i do not know when i do not know when um the best time to get hold of them is absolutely right now yeah and you can, again if you when you get home you'll see it looks like there's the two capuchons that have sort of sandwiched that beautiful mermaid color what does the c mean in brackets well, it means coating, oh, but that would does. also mean like uh, your mystic topaz and things yes, like that. Yeah. That would uh, yeah. come under. It's not necessarily wrapped. No. Not necessarily. I um, never thought of the captions. Makes sense. Well, that's what it looks like anyway. Mm. I'm yeah. not. I'm. I'm not the expert, but uh, no. it. It. it, yeah. it. That's what it certainly looks like. Um, hello, Mandy. Hello. How are you, my lovely? So, Mandy's saying, uh, in total, I've had three of these bundles. They're oh, well so done. beautiful, and the amount you actually get is jaw dropping. Uh, oh. They will last so long. And if you're thinking, oh, that's too much colour for me, then when you start singling it out... Absolutely. It Treat each colour individually. Yeah, yeah. it tones yeah. it down. Yeah. Um, hello to you, Wiltshire, saying, uh, oh. this is my third kit of these. Second person's mm. messaging that, actually. Um, I have two of the four millimetres. Just love them. I've been so popular with stretchy bracelets. I'm oh, sure amazing. they are. Yeah. I'm sure they are. Um, another message from Amanda. Hello to you. I was happy at £100. So I've got one for free, but added another. <laughs> so much for behaving today. Whoopsie. She didn't sat on her hands, did she, at all today? Not at all. No. Not no. at all, Amanda, but never mind. <laughs> Just think how much joy it's going to bring you. Yeah, and you, must, you must let us know how the craft face go. I'll be, I'll be really yes, fascinated. Yes, because Amanda, yeah. you messaged in as well um, yesterday, didn't you, saying that you've got such a busy November, uh, November mm, that yeah. you're going to make sure you take that time yeah. to yourself to just, you know, just so you can recuperate because yeah. like i said you've got a busy job and you've also um got a business on the side as well mm. so you need that yeah. time my lovely um okay mark there are wow. so many people that have this in their baskets um 37 Gosh. left okay so if i shout out your name 
Maker in County Antrim, Jay Marie, Sandra, Marion, Beverly, Faye, Ellen, All That Glitters, Diane, uh, Julie, Berkshire, Christina, Jill, Audrey, Anonymous Maker, Claire, London, Liz, Jenny, um, Essex. If I've shouted your name, you need to check out. We've got 37. And by the way, I can see people with twos and threes in their basket as well. Um, 37 moments ago, there are multi buyers. So you've got to remember mm. if people come in and buy three, like Beverly wants, for example, it it, wow. it, it, it it does they don't they don't it's not gonna last long, absolutely. There's thirty left now. Mm. Gloria, you can do it, lovely in Mirtha Tidville. Good luck. Make sure you're checking out everyone. Make it Faye. If it's in your baskets, it's not yours. Do you know how many times I actually have this message? Oh, I had it in my basket, but um it sold out. It sold out. That's why wow. I shout about it all the time. Check out your baskets. You still only pay the one postage and packaging. That's not per item, it's per day. Nothing is debited from your account until your order is ready to be shipped. But yeah, three ninety five per day. You gotta think of what we brought you today. If you've got the advent calendar in this, mm. you know, yeah. they're quite big items. Yeah. Sorry, what did you say? 18 months. That's how long it's taken us to get this back in stock. Where does time go there, Mark? I know, Mark? I know. It doesn't it's seem amazing, like 18 months ago that this was launched. Um, okay, we're going to uh, dive into your demonstration. Anything that you have, uh, any questions that you have for Mark, do feel free to text us because we are live. What are you going to show us, Mark? So, do you remember... I need to take these bracelets I off. I love this. So, do you remember we had this bracelet on our last show? Yeah. And we've got a few more of these left. Okay. which we're going to bring to air shortly. Do you remember it was the, it was the, oh, cat's, it was the, the cat's, cat's eye, eye yes. And I said that I'd show you how to attach the embellishments, the little crosses onto yep. your bracelets. So yep. that's what I'm going to do. Fabulous, because you could do that with this, couldn't you? You can, yeah. So this is very similar technique. This is, this is, they're both right angled weaves. And this one is using your atos to make little picots. And then this is your conventional bracelet. I've got the blue vert. Can you pass me that blue bracelet on the left? Sorry, it's <coughs> short. Sure. Yeah. No problem. And I'll lay it down flat. So I've gone. Oh, that's gorgeous. So I've gone for the pinks. So this is the this is the the right angled weave bracelet in the blue. And I'm <gasps> going to I'm going to show you in in the pink. Oh, someone's asked oh. to see your memory wire bracelet right. as well. Okay. So if I pass yep. you that, yeah, yeah. No problem. I can show you this too. I love that. Look Alison in Kent. That lovely? Mark, I love your jewellery. Can you show the memory wire bracelet close up, please? No problem. Oh. That's gorgeous. Absolutely Beautiful, gorgeous. And yeah. um, oh. the cat side, by the way, that we are going to yeah. play, we'll put on pre order, but there's only 30. Okay. Right. Um, over to you. Okay. So we've done right angle weave quite a few times on the show. And as I said, I just wanted to show you how you do your your embellishments so so it works exactly the same way whether you do the um you do the pico one or mm -hmm. you do the right angled weave one okay so we'll pop the specs on so i've done my right angled weave to the length of the braces i want and then down the outside edge you will have little gaps which i've filled with two 11 o's and because I've gone for these bright, vivid pinks, I've gone for some little hematite. These are four millimeter rounds. You can use six OC beads if you want to, but I've used four millimeter rounds. I've gone for this amazing fuchsia pink galvanized. We're going back to Victoria's Secret again, aren't we? <laughs> Agent, you say it better than I do. Agent provocateur. That's the one, yeah, yeah. it reminds me of that. Okay, and I've gone for gunmetal 11s, okay? So as I said, you're going all the way down one side and then all the way down the other side filling in the gaps with two and this is what we, we do our embellishments so i started from this end i've just made some little scallops and i'll show you how to do those so we're going to sew through our uh, glass um quartz then we're going to go through the two 11 o's and we're going to exit so you can see i'm exiting through that little hemat that little gunmetal color there and we're going to pick up the following combination. We're going to pick up a pink, a gunmetal, a pink, one of our hematites, and then we're going to pick up the combination in reverse. So 11, 11, 11. So just bear in mind when you come to do these the mini combinations down here that these are these are four millimeter, not six. So you just need to to shrink this your combination size. Then we're going to go around the quartz, 
into the two gunmetal 11s. So in effect you get these little arcs on the outside. So we'll do a couple more. So we've got pink, gunmetal, pink, and then reverse. So one, two, and three. Go round the outside through the two 11 O's. Pull that through. And you can see at the moment they're scalloping all around the outside edge. So we'll just finish these last two. So one, one, one. Then your hematite. One, one, one. Round the outside through your two 11 O's. And I'll, I'm using a size 12 needle because we will be doing multiple passes and I'm using a black wildfire. So we'll just do our last one. So one, 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 then an eight. One, 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 round the outside through your two beads. Okay, I'll just talk you through the end. So what you need to do when you get to the second end is you need to do the, um, a little arc consisting of two, four, six, seven, eleven O's and then you go th back through the bead, you come up through four, and then you do a little oval. Now that little oval of C beads will take your clasp and your uh, jump okay, ring yes, at the yeah. end, okay? So you go down one side, you do your little arc, then you come down the other side. So this is the, this is the little embellishment technique that you asked for me to show you. So I'm just going to get into the right position to do the other side. So pull that through. So we're now ready to do our little cross embellishments. So we'll just go through those two 11s, there we go. So what we're going to do now is we're going to replicate the scallops down this side that we did on this side, mm -hmm. but something slightly different. So what we're going to do, we're in the right place. So we're going to pick up 11, 11 and an 11. We don't need to pick up the hematite now because it's already there. So we're going to flip it across to the middle and we're going to sew through, pull that through, just get my thumb out of the way. And you can see now it's popped it oh. into the centre of the square. And then we're going to finish off our second part of the combination. So pink, gunmetal, pink, across diagonally into the two 11 O's. And then you pull nice and tight, and you can see now that cross fits perfectly in the centre. So we'll do one more. So the first thing I do is I just flip it over so that hematite is in the centre. Pick up an 11, an 11, and an 11. Go across to the centre through the hematite. Pull that through. And again, it sits nice and neatly in the corner. And we finish off our seed bead combination. So 11, 11, and 11. And what I love about this bundle of, of the mermaid quartz is you've got so many different colors of seed beads in your stash and other gemstones that you can work alongside that um, you can have a real play around with color. Pull that through. So there you've got your, your second crisscross. So all you're going to do now is you're going to continue right down to the very end. So all of these little sections you will you will pop across mm -hmm. and do the second half of your crosses. So with the bracelet th that we had on our last show with the cat's eye, what I did is I did I did the little scallop down one side that I missed the group of blues. So I've only done the little the little crosses on the whites. So I, d I showed you how to do this bracelet, the base of it on the last show. And this is just showing you how to do the embellishments. So again, exactly the same, but because these are four mil, I've used 15 O's and an 11 O just to make a more delicate little cross all the way. So then when you get to the other end, again, you do your, your seed bead loop and then you pop on your clasp. So with this one, so this is the finished bracelet here. So can you see on the, this bracelet, I've used two 11s, then an eight, and then I've used a four millimeter glass quartz yeah. by cone oh, in yeah. the centre. Oh, yes. So exactly the same way. So you do your scallops as we've got down here and then you bring the scallop into the centre. You do your little connections all the way down so you get your crosses and then you can see on here 
I've popped on a couple of jump rings with your toggle to finish. Exactly the same, but just you can see the hot and the cold colours. Beautiful, Mark. Amazing. So what I'm going to do for... Never would I have seen that. Flipped across. Turn to that. No, it's really clever, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, no, really, really clever. Cool. Really Talking good. Victoria's Secrets, that's like a corset. It is, yeah. There you go. Mrs. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. um, now, this kit, extremely limited. I just wanted to show you the core screens, oh, everybody. That? So, right. have they sold out? Okay. Okay, oh. I'll come back to it. I'll show you in a second because I've got to bring the cat's eye courts on here um, because there's only 30 of these. Oops. Only there 30 available. Now, courts can produce a phenomenal effect, which is what is known as, oh, ca yes. as cat's eye. Um, so if I just show you, actually on the one strand here. That's an amazing that chatoyancy. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, the phenomena occurs naturally within the gemstone. There's no way of creating movement. No, no. You know, internally or, or man-made. Um, this is all Mother Nature's doing. So um, you've got beautiful colours in your cat's eye courts. We were saying, Mark, I think it was last week, wasn't it, Roscoe? Monday, yeah. Monday, yeah. yeah. When we launched this, um, we were saying that cat's eye courts we've seen before once or twice, and but it's only ever been like a dark grey. That's right. Sort of an olive, like, it's like an olive colour, like yeah. an olive grey colour. There is Quite moody. Thing. Yeah. A bit yeah, moody yeah. and broody. Um, is that the right word to describe it? Moody and broody. Broody. Yeah, that's a good word. Broody, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so um, whereas this is cheerful, uplifting. <laughs> oh, brooding. 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 <laughs> <laughs> you might be broody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, brooding, not broody. Yeah. Um, but yes, whereas this is, you know, cheerful, positive, joyful, cool, absolutely. Yes. And it has that magic. Can we just show your beautiful yeah, jewelry yeah, yes, with this? Because yeah. honestly, these so are this unbelievable. The, so this is the, the bracelet. This is going to be known as the bracelet, isn't it? I think. Yes. So this is the first piece I made, which was this netted cuff. Now, That's this amazing. Using, this was using one strand. And then I've gone to the Halloween I bracelet. I do like the Halloween it. one. I think I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm struggling to choose my favourite yeah. here. It's amazing. And, and I then, love this um, one. So this is a macrame triple rose shambhala. Yeah. In, in the kit, you get a mixed strand of all different colours. Yes. So again, this is just random. And then we've got the, the little blue and white that, that I just showed you with the demo. Yep. And then this is, again, this is a similar sort of bracelet. Can you see the crosses going down the yeah. centre? Again. And then what I've done off the mixed strand, I love this, is you get so many different colours that I've taken all of the browns, the greys. It's like a Botswana agate, isn't it? Yes. And again, these are all your cat's eyes. So I've, I've done a simple uh, one for the gents, I think. So I don't, I, you know, why can't gents wear memory wire? That's Absolutely. The and then I took all of the hot colours. That's gorgeous, that makes And again, you, I had to do a kiss cross. So I've done a kiss cross station here because it's more delicate. So I've taken, can you see the ombre? So you've got the dark in the centre and then you work out to that pale lemon. Lemoncello yellow, isn't Ooh, it? Oh, lemoncello lovely. yellow. Yeah. <laughs> Yummy. And again, with 15 O's, just separating all of the little stations. But every single bead, you get that absolutely beautiful look from. And then just to finish, I made simple spiral earrings, which I did the week before as a necklace demo. And you've just got this amazing necklace. Look at the blues, aren't they beautiful? They're stunning. And that almost, especially the, the, yeah. the that spiral design, because yeah. they, they move. Um, yeah, it works almost like yeah. it's it's gliding yeah. down. Forty nine ninety nine jewelry makers. You get ten strands. Ten strands again. Um, yeah. Again, you've beautiful. had your your courts of the masterclass kit, but mm. this is your cat's eye court. So they'd work perfectly yeah, together, together, wouldn't it's they? Just, it's just amazing. No, I love them together. So beautiful. <sighs> Now Monday, look, I can't, oh, I can't yes. remember what I did yesterday, let alone Monday. <laughs> Genuinely, I don't know sometimes. Yeah. I don't know my name sometimes. You know, you wake up mm. and you've got that. I can't remember what we took this to, but apparently we didn't close here. Mm. Do you remember? I think I do, I think I do, <laughs> I think I do. 60 seconds we're taking it there, but can I just tell you, there is Devon, Meath, Kim, Ruby, Vivian, Elaine, Maker, Oxfordshire, Hilda, Florence, Janice. Oh, I can't keep up with you. New customers getting involved. There's only 30 available. So if you weren't able to tune in on Monday show, these are four mil though these as well, are four aren't mil. they? Yeah, yeah. So maybe you prefer the four mil. Yeah, so you can Kumahimo with four mil. You can, yes. Obviously you could do micro kiss cross. You can do all that nice. sort of thing as well. And again, so same as what, oh, that's so, I mm. love this bracelet. Yeah. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? Look at that. Yeah. 
amazing. It's I mean, just, it's just every tell me you wouldn't. Bead. How yeah. much would that be if you were to sell it? Uh, I would probably sell that for seventy-five pounds. Yeah, it took me away. about it took me about three hours to make. I'm not surprised. Um, so you need to in, you need to incorporate that as well. Looks but like the planet. It's just lovely. Yes, actually. Yeah. Looks like the planet. Like You've got Saturn, Mars in there, Saturn, yeah, Saturn in there. Yeah. Um, we're going low. You get all ten it's strands. Beautiful. Four millimeter cat's yeah. eye rounds. That's gorgeous. Thirty yeah, four. Yeah. That's, that's three. Right. That's three pound yeah. fifty it's each, crazy, isn't, it? isn't it? Three pound yeah. fifty. We're desperate. I've asked Wayne to try and source six and eight mil, but he's finding it really difficult. I bet. It doesn't come in large sizes. Yeah, I bet. But and you want still, the chatoyancy to reach oh, all every the way up. Yeah, like, yeah. Every single bead as well. So we won't make compromises there, yeah. will we? Not on quality. No, no. Um, there's uh, lots of you getting involved. Wow. These are going to sell out today, Julie May, because I can tell you, we are s massively over allocated. Mm. What did you say? Much more so. limited than the mermaid. We had 30 of these. So Devon, Hilda, Meath, Maker, Kim, Ruby, Elaine, Vivian, Catherine, Jacqueline, Judith, Marion, Holland, Julie, Helen, William. You've done it. I've also got Merseyside, Mary, Lynette, Morgan. You've just done it. Well done. I can't keep up with you now. <coughs> Florence, Oxfordshire, Maker in Lanarkshire, Amelia, Stephanie, Carol, Eileen, Diane, Beverly, Maker in London, Lynn, Gloria. I can't keep up. We're over allocated. Let's just leave it at that. There's 10 well left. Well done. 10 of these left. These are, they're in four mils and I love four mils. You can do a multitude of well. four no, mils. I love four mils. Why not use these yeah. with it? With it, alongside. Because they, they, they match perfectly. Perfect, really perfect, do. perfect. My goodness yeah. me, it's been a fun show, hasn't it? It's been ace. Start to finish, we've had jewellery <laughs> boxes, advent calendars, amazing kits, Kuma Hemo. There are... Oh, oh. Oh. Not art, there is. Yeah, you're right. Is. They've gone. Sold. Oh, no. Right. Gone. Quick recap oh on the no. mermaid. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Okay. I've Can I that. pop that there for a second? Yeah. Okay, um, so that's all this. Hang on, I've put it under here. Can I borrow that tea bar actually, yes. Mark? Yeah. That would be oh, far yes. easier. Oh, yeah, that would be much easier, yeah. <laughs> because... They look beautiful. For me to, yeah, for me to hold 10 strands, isn't that easy? I can These tell you are that. These absolutely, I mean, we, you think they look good in the studio, you get them in sunlight. Well, yeah. you saw that video, didn't you? Yeah, they look gorgeous. Did, did, you, did I tell you how many views that? Um, did I mention it? 10.6 thousand. Uh, sorry? 10.6 yeah. thousand, so yeah. I'd be happy with a six. <laughs> Uh, yeah, seriously, Mark. Mm. I'm not surprised though. Beautiful jewellery. You're such a talent, and then uh, I'm working with components yeah, like this. Yeah. Sorry, I've got to move that there. So I'm that just that section there. Look like, how beautiful that ombre is. It's amazing. Yeah. These are absolutely gorgeous. So you get the ten strands yeah. of your mermaid quartz, plus you're also getting your extra seed beads as well. Um, one of which is a delica, One's really a delica. pretty colour actually. Yeah, topaz. Uh, yeah. yeah, dark topaz lined chartreuse, mm, maybe. Shuttles. Um, all of those for forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. What's the update? Quantity ooh, is ooh. live as we speak. Fourteen. No. Well, How no. many did we have? One hundred and fifty. We will hold it on screen for one final minute. Take a look That's at that. That's amazing. Well done. Oh. If your name is this side of the screen, that's not yet checked out. If your name is that side of the screen, sit back and enjoy. It's on its way. Well done to you. You can see the oh, multipliers. Yeah. You can see you disappear. You scroll down, you scroll down, you scroll down. There's tons and tons and tons oh, of you amazing. there. We only had a hit uh, 150. 12 of them live as we speak. 11. We'll hold it on screen for another 33 uh, seconds and then we'll obviously have to move on. Jewelry mm. makers, absolutely amazing. And I love these. Well. All, whatever time of the year, you know, you could mm. tone them down like that, couldn't you? Yeah, yeah absolutely. You have yeah. different colour palettes. Yep. Can you um, just humour me for 30 seconds? Just Always. have to take the Alhambra off the bust sure. and just to show the length the over the head. I love this. This is gorgeous, yeah. and it's the first time you've done it. I've not, I've not done an Alhambra of any description before. I love yours. Yeah. Yeah, which great, they use they? gold, don't they? And they also use the beaded yes. technique, so it really works. Yes, yeah, just straight over the head. Yeah. So that's using the coals, but you could. I didn't have enough beads, or I could have replicated the um, with the pinks and the reds. Wow. It ever so nice. Yeah. That's gorgeous. Um, okay, between now and. Oh, no. That's lovely. Uh, now and the top of the show, we have got time to. 
I've just been given a bracelet. Oh. Twisted knot. Twisted knot oh. bracelet. Oh, this is very nice. <gasps> and you've got a matching necklace. Oh, that's pretty. Can I borrow that cushion? You can. Perfect gift, because we have got uh, the matching. Oh, look. Oh, look at this. This is a chainmail technique, is it? It looks a bit body. like it. Oh, it is, yes. That's gorgeous. Very, very stylish. One for the gents, I think. Yeah, definitely. You've got your yeah. cast just there. You can see the wonderful twisted links as well. Um, and then these sections here, solid bars. Oh, yes. Can you see they're not oh, they're little individual? Like, like chain. Yeah, so if, maybe if I should take that off there. It is actually solid Ooh, bars. I'd dismantle this and... Would do you? Lots of nice things with it. You always dismantle, I don't love you? It. I, I like good value for money. <laughs> I like value for money. Yeah. Dismantle it. Right. You mean, yeah, why not? You could use yeah, them as individual components. Definitely. We have got the matching necklace as well. £19.99 wow. only to get hold of this. Not your prize. Perfect Christmas gift, says Roscoe. Yeah, I can see that. Look how pretty that is. Secret Santa gifts? No. I love this. It's almost like an uh, um, yeah. unwritten rule, isn't it? When we say Santa's, uh, Santa's secret, or secret Santa, Santa's secret. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> See, <laughs> like Victoria, only yeah. uh, Santa, well. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in a catwalk. Amazing. No. <laughs> Like uh, Secret Santa, it's kind of a given that it's going to be under yeah. £10. Pounds. Yeah. How amazing. Already oh, lots. It's pretty, isn't it? So I'm assuming because they're sterling, you can mould those bars yeah, into you could curves, curve it. couldn't you, to curve That's it? That's a good idea. Make a couple of rings and all sorts out of this. And in fact, oh, I probably that. would do that, actually. Yes. I probably would curve it. Get a mandrel mm. yeah. and just curve. Yeah. Nice idea. Now, we will load the necklace on the web as well. So if you wanted to get both of them, I'll hold oh. it quickly up, shall I? Hold it quickly up to the decolletage. It's on the website. And we will, of course, bring it to you. The wow, most unbelievable. Yeah, big investment of sterling silver in this one. £20 for this. Amazing. So you can get the both, the, the suite, for £30. Um, unbelievable. Wow. Mark, when are you back? I'm back with you Thursday. And it's all about chalcedony. Love it. Which I've never used before. I've never it's had. Gorgeous chalcedony. Beautiful. The most amazing dreamy. drops. Dreamy. Beautiful drops. Oh, lovely. really? Yeah. yeah. I always think chalcedony is quite a dreamy stone. And then we've got a strand, in the nine o'clock, we've got a strand of labradorite, the like you've never seen. Oh, I'm excited. That's I'm wonderful. excited. Yeah. Um, thank you for joining us today. It's been absolutely amazing. Um, grab hold of your, mm. your uh, advent calendar and I'll see you back on Wednesday morning, mm. everybody. Happy Bye -bye. Sunday. Thank you. Bless you.